Today, we're playing Built to Survive in Minecraft. Wait, what's Built to Survive? In a few minutes, a bunch of super scary monsters are gonna come through that gate, and we each have to build defenses to survive. Oh, gosh, well, we better get to building. Uh, here, Speaker Roman, why don't you come live with me on my plot? And uh, what? No, guys, come on. We each have our own little plot that we have to build on. That's cheating. Yeah, I didn't really want to build with you anyways. Uh, what? Why not? You're my girlfriend. Uh, I am not your girlfriend. And uh, Yeah, dude, I don't think she likes you very much. But guys, come on. We gotta start building quick. We only have a few minutes before the first round of mob spawn. Oh, no, that's not enough time for me to finish my mansion. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I'm not sure if we're gonna have time for a mansion. We just gotta build, like, a super simple defense that'll stop the mob. So here we go. I'm just gonna build myself, like, a little box that I can live inside of. Stop copying me, guys. What? Copying you? What do you mean copying? My house is so much nicer than yours. Wait, no, wait. Mine looks so much better than yours. And, oh, gosh, wait. You have windows. Hold on. I need to add windows to mine as well. Let me go ahead and grab some of this stained glass really quick. And boom, I'm just gonna replace the entire front of my house with stained glass. Hey, you're stealing my glass idea. Stop it. And what? No, you did not invent glass, okay? This is a 100% original idea, all right? Uh, yeah, but it was my idea to build from glass. You're stealing it. Stop it. Hey, he's not stealing it. He's merely using it, okay? And yeah, dude, come on. She's right. It's not like you own glass or anything. Uh, no, but this design is all mine, and you're just stealing it because it, you know that it's better. And oh my gosh, no. My design is so much different from yours. My house is so much nicer. Yours looks like, I don't even know what that is. You have, like, spikes sticking out the side. Mm -hmm. And uh, wait a minute. Guys, do you see that? Uh, guys, I think we need to hurry up our builds fast. And, oh, Gosh, yeah, we don't have much time left. Come on, come on here. Everyone, go ahead and finish up your build. And here, everyone, go inside of your build because it's going to turn us into survival mode. And then we're not going to be able to do anything. Oh, no, I need to finish up fast. And, uh, wait, guys, I think time ran out. I just got put into survival. Oh, gosh. Oh, this should be fine. My house is super strong. And, uh, dude, I don't know about that. Your house doesn't even have a roof. Like, mine at least has, like, half of a roof. Oh, no, guys, I think that's the first wave of mobs. And, uh, wait, what the? Wait, there's toilets everywhere. Oh, gosh, wait, what the? Are they jumping? Oh, no, they got it. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, everyone be super careful. Well, I should be fine since I have all of this glass here, and I don't think they can even get through this. Let's go. Help, they broke through my door. And what? Oh, gosh, why did you put a door? And wait, why is one of them jumping? Oh, gosh, uh, wait. Speaker one here, try coming into my house here. Let me go ahead and make a little entrance for you. Help, there's so many. And, uh, wait, they're on me as well. Run, run, run. Oh, well, guys, there's plenty of room in my house. Okay, let me in. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, yeah, I'm running towards you. Come on, come on. And what in the world? Why are some of the toilets just jumping everywhere? That is actually crazy. And uh, what? They're dropping TNT. Now, what is going on? Ah oh, no, my house has been compromised. Uh, wait, what in the world? Guys, they're mining into my house. My house has been compromised as well. What in the world are we supposed to do? I don't know. These toilets are too strong for us. And wait, guys, look. I think we only need to survive 10 more seconds. And, oh, my gosh. Okay, everyone, just survive for 10 more seconds, and then we should be good, and it'll put us back into creative. Come on. Oh, all right, we got this, guys. Come on. And oh my gosh, let's go. We made it. We're in creative mode now. Oh, thank goodness. Oh my gosh, that was a pretty crazy round. Of, oh, okay, they're all gone perfect, but what in the world was that? Oh my gosh, what the heck were those? They were like skibbity toys that blew up. And yeah, what in the world were those? I didn't know they could like put down TNT, and some of them were even breaking into my house. Look at what they did. And they completely destroyed the front of my house. And oh my gosh, yeah, whoa, your house took a lot of damage, but guys, we gotta upgrade our defenses. There isn't much time until the next wave spawns. Yeah, I don't know what I want to do to my house, though. And oh gosh, yeah, wait, okay, I think the first thing I'm probably gonna do is upgrade all of the blocks that I'm using. This purple wool is not strong enough. They were literally cutting holes into my house. They made my house look like Swiss cheese. Oh yeah, maybe I should upgrade my blocks as well. Uh, let's see, reinforced red terracotta sounds good. Oh yeah, okay, that's a good idea here. I'm gonna go ahead and use a bunch of obsidian because it's like the strongest block. And there's no way that any of the mobs will be able to break through this. Yeah, I think you're right. I'm gonna use obsidian for mine too. All right, and wait a minute, guys, we should all definitely add a roof to our house. Some of those toilets were literally jumping. I don't even know that they could do that. They were literally like jumping over Speaker Woman's walls. Uh, so we should definitely add a roof. Yeah, you're right. I was super surprised when they just came in. And yeah, I didn't even know they could do stuff like that. But yeah, here, let's just go ahead and add a roof. I'm going to make mine all out of obsidian just to ensure they can't break in. Uh, Speaker Woman, did you see my house? I made it just for you. Uh, yeah, it was okay, I guess. Okay, it was more than okay. And plus, I made it just for you. You could, you know, show a little appreciation. Why do I need to show appreciation? I didn't ask you to do that. And, uh, wait a minute. Yeah, dude, your house doesn't even look that nice. Like, there's literally spikes sticking out the sides. I don't even know what this thing is. This is a masterpiece. You'll see when it's done. Uh, okay, whatever. I'm just gonna go ahead and finish building my walls out of obsidian. I don't need my house to be, like, a crazy masterpiece or anything. I just need it to help defend me from those toilets. Yeah, I can't let the toilets get inside my house again. All right, and here, let me go ahead and finish placing a few more obsidian. And boom, there we go. My entire house is 
is made out of obsidian. Wait, speaker one, what's your house looking like? And <gasps> whoa, wait, yours is made out of obsidian as well. And oh my gosh, iron doors. That is a great idea. Yeah, that way if I get locked outside, I could come back in. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's a great idea here. I'm going to go ahead and do that as well. Except instead of iron doors, <gasps> I'm going to go ahead and put some of these keypad doors. Let's go. And then with these, I can pretty much set up whatever passcode I want. So I'm just going to set it to uh, one, three, four, five. And then whenever I enter that code into the door, it'll open up. Let's go. Oh, come on, guys. We can't slow down. The waves are going to be coming faster. We can't slow down now. And oh gosh, yeah, you're right, guys. Come on. We just got to keep moving really fast. Let me just go ahead and finish my roof. And then my house should be complete. Uh, wait, guys. I think that's the next wave. And, oh gosh, wait. They're going to break out in 10 seconds. Wait, they're already breaking out. Everyone be careful. We're about to go into survival mode. And oh gosh, wait. Why are they breaking out so early? Oh, no. They're coming. Oh my gosh, guys. Be careful. And oh no, we just all went to survival. And oh gosh. All right. It's time, guys. Here we go. Let's see if our houses can withstand these mobs. And oh gosh, wait, why is this one looking at me like that? Hopefully he doesn't jump up on me or anything and... <gasps> Let's go! My house looks like it's defending from it pretty well. It doesn't even know how to get in. Look, my glass isn't even breaking or anything. Oh, yeah, and my house is not even getting touched. Yeah, my house is doing fine. I knew I did a better job this time. And, uh, wait a minute, guys. There's, like, an awful lot of them on my house. Why are they all targeting my house right now? Uh, I don't think this is very fair. Well, I have one right outside my house, and he looks so scary. Uh, you think one is scary? I've got, like, 10 million! What in the world is this? I think they're attracted to your smell, and Jesus, you smell bad. I, when was the last time you showered? Uh, what? Dude, I do not smell bad. I, obviously, the reason they're coming towards me is because my house is the closest one to their gate. Okay, that's probably why. Not because I smell bad. Because I don't smell bad. Okay, I smell great. What do you mean? Body odor smells horrible. And wait, I think you have a leak. And, uh, wait, a leak? What are you talking about? And oh, wait, what? They broke through my glass. What in the world? No, watch out. Be careful. And, oh, wait, what? They're coming up to my roof. Oh, gosh. Oh, God. I gotta evacuate. I'm speaking woman. Let me in your house. Oh, use the levers. Careful with the zombie, though. All right, all right. I'm coming in here. How do I close the door? It's not closing. And now, wait, what? One of them spotted TNT. Watch out. Oh, no, they broke the doors. Oh, uh, wait, what in the world is going on? Why didn't your doors work? I tried closing them, but it didn't close. I don't know, but I Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, we just gotta hit them. I don't know what else to do. And, oh, my gosh, they're doing so much damage. I'm out of here. Oh, no, you're gonna leave me alone? And, oh, gosh, wait, what? Why are there so many now? What? They're spreading in more TNT. Uh, okay, here, I guess I can try to help you. Uh, let me try bridging you out from over here. I'll try digging, like, a secret tunnel. Okay, hurry up. There's a lot of them. All right, all right, here, let me go ahead and cover myself up over there so they don't come in. And, okay, here, I'm digging in. I'm digging in. All right, all right, there you go. And, ah, wait, there's more TNT. All right, here, follow me. Oh, my gosh, there's literally toilets everywhere. Just go. Ah! Oh, gosh, yeah, we just gotta make a run for it here. I'm gonna go ahead and block off their hole. And, oh, gosh, it's too late. They already escaped. I'm speaker, man. Can we go in your house? Uh, what's going on? And, oh, you're still struggling with the toilets? Uh, I mean, if you can find a way in my house, you can come in. Wait, what? How do they not breach your house at all? That's because I built the best house. Oh, gosh, we gotta find a way in. And, oh, gosh, yeah, wait, here, I have some of this obsidian here. Uh, Go ahead and take half of that in here. Let's just bridge up. Go, go, go. The toilets are coming. And okay, we made it, Speaker Man. Uh, how's it going? Oh, it's going good. I've been standing up here. This space is like in impenetrable. Oh my gosh. How the heck did your house made out of these reinforced red blocks survive against our houses made out of obsidian? Because I'm better. What? You don't even have a door in your house. Yeah, exactly. So they have no way to get in. Yeah, but you have no way to get in or out either. And uh, yeah, wait, did you think about that? Well, there's no reason to. Uh, well, what if you like fall off? Oh, what the heck? Why did you knock me off? And, hey, I was just trying to prove a point, but uh, I mean, you don't have a door, so you can't really get back in now. All right, that's it. I'm blowing up your house house next round. And, uh, whoa, 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 no, 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 come on, come on, don't blow up my house. I mean, you literally can't spin out of obsidian. You don't know how strong I am, do you? Oh, gosh, and wait, what in the world? The toilets are spawning in more TNT. Is this round almost over yet? And, okay, round two ending in 10 seconds. Let's go. Oh, thank goodness. I have to fix my house. Yeah, I've had enough with that round. That was pretty crazy. And wait, is the round over yet? It's been more than 10 seconds. And oh, there we go. I'm in creative mode now. Let's go. Oof, that was a pretty intense round, but I'm gonna go fix my house. Oh, yeah, I need to do something before I fix my house. I just got to, you know, come and over hey, here and get rid of the cold doing? water. Hey, oh, my God. Dude, come on. Why did you have to do that? This is what you get for knocking me off my house. You don't hey, get one. Stop, stop, stop. I was just trying to prove a point, okay? It's, it's nothing, okay? Come on. And I'm proving a point saying that my house is better. And, hey, stop, stop. Do you really have to break my entire house? Come on, come on, come on. I literally can't even stop you right now. You're in creative mode. Stop. Yep. All right. You don't get a house anymore. And I feel like that's good enough. There you go. Good luck. And, oh, my gosh. What? In the you literally just destroyed my entire house. All of that progress I made. Why? You didn't have any progress because they just broke straight through, remember? Oh, my gosh. What in the world? All right. Well, I guess since you broke my house, I got to come up with a new design. Let me think. What could I do? And, oh, I've got a really good idea. Okay, hold on. I need to go ahead and rebuild all of my walls. I'm just going to keep building them out of obsidian. And wait here. I'm going to make it a little bit smaller 
than last time. You'll see what I'm going to do. This is going to be really nice looking. Wait, what are you going to make? Oh, you'll see. It's going to be very OP. And there's literally no way any of the mobs are going to get through this. Oh, I'm excited to see what you make. Yeah, I can't wait to see it fail whenever the toilets come. What, dude? It's not going to fail. It's actually a 10,000 IQ move right here. You'll see when I finish building it, all right? You're probably going to copy it because it's so good. Oh, yeah. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, just give me a few minutes, all right? I just got to finish building the walls. And then I can go ahead and start building the next thing. And then, yeah, it's going to be a very epic. You'll see. And oh, my gosh. That TNT that the toilets were dropping is actually so annoying. I have to go ahead and rebuild my floor now, but wait a minute. Hold on. I'm going to build it out of obsidian just to make sure that they can't try digging underneath my house either. Oh, that's so smart, Dash. What? I thought about that first. And uh, wait, what? No, you didn't. This was my idea. No, I thought about it first. I already have it made. Uh, yeah, so do I. No, like I had it made last round. And what? No, you don't. Your floor is literally made out of grass. What are you talking about? Uh, it's hidden. You just can't see it. Uh, I don't believe you, but here, I got to go ahead and finish building my house. It's going to be so epic looking when it's done. And here, I'm just going to tell you guys what I was about to build. I'm going to build some archer towers and they're going to absolutely destroy any mobs that come my way. Oh, that's such a great idea. I mean, it's all right. Uh, do you have any better ideas? Yeah, it's called not build whatever you're building. Oh my gosh, dude. No, the archer towers are going to work. Okay, it's a great idea here. Let me just go ahead and put some of this fence around here so that my archers don't fall off. And uh, wait a minute. What am I even going to use for archers? I can't use skeletons because those are probably going to like start shooting me. <gasps> wait a minute. What if I become the archer? Let me go ahead and grab some ladders really quick and I'm just going to go ahead and put them right over here. Hold on. Actually, let me go ahead and make a little platform over here. And then I can go ahead and put some stairs over here. And boom, there we go. One archer tower done. Now I just got to go ahead and finish up this one. And boom, there we go. My archer towers are done. But hold on. I need to go ahead and find a bow. Let me see. And <gasps> whoa, guys, we have so many cool bows. Uh, I think I'm going to go with this electric bow. This thing looks super powerful. Well, I'm working on a super secret thing that's going to totally blow your mind. And wait, what, what are you building? It's a moat. Whoa, wait, yeah, that actually is a pretty good idea. But <gasps> wait. Wait, speaker wood. You should replace the water with lava. That way, if any of the toilets fall in, they're just gonna burn. <gasps> That's a great idea. I mean, it's all right, but still, you gotta get something way better if you actually, you know, want to survive. And wait, what even are you doing? You're building like a whole skyscraper. What? Is, do you have two floors already? Yeah, they can't reach you if you're too high up. Uh, I mean, I guess that kind of works, but unless they're like a flying mob or something, what if one of the mobs start flying? Well, then I'll still be fine because I'm making a roof right now. Yeah, but then they're just gonna blow up your tower. You see, I've got my archer towers over here, so I can just shoot whatever flying mob comes my way. I mean, they can try and fly on me, but I don't think they're going to survive. Yeah, 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 whatever you say. And oh, wait a minute, guys. I'm going to go ahead and add some electric fence around my house as well. This is going to be sure to help out stop any of the toilets. There's no way they're getting past this. Well, I wonder what the next round's going to be. I wonder if it's going to be like some crazy OP toilet or something. Oh, uh, guys, those are not toilets. That's Titan Cameraman. And, uh, wait, what? Titan Camera? What in the world is he doing here? I don't know, but he's definitely going to destroy our builds. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, everyone, be careful. Uh, I don't know how much time we have left. Oh, wait, I think that answers our question. Oh, gosh, guys, we only have 10 seconds left. Everyone get ready. I'm heading to my archer towers. I'm heading inside. And wait, what did you do to your moat? Whoa, wait, did you put like water on the top and then lava at the bottom? Exactly. So when they walk on the water, they'll sink down into the lava and die. And guys, it's enough talking. They're out. And, oh, gosh. All right, it's time to fight here. Everyone go, go, go. Be careful. Uh, wait, what? Wait, they can shoot. Oh, gosh, be careful. Oh, uh, they're like shooting laser rays at my house. What in the world? Oh, yeah, your archer tower is totally working. Uh, well, they would work if I could actually go out and use it. Look, they're like attacking me. What in the world is this? Oh, no, I don't know. They're super OP. And wait a minute. It looks like they're shooting at your house now, speaker man. <laughs> oh, yeah, but I have bulletproof windows and bulletproof walls, so I'm fine. And, oh, wait. It looks like one of them just died over here. Okay, perfect. Uh, let me go up here, over here and try taking some shots at them with my electric boat. Come on, come on. And Okay, there we go. I just got one. Now let me go ahead and take some cover. And oh, my gosh, these things are so terrifying. My house seems to be doing good so far. They're focused on you guys. And, oh, wait. One of them just hit me again. These guys do so much damage. If I take one more hit, then I'm gone for it. Come on, guys. Be careful. Don't let them hit you. Uh, I can't believe you guys are struggling with this. I'm just laid back in my house. Hey, I'm not struggling either. And yeah, wait, guys. I think I'm the only one struggling because I'm like the only one who's actually trying to fight them. Can you guys like help so we can get this over with quicker? No, we don't have to kill them. We just gotta survive, right? Uh, wait a minute, guys. Do you see that? It says round modifier, no despawn. Wait, what does that mean? Oh, no. That means we actually have to take them out. And oh my gosh. Wait, we actually have to fight these guys. We're not just gonna despawn like earlier. Okay, well, what are we waiting for, guys? Uh, I guess we better get the fighting, but I'm literally a one heart. How is this gonna work? Wait, guys, we just need to lure them into my trap. That'll be the best way to get rid of them. And, oh my gosh. Yeah, you're right, because you got that lava trap, but uh, I don't really want to go out there. Like, they're literally shooting at my house right now. This is very terrifying. All right, well, I got this, guys. Just everyone follow me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Wait, wait, wait. You're just gonna run like that? And uh, wait, dude, I don't think they even care about you. They're all distracted on me. Well, that means I can't do anything. You're gonna have to do it. And, oh gosh, I really have to run. Uh, okay, here, speaker one. I'll start running over to your house. Is the door 
open, though? I just want to run in as quick as possible. I don't want to wait for the door to open or anything. Okay, open up the door. Come on, come on, hurry. And Oh, gosh. All right, well, what am I waiting for? I'm running. Go, go, go. Come on. Come here, you stupid the Titan cameraman. What are you guys doing? Hey, hold on. I'm going to try pushing him in. Come on. Let's go. This is actually working. And they're not even attacking me because they're distracted on you guys. <laughs> Let's go. But, uh, wait, speaker woman. Your trap is not working. They're floating on the water. What? Oh, no. I didn't know they could swim. Oh, my gosh. This trap didn't even work. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, what? This trap is horrible here. I'm just going to keep shooting them with my electric bow. It looks like they're still distracted on you guys, so there should actually be no problem. And there we go. I finally got one, but it looks like there's still a lot of them left. Oh, gosh. Come on. You can do this. Come on. Hit them. I'm trying. They have so much health, though. If only this trap would actually work, that would actually save so much time right now. Wait. Maybe I can drain the water. I saw some sponges when I was back in creative. And, whoa. Wait. You do? Okay. Yeah. Here. Try doing it. And, whoa. Wait, that worked so perfectly. Oh, let's go. That worked. But wait, we need to do that on the rest of them. And uh, yeah, but wait a minute. It looks like they're targeting you guys right now. Here, wait, speaker one. Hand me over the sponges. I'll go do it. Okay, come on. Here you go. And oh, wait, wait. Hold on. They're falling in the lava. And oh, there we go. I got it. All right, here. I'm going to go around over here. And let me just push all of them into the water real quick, just like that. And boom. Wait, it didn't work. Hold on. I need to put it inside of the water. And there we go. Let's go. Uh, wait, speaker one. The water uh, filled up again. Do you have any more sponges? I need more. Come on, I threw them over here. Get okay, them. perfect, perfect. Here, I got them. Come on, come on. Let me just go ahead and push all of these guys into the water really quick. Come on. And let me go ahead and drain it. And boom, there we go. Let's go. They're burning in the lava. Phew, that was a close one. I was on half a heart. And, oh my gosh. Yeah, that was pretty stressful. Good thing they were targeting you guys there and not me. Yeah, that was really scary. But my trap didn't really work as planned. And yeah, wait, I told you, you should have just replaced all of the water with lava. That would have been so much better, right? Yeah, I'll do that next time. Well, guys, we don't know how much time we have left until the next round. We gotta keep upgrading our houses. And, oh gosh, yeah, you're right. All right, here, everyone, let's go. We're back in creative. Let's go ahead and upgrade our houses and... <gasps> Okay, guys, I think the first thing I'm going to do is automate my archer towers over here. Well, how are you going to do that? Well, you know how before I would actually have to, like, walk up here and, like, shoot this bow myself? Well, that is way too dangerous because, uh, you know, like, they could just shoot back at me. So what if I use one of these automatic sentry turret things? Whoa, that sounds like a great idea. Wait, a sentry turret? What's that? Oh, well, pretty much here. Let me go ahead and activate it over here really quick. Pretty much whenever a mob spawns nearby, it's just going to start automatically shooting at it. And here, I'm just going to go ahead and put two of them right over here in front of my door. There we go. Oh, uh, well, I'm gonna make an armory in this layer of my base. And whoa, wait, you're making an armory? Hold on. That is actually a great idea. I should probably do that as well. Yeah, me too. You guys are always copying me. What, dude? It's not copying. You did not invent the idea of an armory, but hold on. I need to go ahead and test out my sentry turrets. Let me go ahead and spawn in a zombie villager guy over here. And Oh my gosh, these things are working so well. Okay, yeah, these are actually perfect. And I'm gonna make a second layer for my armory. Okay, yeah, that is a great idea. You know, I've got a bunch of room down over here. I think I'm just gonna build mine over here, so let me go ahead and grab some armor stands really quick. And let me go ahead and put that down over there. I, in fact, I'm going to go ahead and put down two just for like backup armor. And let me see. What type of armor is everyone going with? I'm going for the crystal hide stuff. Wait, crystal hide. What in the world is that? And whoa, wait, this stuff looks super awesome. Okay, hold on. Let me scroll down. I want to see what type of armor I can get. Whoa, look, there's Nyan Cat armor. I'm definitely going to use that. And whoa, wait, Nyan Cat armor. Wait, the chest plate looks like a cookie. This will definitely keep away the mobs. Wait, keep them away. That's going to draw them in more. They're going to try and eat you. And, oh, yeah, right. They're going to think you're a cookie. Cookie. No, you guys are wrong. Maybe a muffin. And anyways, all right, let me see what type of armor I should go for. And whoa, wait, guys, I think I'm going to go with the advanced combat armor. This stuff looks super awesome. Whoa, you're right. That looks so cool. Yeah, all right, here, let me go ahead and grab a full set of this really quick. And let me just go ahead and put this all on the armor stands really quick. And whoa, this stuff actually looks so epic. There's no way I'm taking any damage to those mobs. Uh, yeah, but guys, we also need weapons. And oh, yeah, you're right. Uh, I should probably upgrade my weapon from this electric bow. It's not that good. Oh, my gosh, there's lights. And oh, wait, you're going with a lightsaber? Oh my gosh, I can see your armor stand with the cookie armor. That actually looks so funny. It's not cookie armor, it's Neon Cat. Uh, well, it sure looks like cookies, but whatever. Oh, I'm gonna use the power hammer as my weapon. It looks so cool. And wait, the power hammer? What in the world is that? Hold on, let me go ahead and find it really quick. And whoa, wait, what the? Wait, this thing looks super cool. Yeah, it's like a punch, but more powerful. Ooh. What the? Yeah, this thing is awesome. All right, well, hold on. I want to find a cool weapon as well. Let me look around. Let's see what type of weapon I can get. And whoa, wait, what? These weapons actually look so cool. <gasps> I think I'm going to go with the energetic steel sword. This thing looks so cool looking. Whoa. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put a few of these inside of my chest really quick. And oh, wait, guys, let's also go ahead and grab some enchanted golden apples. We're definitely going to need those. Yeah, golden apples would definitely be useful. And yeah, here, I'm just going to fill up the rest of my chest with golden apples. These are going to be clutch. But yeah, I mean, I guess with that, my armory room is done. Let me see. What else could I add to my house? I think we still have a bit of time left. And, uh, wait a minute, guys. I think the next round is... Wait, what the... It's already started! Oh, gosh! Oh, no! Look how fast they are! What in the world are these? They're, like, camouflaged. 
camouflage toilets and oh my gosh guys it looks like my sentry turrets are doing the job let's go and oh gosh wait these things are huge i'm hiding inside of my house wait guys quick put on your armor this is the first time we can actually fight oh gosh yeah wait some of them are literally inside of my floor here let me go ahead and put on this armor really quick come on and here let me go ahead and grab this sword and some of these enchanted golden apples and let's go guys here let's go take these guys out all right come on guys we got this go 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 and oh gosh wait these guys do a lot of damage be careful come on guys i'm hitting them they're so powerful come on come on keep coming these guys are so much bigger than the last ones be careful everyone and they're faster too and, oh gosh yeah wait these ones have like super speed or something what the and ah wait one of them just let me on fire oh yeah these guys don't stand a chance come on guys let's take them out let's go and whoa wait your weapon looks super cool come on let's go wait guys help i'm stuck and, oh gosh wait there's so many down here come on come on we gotta take these out wait each one of your enchanted golden apples these are gonna be clutch let's go oh my gosh there's so many of them oh my gosh yeah what in the world there's actually so many wait are you like leaving a rainbow trail behind you wait i just saw like some rainbow stuff on my screen what the oh yeah it must be because of the man cat armor Whoa, what that's actually pretty cool but come on guys there's still so many of these guys let's go all right all right guys and here we go i think that's the last one and boom we got him let's go look at how op my armor is yeah our armor is super op that last one was actually pretty easy yeah i really like my armor but guys we should get back to building our houses the next one's probably gonna be even crazier and, oh gosh yeah you're probably right and okay it looks like we're in creative mode again so uh let's see what should we upgrade our houses to this time hmm, maybe a time fortress where we connect all three of our bases and whoa wait yeah that sounds like a great idea we should definitely do that what no no way i'm connecting my beautiful house to your filth and uh, what filth what are you what are you calling filth my house is literally the best one here i don't know what you're on about dude uh, i don't know about that look at how ugly yours looks with your just obsidian and walls and look at how beautiful mine looks and hey okay fine mine isn't meant to look like super beautiful and attractive and all that but it's effective okay it's got full obsidian walls while yours has like wood and stuff yeah but they still haven't got through mine yeah 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 yeah. whatever those are just excuses and oh wait it looks like speaker woman's already connecting them yeah come on dash let's put our houses together and yeah here let me go ahead and help build this little bridge over here and boom yeah wait speaker man come on we should connect all of our houses it'll be so much better fine as long as i can connect them to speaker woman's uh, okay i guess all right all right whatever here let me just go ahead and make like a little point over here on my house where i can just like have a little ladder and wait a minute hold on i probably shouldn't build the ladder on the outside i'll build it down over here so that i can actually get in with like a wall around me so that nothing can shoot at me yeah this is gonna be much nicer all right let me just place my bridge like this and uh, wait what are you serious dude you're literally building it to go all the way around my house yeah that's what i said i said i'm building this directly to speaker woman oh my gosh it would have been so much nicer if we could just have like one solid line go from speaker woman's to mine to yours but okay whatever whatever or if you guys actually built like you know decent looking houses except for you speaker woman your house looks so good yeah okay i guess you can combine your house to mine and wait a minute now that all of our houses are combined wait can i get a house tour of your guys's houses oh yeah sure come so this is where i put my armor stand i'm wearing it right now so you can't really see it but then i would put my weapons and golden apples here and then down here is the main area there's a little staircase and i have these levers that connect to the lava moat and, whoa, whoa, wait yeah this house actually looks pretty nice you know you got the two floors and everything i should probably add a second story to my house yeah you definitely should Good. All right, well, here, let me let myself back in again. And wait, speaker man, can I get a tour of your house? I've barely seen your house yet. Uh, after I get done with this bridge, you can. All right, all right, here. I guess while you're doing that, I'm gonna head back over to my house. And I have an idea for one more thing I wanna build. All right, well, anyways, guys, here's what I was thinking. What if we go ahead and grab some of these laser blocks and we can just use these to build like an entire defense surrounding our entire house? So let me just go ahead and get rid of these. Uh, wait, what, why can't I get rid of these fences? Oh, there we go. I can get rid of these ones. And now I can go ahead and put a bunch of these lasers around my house. Let's go. No intruders are getting through these. Wow. Oh, that sounds like a great idea. I can't wait to see it. It's gonna look so awesome when it's done. It's gonna go all around my house and it's actually gonna be so epic. All right, and all I gotta do now is place this side of my lasers and boom, all of my lasers are done. This looks so awesome. All right, I think my bridge is done. You wanna come check out my house now? And oh yeah, I've been waiting. All right, here, let me go ahead and enter the code into my door. I'm pretty sure it was one, three, four, five and boom. All right, I'm coming up this ladder. And oh my gosh, since you built your bridge to go to Speaker Woman's house, I have to go all the way through Speaker Woman's house to get just to your bridge. Okay. This is actually pretty inefficient, but whoa, wait, your bridge actually looks really cool. Yeah, that's what I do is looks and efficiency. And Wait, are we inside of your house now? This place actually looks awesome. What? Yeah, here's my spare armor set. And then I've got some ender pearls here and these OP void black hole apples. Ooh, 
what the void block hole up? Wait, are these better than enchanted golden apples? Uh, yeah, way better. And, oh, I'm gonna steal one of these. Uh, I guess you can have one, but I mean, you can just grab whatever from creative. Oh, can I join the house door? Oh, yes, yeah, speaker woman, you can. Uh, this is my bedroom up here. As you can see, there's a bunch of blue stuff. I, I also like the color blue. And, uh, wait, what? I thought your color was red. Uh, yeah, but blue's also a good color. And, uh, wait, why are there so many balloons everywhere? Is it like your birthday or something? Uh, no, I just thought they looked cool. But anyway, come on, guys, let's keep heading down. Uh, wait, you have more floors? Oh, gosh, this place is actually ginormous. And wait, what's this floor for? Oh, this is just the entry floor, and I don't have anything on here. Oh, wait, guys, I think I see the next round of mobs. And oh, gosh, yeah, round five is starting in 10 seconds here. Everyone, let's get back to our houses. We gotta get prepared. Oh, yeah, I'm already ready. And, whoa, but you have like an archery area as well. Okay, well, I'm going back to my area. Let's go. So am I. And oh, gosh, wait, I just got put into survival mode. All right, all right, I gotta rush back over to my house. I think the round started. And oh, gosh, yeah, all right, there they are. And uh, wait a minute, where did they all go? Wait, guys, did they all despawn? Uh, I think so. Uh, wait, that's kind of weird. And, uh, wait, what in the oh, guys, one of them is behind me. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I think they can teleport. What the? Wait, they just put a bunch of TNT on my tower. What? Oh, my gosh, guys. What in the world is going on? Oh, gosh, we got to be careful. Ah, my wolves are helping. There's one inside my house. I'm going outside. And, oh, gosh, yeah, guys. Our houses are useless right now. They can literally teleport inside. Everyone, quick. We got to fight them. Okay, I'm going out. Oh, my gosh. What in the world? Since when can Titan TV people teleport? They always could have. What do you mean? Uh, there's so many of them. And, oh, my gosh, yeah. What in the world? Half of them have TNT in their head as well. Everyone, be careful. What the? My lava mode is going everywhere. Oh, my gosh, guys. This is actually so bad. What do we do? Guys, we all have to join up and attack them together. And, oh, my gosh, yeah. These guys are actually insane here. Everyone, head over to my house. What? Your house? No, your house is horrible. Everyone, go to my house. And, oh, my gosh. Fine, fine, fine. Whatever. Here, I'm heading over to your house. Let me just go inside of my house really quick. Come on. Let me go ahead and enter my code. One, three, four, five. Go, go, go. Come on. And, okay, here, I'm going up the ladder. Okay, come on. Let's meet up. All right, go, go, go. Here, speaker man. We're heading over. All right, we're here. All right, guys, I got rid of the last Titan TV man in here. Uh, but come on, guys, we gotta come up with a plan. What are we supposed to do? And, oh my gosh, yeah, what in the world? There is literally so many of them. Wait, where did they go? Oh gosh, they must have like teleported over here, like beneath your door. And oh my gosh, they're literally right over there. Be super careful, guys. Oh, don't worry, I'll just use my lightsaber on them. And, oh, you have a lightsaber? Uh, wait, did you get rid of him? And okay, nice, you got rid of him. But guys, there's probably so many outside of the door right now. They're literally camping around this house. Oh my gosh, there's literally one right over here. All right, guys, this is the plan. Dash, you go in from the front. Me and Sweet your man will take out them out from the back. Then we'll meet up in the middle and absolutely destroy them watching each other's backs, okay? And, uh, yeah, that sounds like a good plan. Uh, I guess I'll start over here on this side and you guys start here? Yes, sir. All right, guys, in 20 seconds, let's all drop down and get them. And, all right, sounds good here. Let me go over to my spot. I'll start over at Speaker Woman's house. All right, I think it's about time that we go out and destroy these guys. Let's go. And yeah, what are we waiting for? Come here, you Titan TV man. Let's go. Oh, my gosh, there's so many on me. I need help. And, wait, wait, wait. Don't, don't bring that to my house. They're going to blow everything up with the TNT. Oh, my gosh. It's fine. You don't even have a good looking house anyway. And, oh my gosh, dude. It's literally my house. You can't say that. All right. Well, let's just go ahead and get rid of these guys. Come on. There's still so many of them. Come on, guys. We have to get them. Let's go. Come on. Come on. And wait, guys, they're actually dropping pretty quick. There's only a few left. And okay, hold on. Let me go over here to this one. I'm going to use one of these ender pearls. Let's go. And uh, he teleported away. Oh my gosh. And uh, wait a minute, guys. It looks like there's only a few of them left. Come on. Come on. They keep teleporting everywhere. These guys are so hard to fight. And oh, wait. One of them just teleported into your lava speaker, woman. Heck yeah. I knew that was a great idea. Yeah, let's go. We got to do more stuff like that. But let's see. Is there any of them left? Wait, did we get all of them? And oh, wait, guys, there's literally one right over there. Uh, why is he looking at us like that? That guy does not look very happy. I got him. And, oh, nice. But wait, was that all of them? Uh, yeah, I think it was. A speaker woman, did you see how brave I was for you? Oh, yeah, that was fine, I guess. But good job, guys. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. We took out another wave. But oh, gosh, I wonder how many more rounds there are left. We just got put into creative mode again. I guess we have to upgrade our houses more. Wait, guys, I think we need more traps like my moat. Maybe we could do a void trap or something. And Oh my gosh. Yeah, a void trap. That's actually a great idea. Uh, well, what type of void trap are you thinking? Well, why don't we put it surrounding our bases like a moat? And oh my gosh. Wait, yeah, that's a great idea. So like a void moat here. Everyone, let's go ahead and start digging down. All right, well, while you do that, I'll just do it over here on my base. And yeah, wait, guys, this void trap idea is actually such a good idea. There's no way anyone's going to be able to get past this. They're just going to fall right into it. I'm going to have my lava trap and the void trap. And oh, wait, so you're going to build like the void trap outside of the lava moat? That is actually so OP. All right, well, my void trap is done. They can't get anywhere near my base. And yeah, wait, mine is almost done here. I just gotta break a few more blocks just like this. And boom, there we go. My entire void trap is done. I've got like a huge void moat around my entire house. This is so awesome. And whoa, wait, 
we speak for a minute? Wow, you really went all out. You got rid of like all the bedrock. Yep, I have to fully protect my base. But uh, wait a minute. Question now. When we're in survival mode, how are you supposed to get inside of your base? Oh, look, it's pretty simple. I take an ender pearl like this and I throw it in my balcony. Well, just like that. And uh, wait, you literally just fell into the void. I don't think that's a very good strategy. Oh, I've got an idea. Well, I could just make a TNT cannon. And wait, 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 like a TNT cannon for yourself? Wait, that sounds like a little bit dangerous, doesn't it? Uh, won't you blow up? Only if I'm not good enough. Okay, well, I'd actually like to see this work. If this works, that's gonna be so OP. All right, now all I gotta do is put TNT in these dispensers. Whoa, is that actually gonna work? It should. If this works, we should probably build two more for our houses. That way we can all have like a safe way to get inside of our base and the mobs aren't gonna be able to even use it. All right, and now all I have to do is put this lever down and boom, it's ready. Now this should work. All I gotta do is flick this lever just like and, this. Uh, oh gosh, I'm gonna back off. And run and boom. And Ooh, what the? Wait, that's actually awesome. Yeah, it's pretty simple. Oh, I can't believe that actually worked. Yeah, boy, I'm surprised you didn't blow up. Wait, is that gonna work in survival mode? But yeah, it should because the TNT's in the water. And, whoa, okay, yeah, that makes sense. Speaker one, we should build one of these for our house as well. That way we each have like a nice way to get inside of our house where the mobs can't follow us. Speak for yourself. I can just park cord to get into my base. And, oh, yeah, I guess you can do that. But do you, are you still gonna be able to do that when there's 70 toilets chasing you? No, don't worry, I'm fine. And, oh, okay, if you say so. But honestly, I think I'm gonna go ahead and copy Speaker Man's design and. Wait a minute, I don't even have to copy your design. Wait, can I just use this to like launch myself over to my base? Let me go ahead and flick the lever really quick. And here we go. Do you guys think it's gonna work? Let's see and <gasps> what the uh, guys, I literally just got launched into outer space. What in the world? Yeah, I know my design's pretty good, but you probably should add some water because you're gonna die of fall damage. And oh yeah, that's a good idea here. Let me go ahead and add myself like a little water pool here. But whoa, yeah, that TNT cannon thing is super OP. And boom, there we go. Now I've got like a safe little landing platform over here. Wait, guys, what's a nuclear ray? And Wait, a nuclear... Wait, what in the world did you just find? Uh, I'm heading over right now. This has to be exciting. And, uh, yeah, wait, hold on. I need to check this out. What in the world? Yeah, look, it's a nuclear ray. Check this out. Uh, oh, wait, what in the world? Oh my gosh, I need something this cool as that. Let me see. Is there anything cool I could get? And whoa, this could work. It's called a guided missile launcher. And, whoa, wait, what in the world? Wait, how did we not see this stuff earlier? Oh my gosh, wait. And I'm pretty sure I could just aim at something. And oh, it's beeping. And oh my gosh, it's saying no targets in view. Wait, what happens if I shoot it and oh my gosh, that's a rocket! Whoa, what the? Okay, that is actually crazy. Hold on, I need to get something as cool as that. Let me look and see what I can find. And uh, wait a minute guys, what in the world is a Tesla cannon? This thing looks awesome! Whoa, wait, you should test fire that! And oh my gosh, yeah, you're right. I definitely should here. Let me go ahead and aim at this tree over here and let's see what it does. And <gasps> Oh, wait, uh, guys, did you see that? It literally shoots lightning out of it. This is awesome. Oh my gosh, we have such OP stuff. This next round's not gonna stand a chance. Oh my gosh, yeah. I have no idea what this next round is even gonna be, but it does not stand a chance, but it is going down. All right, guys, well, I think we're all ready. How about we head back into our houses for the next round? And yeah, here, everyone, let's go ahead and get back into positions. I'm gonna go over here on my archer tower, and yeah, let's just wait for the next round. And oh, wait, guys, it says it's starting final round in 10 seconds. Wait. Guys, is that a missile toilet? And, uh, wait, what in the world? Ah, he just saw a fireball. Let me be careful, everyone. I'm shooting my rockets at him. And, oh, gosh, yeah, here, everyone, let's go ahead and shoot ourselves. And, ah, oh, wait, he keeps shooting fireballs. Oh, gosh, those hurt. And, wait, what in the world? He can fly? Oh, my gosh, I'm gonna shoot my rocket. And, oh, yeah, good idea. And, whoo, wait, okay, that looked like it did a lot of damage. Here, everyone, let's use our weapons on him. Go, go, go. Oh, yeah, I lock on to him. I'm using my nuclear ray. And, oh, gosh, wait, it looks like he's targeting you, speaker one. Watch out. Oh, geez. Me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, and uh, wait a minute, guys, I think my thing ran out of ammo! Oh gosh, hold on, I need to go up here and attack it with my sword, come on! Oh my gosh, you should have stocked up on ammo! I forgot, I forgot, wait, do you have any extra ammo? Yeah, but you have to come inside, come and, on! Oh gosh, you're right, you're right, um, the, hold on, I'm gonna go use the TNT launcher, I'm going, I'm going! But wait, there's no water landing area on my roof! And, oh yeah, right, but wait, I've got a bucket of water, I can make it work, come on, come on, let's go! Are you sure? Come on, come on, it has to work, and here we go, here we go, guys, I'm landing in! <gasps> Let's go! I clutched! Oh my gosh, let's go finally! All right, here, take your ammo! Let's go, let's go! Thank you very much here. How do I even use these? Do I just have to reload and... Oh, perfect, I'm reloading. All right. Oh, wait, guys, he's doing a lot of damage. And, yeah, wait, what in the world, guys? Our weapons are barely doing anything. What do we do? I'm pulling out my secret weapon! And, uh, wait, what in the world is that? It's a nuclear blaster! Come here, you're going down! And, wait, come on, come on, go, go, go! And... <gasps> You got him! Let's go! Oh my gosh, I'm glad that got rid of him because that was the only shot that I could take. Whoa, no way! We actually did it! Oh my gosh, that weapon is awesome! Yeah, that thing is OP! And wait, guys, I think we beat it! Let's go! Let's go!
Today, we're playing Build to Survive, but I'm secretly cheating with the Morph mod so I can morph into all of the monsters and break my friends. You guys ready to start this Build to Survive? Let's go. I'm gonna build the best house. Okay, okay. We'll see about that. But guys, here, let's go ahead and start building a basic house. And wait, instead of using just wool, let's go ahead and use obsidian. Oh, wait, you're using obsidian? You know what? I'm gonna use bedrock. Oh, what? Bedrock? That is a great idea. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and build my house out of bedrock as well. This is gonna be unbreakable. Oh, you guys are using boring blocks. Your blocks have no color. Uh, okay, does that matter, though? We're just trying to survive. What are you building your house out of? I'm using reinforced orange terracotta. Whoa, wait, reinforced? Does that mean it's as strong as bedrock? I hope so. Whoa, but yeah, that stuff actually does look pretty strong. But anyways, here, guys, I just have to go ahead and start building my house pretty normally for this first little part, just so that they think I'm, like, not up to anything. And then once my house is done, I'm gonna start morphing into mobs and breaking them. All right, well, I'm gonna add a bunch of cool designs to my build. I'm gonna make it so cool. And whoa, wait, your base actually is looking pretty cool. I just need to go ahead and finish up this wall over here, and then I can go ahead and add in a roof. This is gonna be so awesome. My bedrock house is gonna be the best house out of everybody's. What? No way, mine is. And wait, what? Hold on. Uh, wait, no, your house doesn't even have a roof and a speaker when your house is smaller than mine, so mine is clearly they're gonna be the best. Hey, it's efficient. All right, all right. Well, anyways, here, guys, let me just go ahead and finish up my house just like this. I need to finish adding in the roof, and here, let me also go ahead and grab some doors, and all right, all right, perfect. This is gonna be our head of operations. This is gonna be where we're gonna be morphing and pranking everyone. So here, what should we morph into first? And wait a minute, guys, hold on. What if I go ahead and morph into a creeper? This is gonna be so funny. I'm gonna be able to blow everyone up. All right, and now that I'm a creeper, I'm pretty sure I can also blow up and... <gasps> oh my gosh, that was awesome! Wait, what was that sound? Did someone hear something? Uh, yeah, I heard that. It was like an explosion. And, uh, no, 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 guys. Uh, it was nothing. It was nothing. Uh, don't worry about it. Uh, okay. Oh gosh, that was a close one. But all right, guys, now that I morphed into a creeper, let's go prank speaker man's house first he looks like he's right over here and oh gosh wait his entire house is made out of bedrock hold on what can we even do um okay let's see and whoa wait guys look he's got this like big door over here uh here let's just go ahead and quickly open up this door and wait is he inside of his house where is he and oh wait he's got like a basement over here what the oh yeah i'm definitely gonna win with this underground bunker there's no way any of them are going to get all the way down here and plus i have so many floors and wait what he's building an underground bunker what in the world oh gosh wait hold on let's quickly go down here hopefully he's not on any of these floors and oh gosh wait uh, i see him right down there wait a minute guys this gives me a really funny idea here let me just go ahead and run this command and set him to survival mode really quick and here now let me hop down this ladder really quick and boom what the heck ah! and, oh my gosh that worked so perfectly but oh gosh wait uh, guys i gotta get out of here he's gonna see me i gotta go whoa wait what happened to speaker man yeah how did you fall out of the world oh i was building an underground bunker and there was a giant creeper that came on me and exploded wait what speaker man a creeper i don't think the round actually started yet what are you talking about did you spawn it in uh, no i didn't spawn a creeper in to blow me up why would i do that i don't know but mobs aren't supposed to spawn so you must be imagining things and yeah dude the gate is literally closed what are you talking about why would i imagine Imagine a creeper blowing me up and tossing me into the void. What sense does that make? I don't know, but you do you. Whatever. All right. Well, anyways, guys, that was actually perfect. We didn't even get caught or anything, but I think next we should go ahead and prank speaker woman. Look, not all of our house is made out of bedrock, so this should be perfect. And oh gosh, wait, I gotta be careful. Okay, I'm gonna just put these blocks here. There we go. This looks good. And okay, guys, while she's distracted with her roof here, let's just go ahead and sneak into our house right over here. And okay, perfect. We are in. Let's go. And almost done with this. Oh, I can't wait for everybody to see my house. It's definitely the best. And whoa, wait, she looks like she has a lot of cool stuff up here. Here, let's just quickly go right over here and boom, let's go! Ah, what the? What in the world? Why is there a creeper here? Go away, go away! Oh gosh, wait, she saw me, she saw me! I gotta run! Go, go, go! Whoa, whoa, did anybody see that? Uh, wait, 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 what? What, what happened? What are you talking about? I saw a creeper. It just blew up all my work. Yeah, see, I told you there's a creeper. Wait, what? A creeper? Uh, you guys sure about this? I mean, I haven't seen any creeper in my house or anything. No, that was definitely a creeper. It just blew up my house. Wait, isn't your house made of bedrock? How did it even blow up? Well, not all of it is made out of bedrock. There's some concrete parts for decor. Well, I don't know. That's pretty strange. I guess if anyone sees this random creeper again, I'd just, like, pull out a sword and try killing it. Yeah. Guys, why did I see that? I just remembered I am the creeper. Oh, gosh. Um, okay, well, here, why don't we go ahead and just morph into another mob? Here, let's head back into our head of operations building right over here. And, hmm, okay, what mob should we morph into next? And, <gasps> wait a minute. What about an Enderman? So, wait, I'm pretty sure to actually unlock the Enderman morph. I need to go ahead and grab an Enderman spawn egg and a sword really quick. And here, let me just go ahead and kill an Enderman. Boom, there we go. And now I should have 
have the Enderman morph. And okay, perfect. I do. Here we go. And oh my gosh, check me out. I'm an Enderman now. This is awesome. And oh my gosh, look at how long my arm is. What in the world? It literally looks like a noodle. But anyways, here, let me just quickly head outside and oh, wait, hold on. I'm too big. I need to break these blocks. And okay, perfect. We are out. And I think our next target is going to be Speaker Baby right over there. All right. And guys, the best part about being an Enderman is that, of course, we can go ahead and teleport. And whoa, wait, it looks like Speaker Baby's made some good progress on his house. Whoa, look at that door. All right, I'm almost finished with upstairs, but I think I want to keep working on my bunker. And oh, perfect, guys. He's going downstairs into his bunker. Oh, wait, I got to be careful. I don't want to get caught by the others. But anyways, guys, since Enderman can, like, pick up blocks, it would make perfect sense if we just, like, pick up all of the blocks from his house and just put them in random spots. So here, let me just hop inside of his house over here. Let's literally just go ahead and destroy the entire wall. This is going to be a perfectly convincing story because, you know, Enderman can pick up blocks. And it's basically just going to look like the Enderman picked up all of the blocks of his walls, pretty much. So here, let's just quickly go ahead and break all of this before he sees us. This is actually going to be so funny. All right, all right. And come on, we got to do it quick before anyone sees us and before Speaker Baby comes back up. And okay, boom, there we go. It is done. All right, now let's go see his reaction. All right, I'm finished with my bunker. I think I'm going to go check out the other people's houses, especially the humans. And wait, what happened to my house? Guys, did you do anything to my house? And oh my gosh, this is so funny. Uh, the Wait, Speaker Baby, what happened to your house? I don't know. Everything is gone. All my walls are disappeared. Wait, what? That's weird. I didn't do anything. Wait, your walls disappeared? How in the heck do walls disappear? I don't know, but the only thing left is my door. Wait, what the heck happened over here? And Whoa, uh, wait. I don't think walls can just like disappear like that. Uh, maybe you didn't build them. Are you sure you actually built the walls? Yes, I'm sure I actually built them and I built them out of a reinforced orange concrete, remember? And Oh, yeah, right, right, right. I remember you were talking about that, but uh, are you sure you actually did it? Yes, human. I'm sure I actually built them at... Wait. What's that over there? There's an Enderman. And, oh, gosh. Uh, guys, they see me. I gotta run. Go, go, go. Watch out, human. There's an Enderman on the loose, and he's coming to your house. And, uh, wait, what? There's an Enderman? And, oh, gosh. Quick, guys. I need to unmorph. Come on. And, okay, okay. Perfect. Come on. I'm unmorphing. Come on. Come on. And, okay, okay. I'm back to my normal self. Human, are you all right? And, uh, yeah, guys. Wait, what are you talking about? I didn't see any Enderman around here. What? The, I swear I seen an Enderman walk in here. Yeah, he definitely came in here. And, uh, wait. Are you sure about that, guys? Uh, are you sure he didn't walk into, like, your house or something, Speaker Man? Uh, yeah, because my house is completely made of bedrock. He can't get in. Mm, I don't know. Well, don't you have a door? Can't he just, like, go through the door? And wait, guys, Enderman can literally teleport. Maybe he teleported somewhere. Wait, guys, what happened? I was looking for you guys. I heard there was an Enderman on the loose. And yeah, wait, they're talking about, like, some sort of Enderman. They said it came into my house, but I didn't see anything. Oh, uh, I don't know. Maybe it teleported away. Mm, it's kind of weird that it went into your house. And wait, what the heck is that? And, wait, what? Oh, my bedrock? Uh, yeah, that is what I was using for my house. No, you had a spawn egg. But wait, yeah. Yeah, look at your house. It's just a box. There's nothing inside of it. And, uh, yeah, that's my house. Okay, I'm still working on it, dude. Come on, no need to be so mean. Yeah, but look at everybody else. We've all made a bunch of progress, and you just have a box. Wait, what speaker baby doesn't have any progress either? Look, his thing is literally like a lava moat and a door. I had a bunch of progress, but the stupid Enderman broke my walls. I don't know. This is kind of weird, but we should probably just get back to building. And, yeah, guys, I, I agree with speaker man. Let's just all get back to building, okay? And, oh, gosh, guys, uh, I think they're on to me. Here, let me just go ahead and, like, actually build on my house a little bit, just so that, I, you know, I don't seem suspicious. All right, all right. Well, uh, anyways, uh, what type of defenses are you guys building on your houses? Well, I have a bunch of towers, so if someone invades the first floor, then I can just go up and up and up, and they won't ever reach me. Whoa, wait, that is actually such a good idea. Oh, yeah, mine's just like that, except for underground. I have, like, 17 layers of just underground bunkerness. Oh, well, right now I only have a lava moat and a bunker, but I plan on making my base super overpowered. Whoa, okay, hold on. I think I know what I'm going to build next. I'm going to go ahead and build a lava moat as well. Here, let me go ahead and grab some lava. And wait a minute, guys, instead of lava, why don't we go ahead and use some fake water? Pretty much it just looks like normal water, but if anyone tries going inside of it, it'll do a bunch of damage. So here, let me go ahead and spawn in like a pig, for example. And here, guys, check this out. Look at that. It's like poisonous water. Oh, yeah. I mean, I guess it's good, but like it's just some water. Yeah, but the mobs are going to think that it's normal water. So they're going to try to go for a little dip. And then before they know it, it's too late. Well, that's actually really smart. I don't think the mobs will ever suspect that. Yeah, it's going to be awesome. And whoa, wait, what are you building on your house? Well, I have this lava a moat, and then I'm surrounding it by an electric fence, so no mobs will get through. Whoa, that is such a good idea. Okay, hold on. Uh, I might have to copy that. I'm not gonna lie here. Let me go ahead and grab some of this electric fence in here. I'm just gonna put it around my entire house, and wait, instead of putting just one layer, I'm gonna put two layers just to make, like, a whole electric fence wall. Oh, wait, that's actually really smart. I'll do that, too. Oh, my gosh, guys. I just found the best defenses for my house. And wait, you did? What are you building? Oh, well, you should come look at it. And whoa, wait, is that a gold fence? Wait, what does it do? Uh, well, can't you see it? 
it's a defense. Uh, I mean, yeah, I guess it, like, kind of stops the mobs, but wait, is it, like, better than the electric fence? Like, does it zap the mobs if they get too close? Uh, no, why would it zap mobs? It's a defense. It, it's defense, can't you see? Oh, wait, well, what? I'm getting kind of confused here. Uh, Speaker Baby, what are these fences? They're defenses. Can't you see? You mean these are fences? Like the fences instead of the fences? Yeah, they're defenses. And uh, wait, oh, wait. Oh, I see what's going on here. Uh, wait, speaker, maybe there's a difference between defenses and fences. Like, uh, yeah. Uh, no, human. I'm pretty sure that these are defenses. Uh, these are some fences. You could say the fences, but they're not defense. Like defenses. That's literally the same word. No, they're not. No, one of them is two words and one of them is only one word. Oh my gosh, you guys are so confusing. Just let me build my house in peace. And Oh my gosh, all right, yeah, go for it. But anyways, here, I gotta start upgrading my house as well. <gasps> Wait a minute, guys, I'm gonna add archery towers to my house. That way, if any of the mobs get, like, too close and are annoying, I can just shoot them down with my bow. This is gonna be so clutch. And boom, the roof to my house is done. This looks so cool. And, whoa, wait, that actually does look pretty sick. And whoa, 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 wait, what is this big gaping hole beneath your house? Oh, uh, just follow me through here and I'll show you what it is. And, whoa, wait. Wait, what in the world? Wait, what in the... This actually looks so sick. What? Oh, yeah. Uh, this is just some normal stuff. Uh, come down here. I've got a bunch of floors for this bunker that I'm going to deck out with a bunch of open gear. Whoa, wait. Yeah, you have so many floors. Uh, oh, my gosh. I've already lost count. How many do you even have? I think it's like 17 or something. And boom, we're at the bottom of the world. What in the world? Oh, my gosh. All right. Well, uh, your house is pretty decked out. I can't wait to see what you fill these rooms with. Yeah, there's no way the mobs are going to survive my house. It's going to be an amazing death trap. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that is crazy. But here, I got to finish up on my archer towers as well. Here, let me just go ahead and start building the little towers, and then my house should be more defended. Well, I'm gonna make a garden inside my house so we can sniff the flowers without going outside. And what, you're making a garden? Uh, is that really gonna be useful, you know, because uh, we're trying to, like, survive here and not sniff flowers? Yeah, of course it is. It's quality of life. You wouldn't understand. What quality of life? Now, what do you mean? I understand all about quality of life. Look, my house is, like, so quality of life. It's like a... It literally looks like a prison, actually. Your house is the opposite of quality of life. Alright, well, my house might not be quality of life, but my house is, uh, like, the definition of life, you know? If you live inside of my house, there is no way those mobs are getting to you. Uh, yeah, sure. If the house you sleep at night. What in the world? Okay, guys, I think it's time for another round of pranking. They have made way too much progress, and I've, like, barely caught up. All I've got is, like, my archer towers over here. My doors aren't even centered. Oh, gosh, all right, well, I'll fix all this later, but first, it's time for some more morph pranking. All right, but what mob should I morph into this time? And <gasps> wait a minute, what about a silverfish? So here, let me go ahead and just grab a silverfish spawn egg really quick and boom let me go ahead and take it out and perfect now i've unlocked the morph for it so now let me just go ahead and select it here in my morph menu and okay perfect we are now a silverfish and the best part about being a silverfish is that i'm super small so i'm gonna be able to hide anywhere and they're not even gonna be able to see me so what are we waiting for let's get this started all right all right and here who should we prank first and okay i think we should prank speaker woman first because she was making fun of my house she said it's not quality of life so uh hi speaker woman uh, how's your house coming along oh my house is coming along really good Good. I've started working on this tree house. And whoa, wait, you have a tree house? That's pretty cool. But uh, wait, how do you get to the top of it? Oh, you just got to go up through the vines. Oh, okay. Okay. I see. So here, guys, let's just go ahead and sneak into Speaker Woman's house. And whoa, wait, I don't even have to open the door. I'm so small. I can literally just sneak through this little gap in the wall. So here now, let's go ahead and climb the stairs. Whoa, wait, it looks like Speaker Woman's made a lot of progress since last time we were here. And whoa, wait, okay, so there's so much more stuff here. Let's go check out what this top area looks like. Okay, just put this here. This looks good. Guys, she's right there she's right there okay here let me hide over here behind this piece of wood and okay what should we do what type of prank could we pull and <gasps> wait a minute i just realized all of the stuff in here is made out of wood and like leaves and you know what wood and leaves is very flammable that's what it is so why don't we just go ahead and grab a flint and steel really quick and here let's just go ahead and uh oops didn't mean to do that i accidentally uh, put down a fire and okay guys she hasn't even noticed yet let's wait okay this looks really good and uh why is this block missing and wait what guys did the fire not even spread? What in the world? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Okay, uh, that's not good. The fire just went out instantly. We need to do a little bit more. Come on. Come on. There we go. This is looking good. And what? Is the what? How did this happen? And okay. Okay. It looks like she noticed the fire here. Quick. Let's go down. And oh, come on. Come on. We just got to keep lighting the bottom as well. Come on. Let's go. Oh, no. No. Everything's burning. Stop. 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 And out uh, the white speaker on. What's going on? Do you need help? My house is burning. What, your house is burning? Uh, th did you put fire everywhere or something? Uh, wait, is there any lava? You might want to be careful. Oh, no, I can't stop the fire. It's spreading too fast. Wait, what happened to your house? Oh, my gosh, everything's on fire. I don't know. And wait, maybe 
it's because you have like that lava moat down at the bottom. Maybe it was too hot and the fire spread up to the treehouse. What? That makes no sense. What? That makes perfect sense. Lava is super hot. So if you have a lava moat right underneath your treehouse, it might, you know, catch on fire. Yeah, but how would the lava catch the tree on fire if it's on the top of her house? It's way too far. I don't know. I mean, what else could have caused it? I don't know, but no, there's nothing left in. Uh, what is that? And oh gosh, oh gosh, quick guys, I gotta run. Go, go, go. Wait, did that silverfish just run away after being seen? Oh my gosh, that silverfish totally set fire to my house. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, here, I gotta hide over here in this grass. Okay, perfect, I should be hidden here. I don't know how a silverfish can start a fire, but he definitely did it, I know it. Wait, 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 what, you're blaming the silverfish? I speak her mind, I don't think silverfish can, like, even hold a flint and steel. Well, I don't know, it's just a gut feeling, okay? Wait, human, uh, what are you doing with your house? And, oh, oh, uh, oh, uh, me? Uh, I'm just working on my house, you know, I'm working on my archery towers. And, oh gosh, guys, quick, I need to fly over to my house really quick. And quick, let me head back into the head of operations space and quick on a morph uh, wait where are you even and oh there you are uh, what are you even doing in here uh the, the, what do you mean what i'm doing here there's my house and the, the wait guys why are you all here uh, we could have used your help whenever the tree was on fire and yeah but uh, you know i thought you guys had that under control uh, i was just working on my house you know so we could actually survive yeah well this house looks pretty empty what are you even doing yeah it looks the same as the last time we were over here and, no 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 guys you guys haven't seen the upgrades i made look i've got this fake water moat and i've got this electric fence and look i've even got all these archer towers which are uh, still a work in progress. Uh, wait, if you've got fences blocking your fake water, doesn't that mean that they're not going to go into the fake water? And, oh, yeah, I guess kind of. But, you know, in case the mobs try to, like, jump over it or anything, that way they'll land into the fake water and it'll be perfect. Uh, yeah, I guess. Yeah, sure, I guess. I mean, I'm just gonna keep building my base. And, yeah, guys, here, come on. We don't have much time left until the walls drop. Come on, we have to keep building our bases. Okay, you're just being a little suspicious. What? I am not being suspicious. I'm just working on my house. I don't know what you want from me. If you you say so. And oh gosh, guys, I, I am definitely being too suspicious. I gotta be more careful here. At least let me go ahead and finish up these archer towers so it looks like I've got a little bit of progress done. So here, let me just go ahead and grab some of these ladders and just uh, I'm gonna go ahead and place them on the inside over here to get up. And then over here at the top, I can have a little platform like that. And then let me also go ahead and grab a chest so that, you know, I can have a bow. And whoa, wait, okay. I think I'm gonna go with this emerald bow. This thing looks sick. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and put a bunch of these in here. And then, oh wait, I can't forget my arrow. So let me grab some of those. And boom, there we go. My archer tower is complete. But now I need to do the same for three more. I'm just trying to rebuild my house after it got burned down. I hope it doesn't burn down again. And yeah, you gotta be careful. Uh, maybe build like a cover between your lava moat and your roof. Because uh, I don't know, maybe like the heat is like going up or something. I don't know. That makes no sense. It was definitely that silver fish. I know it. Um, I don't know about that. I don't know how a silver fish would burn a house down. But uh, you do you. It was very suspicious. It was just a normal silver fish. Like silver fish always run away when you look at them. No. Oh, and how did you know that it ran away when we looked at it? And uh, uh, Because uh, you guys said so. Yeah, you guys were, like, uh, talking about how it ran away. Uh, no, we didn't. Yeah, you did. I literally heard it. Uh, no, I don't think we said that. I think we just asked why there was a silverfish there. Uh, uh, well, uh, I just had a feeling, okay? I, I knew what you guys were talking about. I don't know, human. That's kind of weird. Yeah, you've been weird recently. What? No, I have not. Okay, I've just been trying to build my house. And anyway, speaking about my house, I just finished the archer towers. They look so sick. Yeah, the archer towers are cool, but you haven't made as much progress as I have. And wait, what, what progress have you made? Whoa, but your house kind of looks like a cake. Uh, yeah, that's the point. But here, let me give you the tour. If you come in here, you can go through my super advanced doors. Just... Mind the jump. All right, all right. And whoa, wait, what's inside of your bunker? Well, you gotta just come down these ladders and then you gotta do this super tricky parkour and then you can get to my super prized possessions. And whoa, wait, you have a parkour room down here? And wait, SB? What does that say? Oh, are those your initials? Uh, Yeah, of course. It stands for speaker, baby. Whoa, that's actually pretty cool. This room down here actually looks pretty sick. And whoa, wait, that is awesome. And oh, wait, I messed up the parkour. Oh, wait, why are you even trying the parkour? Stay away from my prized possessions. And okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. But what even is in those chests? Wouldn't you like to know? Just get out of here. And, oh my gosh, I would like to know. Come on, can you not just tell me? Nope, you're never gonna know. And what in the world? Oh my gosh, well, uh, I guess I'll never find out. And guys, I'm definitely gonna find out. I need to know what's inside of those chests. I am so curious. Okay, okay, well, I've got a plan. Back to our head of operations right over here uh, with the uncentered door that doesn't line up with the ladder. And all right, let's see. What mob can we morph into this time? Let's see, let's see. And <gasps> wait a minute, what about a blaze? Okay, this is gonna be perfect because blazes can uh, literally shoot fireballs and they can also fly. So I I'll be able to fly wherever I want and it'll be like a perfect cover up. So here, let me go ahead and just grab a blaze spawn egg really quick and let me go ahead and put him down and boom, there we go. I've unlocked his morph. And now let's go ahead and morph into the blaze. Here we go. And oh my gosh, guys, check me out. I'm a blaze. 
and okay, this is perfect now because I can shoot fireballs and I can also fly. But wait a minute, before we go over to Speaker Baby's house, let me go ahead and quickly test out my abilities. Can I actually shoot fireballs and okay, I can, perfect. But wait, what? The, uh, the fireballs aren't even doing any damage. What? They're not exploding when they actually hit. And what? Wait, they're so hard to aim as well. Okay, wait, hold on. These fireballs are actually pretty garbage. Wait, uh, Dash, why is there fireballs coming outside of your house? And, uh, wait, oh, 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 what? What are you talking about? There's no fireballs? Uh, yeah, there is. I just seen them flying out. They stopped as soon as you started talking, but there was definitely fireballs. And, oh, 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 right, right, right. I think you're talking about my uh, fireball shooter. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was using dispensers. I was just testing out a new design. Well, I'm definitely gonna have to come check that out. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You should definitely come check it out, but uh, not yet. Not yet. It's not done yet, okay? I'll call you over when it's done. Uh, uh fine, I guess. All right, but anyways, guys, we need to solve this problem of our fireballs not blowing up. Like, what's the point of fireballs if they don't explode and all they do is just light stuff on fire? I'm pretty sure we can actually go ahead and grab an item that makes our fireballs, like, actually explode and... Okay, yeah, that is the golden inferno staff. This is what we need. I'm pretty sure if I use this, I can shoot fireballs and, like, also have them explode. So let me just test it out over here and... <gasps> Um, okay, well, that didn't explode, but that was definitely a lot better than before. Look at that. There's like a bunch of particles everywhere. All right, well, anyways, now that we've got our fireballs checked out, what are we waiting for? Let's go head over to Speaker Baby's house. So, yeah, guys, this is my house so far. I have my little, like, computer set up right here, but then down here is where my real prized possessions are, but don't try to get them, okay? And, uh, wait, what, guys, is that Speaker Man and Speaker Woman down there as well? Oh, gosh, I, guys, I think Speaker Baby's giving them a tour. Oh, gosh, um, okay, well, here, let's just quickly head in. So, I don't want to see you guys trying this parkour and, wait, what are you doing? Stop it! Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. And just to have extra security, I have guards down here so no one can get to this chest. And wait, what type of guards did he put down there? And wait, is that a blaze? Oh, wait, guys, I think Speaker Baby put blaze guards down there. Oh my gosh, guys, I can blend in with them. Okay, let me just hop down here and okay, perfect. I blend right in with the guards. Whoa, that's a lot of blazes. That's kind of scary. Well, yeah, it needs to be scary. I don't want anyone getting to this chest. And wait a minute, guys, I have a really funny idea. Why don't I go ahead and just shoot this fireball? Let's speaker win. Boom. Ah, uh, what was that? That was one of my guards, see? Now get out of here. Uh, yeah, I'm getting out of here. See ya. Oh my gosh, that was so funny. And wait, why don't we also go ahead and shoot a fireball at Speaker Baby? Wait, where did he go? Oh, there he is. All right. Boom, there we go. Wait, what are you doing? You're not supposed to shoot at me. <laughs> Let's go. That was so funny. And wait, let's just do it again with the normal fireballs. Boom, there we go. Oh my gosh, what are you doing, you stupid guard? Get over here. And, uh, wait, is that a sword? Hey, get away from me. Oh gosh, oh gosh, I guys, he's chasing me with a sword. What do I do? Oh my gosh, Blaze, come here. I'm going to get you one way or another. And, oh gosh, oh gosh. Okay, guys, I have an idea. Here, I need to go ahead and grab some TNT and... Okay, okay, I'm just going to put it all over here. Uh, speaker okay, Baby, wait, better wait, wait, stop. Wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. Don't, do not blow up that TNT. And okay, okay, I think this is working perfect. Listen, Blaze, I don't know how, how we can talk. You're a mob, but... Just what do you want to not blow up that TNT? And wait, hold on. This gives me an idea. Let me go ahead and put down a sign really quick. And I'm just going to say, leave me alone and I won't blow it up. There we go. Now we can talk to him. Leave me alone and I won't blow it. Oh my God. This is the weirdest place I've ever seen. Okay, I'll leave you alone. I'll throw the sign. I'm, I'm just going to break this TNT. Okay, take the room. Don't blow up my room. And oh my gosh, perfect. I can't believe that actually worked. Anyways, here, let's check out what's inside of his prized possessions chest. Let me see. And wait, oh, I thought it was going to be something good. It's just a bunch of cake. What in the world? Uh, wait a minute. What's the stuff down here at the bottom? A nuclear blaster? And wait, what are these? Nuclear power cells? Wait a minute. Hold on. What if I just go ahead and uh, grab one of these and some of these nuclear power cells? And whoa, wait, hold on. This thing looks crazy. How do I even use it? Whoa, what the? Oh my gosh, this thing is insane. Okay, well, this is actually pretty cool. But wait, I've got a funny idea. What if I just go over here and replace all of those super OP weapons with some wooden swords? So here, let me just go ahead and take all of these out over here. And boom, I'm going to replace them with these wooden swords. Let's go. All right, well, anyways. I think our work here is done here. Let's head back over to our home base and... Oh, wait, he's up right over there. Let's just try to sneak past him and... Oh, wait, oh, he's... Uh Blaze, you're escaping. Okay, well, thanks for not blowing up my area. And, uh, yeah, uh, see you. I'm out of here. And, oh, my gosh, guys, that was a clean in and out operation. He didn't suspect a thing. All right, well, anyways, here, now let me just go ahead and unmorph. And perfect, I am back into my normal self. Uh, and, all right, I'm done with my base now. Uh, let me come check out that fireball shooter you were talking about. And, uh, wait, 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 speaker man. Uh, no, 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 my fireball shooters are not done yet. Uh, they're almost done. I just need to go ahead and uh, fill them up with fireballs, yeah? Uh, where are they? I don't see them. And, oh, oh, oh. Oh, uh, hi. Um, the, well, pretty much I built them and then I realized that like they were kind of bad. So I broke all of them. And here, I'm just going to rebuild them again. You want to help? Uh, sure. I guess I can help. But why would you break them? How bad could it have been? And oh, it was really bad. You know, that was just like my first design. Uh, I'm this like the second version. So this one should be a lot better. So here, let's just go ahead and put some dispensers here uh, like this, I guess. And oh, wait, actually, hold on. Let's go ahead and put it all the way up here so that, uh, you know, it like can shoot the flying mobs. Uh, the, yeah, that's going to be important. Uh, yeah, but they have to be exactly in this position to shoot the flying 
mobs up. Are you sure you know what you're doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Trust me, this is going to be really good. Next, we just have to go ahead and add the redstone over here. And boom, look, now we can control them from both of these archer towers. This is going to be perfect. I mean, I guess this is all right, but your house is like nowhere near complete. Uh, come check out my base. My base is super awesome. Well, really? Can I check out your base too? Uh, yeah, everyone come over here and check out my base. It's super cool. Uh, Okay, and whoa, wait, I see you still got these same doors from last time. And wait, I meant to ask you earlier, but what is this? Is this just like a bunch of spikes and oh wait they just gave me poison uh, yeah i wouldn't go in there and uh you don't want to go in this room uh because there's nothing in there it's just a prank room and wait a prank room uh okay that's kind of weird but wait where, where's the main thing at? all right well down here we could go all the way down these layers and i added a few traps so you might want to be a bit careful and oh gosh he added traps okay well let's see what he added and whoa what the uh, what is all this uh, these are a bunch of railgun turrets if any mobs want to come down to me they're gonna have to face all these turrets and what in the world i guess he's got railgun turrets how are we supposed to prank him now and oh my gosh he's literally got them on like the second floor of his bunker yeah this looks really cool yeah they're super op but there's so many more traps on many floors and oh gosh he's got more traps and whoa wait what is this oh nothing it's just a wall i wouldn't want to walk through it if i were you and wait hold on this wall looks kind of suspicious are they ghost blocks and whoa what in the world whoa what the what is this whoa you get shot if you go through the Oh, yeah, this is a trap that activates whenever someone walks into the room. It's super OP. Oh, my gosh. That is insane. But, uh, wait, question. Uh, by any chance, how do you uh, deactivate it or, like, uh, bypass it, you know? Like, if you're trying to get through it. Uh, wait, why do you want to know that? And plus, uh, I don't even do that. Uh, this is just a trap. Uh, I This is, like, straight to your demise. And, oh, uh, nothing, nothing then. Uh, uh, let's just move on. All right, well, then follow me through the wall and down here to these buttons. And, whoa, wait, what are the buttons down there for? What the? Wait, there's so many. Uh, yeah, you. You have to find which one of them leads to riches, but there's also a bad one that leads to your demise. And, oh, gosh. What in the world? Uh, can I hit this one over here? Uh, yeah, if you want to hit them all, go ahead. Uh, okay. I feel like this is going to take a while, though. There's so many in here. Yeah, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to find the good one and hopefully not the bad one. And yeah, wait, let's just move on to the next floor. Yeah, well, that floor was kind of a prank and uh, this is just a troll face just to show that you got trolled. <laughs> no, wait, what? You call this a troll face? <laughs> um, This looks more like a cow. Well, look at it looks like a troll face and plus i didn't have much time to finish it up this is the last thing i built before i took out your fireball launcher yeah i'm not sure if this looks like a troll face oh i'll fix it later but that's all the floors i have right now uh, i'll end more later well your base is actually pretty cool but also pretty annoying to break into because all these turrets but uh yeah yeah it is annoying to break into why do you care uh, uh, nothing nothing and whoa wait what in the world is all this oh this is my airship area uh my entire base can fly away what the oh my gosh your base is awesome okay well uh i gotta get back to my base i gotta to start you know uh upgrading my base and stuff definitely and uh yeah that, that was a good tour thank you very much yeah i need to work on my base too see you later speaker man yeah have fun there's no way you're gonna have a better base than mine and, oh gosh oh gosh guys a speaker man's base is way too op we need to mess with him somehow uh, the, what, what do we do what mob can we morph into to prank him and wait a minute hold on what does this mob look like let's try him out and Oh my gosh. Okay, uh, this thing looks insane. Let's go ahead and kill him. And then we should have his morph now. So let me just go ahead and try morphing into him really quick. And okay, perfect. I think it's working, guys. Here we go. And oh my gosh, look at this. This is actually insane. Whatever this thing is should definitely be strong enough to get past all of Speaker Man's turrets. So what are we waiting for? Let's get down to business. All right, all right. So here, let's just go and sneak over here onto Speaker Man's building. Oh gosh, uh, guys, he's right over there. Oh gosh, oh gosh. I, I don't want to get caught too early. And okay, let's see, where is he going? And, oh, okay, he's right over there. Just come on, just go back in your house. All right, well, let me add my little chimney up here. This should make the house look so much better. And, wait, actually, never mind, guys. We don't even need him to be in his house for us to do this prank. Okay, let's just quickly sneak past him while he's working on his chimney. Come on, come on. Perfect. And all right, here we go, here we go. Now we need to sneak past all of those turrets. And all right, how are we gonna do this? Okay, those things look super scary. They're probably gonna detect me since I'm literally a mob right now, but... <gasps> Wait, I think I've got an idea. Let me quickly go ahead and grab a little bit of TNT and flint and steel. And let me just go ahead and mine this block right over here, right above the turrets. And okay, perfect. Here they are. The turrets are right here. And now I should just be able to put some TNT down there and blow it up. And quick, I need to cover it up. Come on, come on. Uh, wait, what was that noise? And, oh gosh, oh gosh. Uh, guys, hold on. I think he heard that. I need to hide over here in this empty room. Come on. Uh, what the heck happened? Uh, I heard a giant explosion. Uh, did something happen? What? No way. My turrets all got destroyed. Oh my God. Now I have to re build all of them. And wait, guys, I think it worked. Let's go. Okay, wait, hold on, hold on. I want to go and take a look at the damage here. I'm just going to quickly sneak past down here. Hopefully he doesn't see me. And oh my gosh, we did so much damage. This is awesome. But wait, while he's looking away, let's just go ahead and quickly uh, put another one there and light it and quick run, run, run. What the heck? No. Oh my gosh, this is so funny. 
Oh my gosh, my entire turrets just got destroyed. What the heck? And, oh gosh, oh gosh, I better get out of here. Um, okay, well, let's see, let's see. What can we do next? And oh, wait, I've actually got a really funny idea for a bridge. Since Speaker Man hasn't caught me yet, why don't we go ahead and just grab this one item called a model block? And I can just go ahead and place it down right over here. And using this model block, I can actually go ahead and make it look exactly like the mob that I morphed into. Look at that. Except it's not actually a real thing, it's literally just like a model block. So now whenever Speaker Man comes up his ladder and opens up this door, he's gonna see this thing and he's gonna get super terrified. But wait, I think we can actually move him even closer to the door. Let me just go ahead and change this guy's position really quick, just like this. And okay, yeah, now he's right up against the door. This is gonna be so funny. All right, well, anyways, now that that is set up, we should probably go hide somewhere. But before we do that, let me quickly go ahead and grab some of these security cameras. And I'm just gonna go ahead and place one right over here. That way we can see his reaction. This is actually gonna be so hilarious. So here, let's just go over here and hide inside of our head of operations right over here. Boom, there we go. And okay, let's start looking through the camera. And boom, my turrets are repaired and no TNT's gonna blow them out because they're blast proof now. And all right, let's go up here and let's get out our ass. And what the heck is that? I'll get away. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay, it looks like he noticed him. This is so funny. Come here, good dog. I will go away. And why are you not taking any damage? <laughs> and oh my gosh, he's trying to kill it, but he doesn't even realize that it's not even a real mob. It's just a block. Yeah, what are you doing? You go away. <laughs> Wait, are you serious? It didn't blow it up, but it blew up my doors. Are you kidding me? Did he, wait, did he just shoot a rocket launcher to try to get rid of it, but it blew up the doors and not the block? Oh my gosh, that is actually hilarious. Oh my gosh, what's that over there? And wait, it was just a block. It just destroyed like that. And wait, is that a camera? And Oh gosh, I, I, I think he noticed our camera. What do we do? Uh, who's spying on me? Uh, is someone pulling a prank on me? Uh, guys, are you getting pranked right now? And oh gosh, uh, he just broke the camera. Uh, wait, speaker man, what are you talking about? Uh, are you guys not getting pranked? Yeah, I don't know. Everything's been really weird today. Today. And wait, what do you mean? No, it hasn't. You know, everything's been pretty normal. Uh, you know, we've just been building our bases and all that. No, no, something feels off today. All of our houses have been getting destroyed. And wait, that's look out! The mobs on top of your house is gonna break you next! Wait, wait, oh gosh, I forgot I'm still morphed. Uh, oh, oh, thanks for the heads up, speaker man. And oh no, it looks like he's going into my house. And oh gosh, oh gosh, quick, I need to unmorph. Come on, come on. Wait, quick, quick, here. Let me just go ahead and morph back into my normal stuff. Come on, come on, hurry up. And okay, perfect. I'm good. Did you get him? And, uh, wait, what, what? Did you just blow up my door? What was that? Oh, well, I thought the mob was in here. I was gonna take him out. And, oh, no, don't worry about it. I already took it out with um, my OP sword. Yeah, he's gone. I dealt with it. I don't know why you didn't just, like, use your weapon on him. Uh, well, I did, and it was just a block. It wasn't, like, an actual person. And, oh, that's kind of weird. Uh, yeah, I mean, it was pretty wait, easy. What I just was took that it out you were just holding? And, wait, what? Oh, this thing? Uh, oh, oh, nothing, nothing. That's just, um, it's my plushie of Steve, my favorite character. What? That's so weird. Why are you acting so weird? Uh, all right, I guess I'll leave you to your little bad house. All right, I'm going back to my house. And Oh my gosh, dude, my house is not bad here. I gotta repair all of this since you blew it up with your rocket launcher. Speaking of houses, Dash, your house hasn't been pranked so far. And, uh, wait, what? What do you mean? Everyone else's houses got pranked except for yours. And, oh, uh, I guess I'm just really lucky or something. I don't know. Or maybe you guys just, like, aren't careful enough and you guys are, like, leaving your door open and mobs are sneaking in. Or maybe someone who knows how to, you know, sneak into our bases is sneaking into our bases. And, uh, dude, what are you saying here? Uh, nothing. Just the fact that you haven't gotten pranked and, uh, you know, us three have gotten pranked multiple times is saying something right now. Plus, human, you've barely made any progress on your base as well compared to us. And, well, what do you mean? No, I've made plenty of progress. Look, I finished my archer towers. Look, I've got these emerald bows and stuff. Yeah, but look at my dad's house. It's like 10 million times better than yours, and my mom's house is like 10 million times better than yours as well. Uh, well, you know, they're just better builders, okay? I'm not that good yet. You have grass floors. What do you mean? Hey, what? Okay, it doesn't matter what floors I have, okay? The mobs aren't gonna be even getting inside of my house, so the floors don't need to be strong. Uh, dude, just watch this. And uh, Wait, what are you doing? Hey, hey, no, come on. You can't dig a tunnel, okay? That's uh, that, Their mobs are not gonna do that. Uh, yeah, they will. No, they won't. Okay, just leave me alone. You know what? Here, I'll start upgrading my house. I'll repair the floor and all that if it makes you happy. Yeah, your house is looking kind of ugly. You should definitely do that. And what? My house is not looking ugly, okay? I may be missing a floor, but it still looks nice. Um, if you want to lie to yourself, sure. And oh my gosh, Speaker Rowan is being so mean. I think she should be our next prank target. But okay, what mob can we morph into? Uh, let me see. Let me quickly finish up this floor first. And come on, come on, quick. Let me just finish up this floor. There we go. Boom. Just like that. The floor is done. And all right, let's see. What type of mob can I prank 
speaker woman with this time. And wait a minute, hold on. I just got a really funny idea. What about a villager? Let me go ahead and grab a villager spawn egg and let me just grab his morph and what in the world? Wait, why does this guy have a name? Hold on. I just need to get a normal villager. Wait, why do they all have names? No, I want just a plain normal villager. And oh my gosh, they're all spawning in with names. And come on, come on. Can I please just get a normal one? And you, you know what? Forget it. Okay, I'll just get whichever one I can get. And okay, here, let's just go ahead and morph into this one. This one looks pretty normal. And okay, perfect. I am now a villager. All right, well, here, I actually have a really funny prank idea for Speaker Woman. So uh, let me just close my door really quick. And all right, let's head over. Oh, this hurt looks so good. And oh, uh, Speaker Woman, how's your house coming along? Oh, it's coming along just fine. And oh, yeah, nice. Good to hear. Wait, what's that pink box at the top of your tree house? Uh, nothing. That's a secret. And oh, uh, it is? Okay. And wait, what, guys? She has a secret box at the top of her house? Oh, gosh. Okay, well, we need to go find out what's inside of that thing. All right, well, let's go. Operation break into the big box is a go. Come on. And wait, Speaker Woman, uh, if it's a secret, uh, how do you get into it by any chance? Uh... That's also a secret. Why do you want to know? Uh, don't worry about it. I'm just trying to, like, make sure it's, like, super safe so none of the mobs can get in, you know? And, wait, guys, hold on. I think I found an entrance. There's literally just vines over here to go up. Uh, trust me, it's fine. And, a villager? What are you doing here? And, okay, perfect. It looks like she caught me. Uh, here, let me put down a sign for communication. Um, do you want to trade? Oh, trading? Oh, uh, that makes sense. You're a villager. Uh, what do you have to trade? And, uh, oh, gosh, I, I didn't think this far. Uh, what do I have to trade? Hold on, let me see. Um, and, wait. Guys, what if I trade her some rail mines and just tell her that they're like normal roller coaster rails? Pretty much these rail mines explode whenever you go on top of them. So, uh, here, let me grab some of those and let me put on another sign. Do you need any roller coaster parts? Um, hmm. I, I wasn't really thinking about it, but now that you said it, I guess that could be a fun addition for my house. And yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll be a really fun addition. It will be good for a house. Trust me. Okay, well, wh how much do I need to pay you? Uh, let me think, let me think. Uh, 64 dollars Diamonds for uh, 10 stacks of mines. I mean, I mean, uh, not mines, rails. Oh, okay, well then, here you go. And, oh, wait, she's just giving it to me? Okay, perfect. But, wait, guys, before I give these to her, uh, I need to rename them because I don't want to just give her something called rail mines. I need to rename them so they just look like normal mines. So, let me get an anvil really quick and, uh, hold on, let me put down a sign. Thank you. One second. We'll be right back. Oh, okay. Then uh, I'll see you in a sec then. And, uh, yeah, yeah. Just uh, don't come over here and quick. Let me grab, uh, what is it? I said 10 stacks of rail mines, right? So uh, let me just grab those really quick. Boom. There we go. That's 10 stacks. And wait, actually, I should probably name them first. So let me delete these ones really quick. Oh, gosh, guys, I'm throwing. Come on, come on, come on. And okay, here. Now let me just go into the anvil. And I'm just going to literally remove the word mine from them. So it just looks like rail. There we go. Perfect. And now let me multiply this. So we have 10 stacks. Perfect and okay, I got it. All right, all right. Uh, speaker one here. I got the goods. Uh, let me drop them all over there. There we go. Boom. There we go. Hey, okay, awesome. I'm gonna build a roller coaster now. Let's go. That actually worked. This is gonna be so funny. As soon as she actually goes onto the roller coaster with a minecart, it's all gonna blow up. And wait a minute, guys. While she's building the roller coaster, now's my opportunity to go check out what's inside of the pink box room. So, all right, here. I'm just gonna quickly sneak up over here and whoa. Wait, what in the world is all this? Whoa, wait. This looks like a crazy armory room. She's got so many weapons in here and wait what's inside of these chests and oh wait the chests are empty and whoa what the, this one is not oh my gosh there's so much stuff in here and wait what is that white chocolate waffle and dark chocolate bar oh gosh okay that is kind of unhealthy oh then i think i know what i need to do here i'm just gonna go ahead and replace these with some apples and boom there we go they have been replaced with normal apples i'm making the world healthier one step at a time guys guys come look i made a roller coaster oh yeah i'm definitely on my way oh yeah i'm on my way too and oh wait gosh she finished up the roller coaster uh, okay wait here i should probably just like uh, stand here and just look like a normal villager so that, you know, I can, like, watch. And wait, should we get Dash so he can see it? Oh, yeah, you're totally right. Dash, Dash, come on. And, uh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, guys, I didn't think about this. And wait, he's not in his house. Yeah, where is he? I'm looking everywhere and he's nowhere to be found. Is he in one of these archer towers? And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, guys, hold on. Wait, I need to do something. Uh, quick, let me just dig below my house. I have a plan. Uh, come on, come on. I just need to quickly dig out a little bunker. I can pretend like I was working on a bunker. That'll be like a perfect getaway story. Quick, let me just run this command slash slash one. Uh, he's nowhere in here, guys. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I gotta be quick. Come on, come on. Let me just select this position over here. And then, come on, I need to go over here and select another position over here. And let me set this to air. And oh gosh, now it's leaking. Come on, come on. I need to set the walls into some stone so that it looks nice. Come on, come on. 
There we go. And okay, now I need to set the roof really quick. Come on, quick. I need to make this look like a kind of believable bunker. I don't want it to look too sloppy. And come on. And okay, now that the bunker is done, uh, quick, let me go ahead and unmorph back into my normal self. Come on, come on. Why is this taking so long? And okay, there we go. Now quickly, let me dig up into my normal house. And oh, hi guys. Wait, what are you guys doing here? Uh, we want you to come check out the roller coaster. And wait, what are you doing down here? And, oh, oh, this is just my bunker. You know, I took a little bit of inspiration from uh, you and Speaker Baby. And you know, I figured I should build a bunker myself. Oh. Well, we were calling you and you weren't responding. And Oh, yeah, sorry. I was just too busy building my bunker, you know? I really wanted to make it look nice because you guys have been making fun of my build. Oh, you wanted to make it look nice? Well, that bunker is not good so far. Yeah, why'd you make it out of stone? And, hey, okay, I'm not the best at building bunkers, but wait, why were you guys calling me? What do you want me to check out? Oh, yeah, well, I made a roller coaster. Come on. And, oh, you did? All right, well, uh, let's check it out. This thing looks sick. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Is everybody ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Okay, let me just put this here. And, ah! and, uh, wait, what? Did it just explode? What the? My tree house! Everything just got exploded! Whoa, wait, up uh, speaker one. Are you sure you built a roller coaster right? What the? What, how did that happen? What? It must have been that villager. He gave me these rails. Wait, these don't look like normal rails. They're called rail mines. And, wait, whoa, whoa, wait. Rail mines? What the? Wait, why'd you build a roller coaster out of rail mines? Well, there was a villager in my house, and he bought it from him. It was a good deal. Wait, a villager? Wait, let's go see where this guy's at. And Wait, what? A villager? And uh, the, he's probably gone by now. I don't think you guys should go look for him. Wait, why don't you want us to go look for the villager? Oh, well, I'm just saying he's probably gone now, and, you know, that's probably a waste of time. We should focus on building our houses. Well, each time I try to focus on building something goes wrong hmm, maybe I, I wonder if he messed with anything else wait what were my white chocolate bars replaced with apples and wait what your chocolate bars are replaced with apples uh, wait do you think the villager did this yeah i had a bunch of stuff in here but now it's all replaced with ew healthy apples and wait he did you a favor he made it healthier that is not a favor he took all the good stuff wait why are you on his side uh, what dude who would it be on his side come on you everyone knows apples are healthier than chocolate yeah but still chocolate's op for fighting what chocolate is not op for fighting all it does is make you slower and worse at fighting okay remember everyone needs to eat healthy what no but it tastes good and, uh, no dude come on everyone knows apples are better it's kind of weird that you keep siding with the villager but whatever and yeah guys come on we should all get back to building our houses and uh speaker one you might want to get rid of these rail mines uh i'm not sure if you want the rest of your stuff to blow up yeah i think you're right all right well i'm gonna keep on working on my base then all right sounds good uh here i'm gonna go ahead and keep working on my bunker because uh, you guys were making fun of it and i need to make it look better so here let me just add a ladder really quick and uh yeah there we go now this is starting to look like a real bunker you should probably add some armor to your bunker instead of just having it be like a random box and yeah dude that's exactly what i'm doing right now this is going to be the most epic bunker armory room ever and all right let's see what type of armor can i put on it and oh wait what about some of this uh the purple armor it's called the amethyst armor okay yeah i'll definitely grab a little bit of this and here let me just go ahead and put it on all the armor stands and boom this is gonna be so awesome all right well anyways that's enough of actual building it's time to get back to pranking and guys i have a perfect idea for what i can do next now for pretty much all the other pranks i've been doing i've been morphing it something like a super scary mob or a villager, but what if I morph into the most unsuspecting mob ever? And that is a chicken because, guys, if I morph into a chicken, no one's gonna suspect that, like, it can do anything bad. They're just gonna think that it's, like, a normal mob. So, here, let me just go ahead and morph into it really quick. Boom! And, okay, we are converting into a chicken. Let's go! And, alright, anyways, now that I'm a chicken, I should be able to get away with a lot more stuff since, you know, I, no one's gonna suspect anything from me. So, here, let's go check out what Speaker Baby's up to. We haven't spied on him in a while and, whoa, wait, since I'm a chicken, I have, like, slow fall. That's kind of cool. Anyways, uh, Speaker baby how's it going how's your uh, house coming along oh it's going pretty good but i'm making a sky base right now and whoa wait you're making a sky base that sounds pretty cool uh wait how's your bunker going you made any upgrades here and whoa wait this area looks sick uh, wait you're in my base right now and, uh, no, no, no 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 i'm not in your base I, I was talking about my bunker i just made like a really cool change to my bunker and now it looks really cool oh, what did you do uh, uh i put um the uh, armor on the walls yeah yeah that's what i did oh i guess that's pretty cool yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's really cool and okay guys it looks like he still got this prize possession chest over here wait did he even notice what i did over here and <laughs> it's still wooden swords i don't think he noticed yet all right well anyways here let's see what type of prank could we pull on him here and wait i got a really good idea what if i replace some of these chests over here with some trap chests and then make them explode whenever he opens them so here let me go ahead and grab some trap chests really quick and let me just go ahead and replace this chest over here and i should probably replace this bottom chest over here as well there we go and now here i'm pretty sure if i go ahead and put like something that i can power with red 
redstone over here, and then I open the chest. It should power it. And wait, what? It didn't power it? Why? Hold on. Maybe I need to put a repeater down over here. Here, let me try this out. And what? That didn't work either. Okay, how do you even use trap chests? Hold on. I haven't used these in a while. Maybe I need to go ahead and put something over here. Will this work? And okay, guys, did you see that? The redstone lamp lit up. Okay, that means that we're getting power. So let me try putting a repeater here instead. And okay, perfect. The repeater is getting powered as well. Anyways, now that I've got an actual power source that works, we can just go ahead and put a bunch of TNT over here inside of the walls just like that. Boom, there we go. And now let me go ahead and cover all of this up and perfect. The next time Speaker maybe opens up one of these trap chests, it's gonna blow a huge hole in his wall. Well, anyways, I think that's enough pranking for Speaker Ruby here. Let's go see what we can do with Speaker Man. We haven't checked up on him in a while. And wait, guys, before we go over and prank Speaker Man, I've actually got an idea. What if I just go ahead and put a model block of myself inside of my house? That way it looks like I'm just working on my house because Speaker Man's been getting very suspicious of me lately. I think he's like the most suspicious out of everyone. So here, let me go ahead and grab one of these model blocks really quick and I'm just gonna place it up here on my archer tower. And okay, perfect. Now we've got a model block that looks like me here. Let me just go ahead and rotate it so that it looks like it's looking at the chest. And okay, perfect. This is gonna be a perfect cover up for any more pranks I do. But anyways, now I think it's time to head over to Speaker Man's house. Hey, Speaker Man, uh, any changes to your house? Uh, yeah, I have a camera system. And wait, was that a chicken just walking into my base? And, oh, what? He's got a camera system. Oh my gosh. Uh, wait, there's a chicken walking into your base? What are you talking about? And guys, come on. We just gotta act like a normal chicken. Oh, yeah, there's like a chicken outside of my base. Uh, what the heck is wrong with this chicken? And, wait, what are you talking about? What's he doing? Uh, I'm pretty sure it's just the chicken, dude. I think you're overreacting. Uh, no, it's just walking in circles and staring at my cameras. Wait, it's staring at your cameras? Oh, maybe it like wants to know what it is. And oh my gosh, guys, we need to get rid of this. Hold on. I need to go ahead and pull out a rocket launcher. I know what to do. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with this chicken. It just keeps looking at my cameras. And, okay, guys, it's time. Boom! Wait, it just shot a rocket at it. Ha, <laughs> chicken! Don't you know I have blast proof cameras? And, wait, but he's got blast proof cameras? What in the world? Oh my gosh, but okay, that was kind of suspicious how a chicken just pulled out a rocket launcher. Well, okay, what do we do? How do we get rid of this camera? We can't just like sneak into his house when he has cameras. Wait, how did a chicken get a rocket launcher? I don't know. This is so weird. Oh my gosh, how are we supposed to get rid of that camera? And oh, wait, guys, I've got an idea. I'm pretty sure there's a type of potion that pretty much just gives you like extended reach. So here, let me go ahead and search for extend it. And okay, perfect. Potion of extension. This is what we need. I'm pretty sure if I go ahead and drink one of these, I should be able to reach the camera from all the way up here. So let me just drink that. And oh my gosh, look, I can actually reach the blocks all the way from here now. Okay, well, anyways, now it's time to just go and boom, break the camera. There we go. What? My camera just broke. How did it break? And wait, what? Your camera broke? Oh, I'm pretty sure those like break after uh, like 10 minutes of being used. I think they have like a 10 minute runtime. But anyways, here, now let me go ahead and head inside. Come on, come on. Oh gosh, she's got more cameras in here. Quick, let me break those. Oh my gosh, my cameras at my entrance just broke. And oh, wait, that's kind of weird. It seems like your camera system is shutting down. Are you sure you uh, like put batteries in the cameras and everything? Maybe the batteries died? I don't know. That's kind of weird. I guess I'll put some new batteries in them later. And, oh my gosh, this is actually perfect. I can't believe he fell for that. All right, well, here, let's just keep heading down. And, okay, it looks like he repaired all of these. And, oh gosh, wait, I need to break these as well. There we go. Looks like he repaired all his turrets, though. But I guess it should be fine since now, technically, we're not a mob and we're a chicken. So I don't think the turrets can target us, which is perfect. And anyways, here, let's just keep going down. And, okay, he's got his trap over here. And, oh my gosh, he's got so many cameras. We need to get rid of these. Let's see what's on this next floor. And, oh my gosh, why is there cameras literally on every floor? Okay, let's just keep going down. Come on. And, oh, this is his troll face. And, oh gosh, okay, let's break these as well. And, uh, wait, what in the world is this floor over here? Are those more turrets? What in the world? All right, well, let's just keep going down. I want to see all the new floors that he added. And, whoa, he's got like an armory room over here. Let's see. And, whoa, what in the world is this room? I don't even know, but let's just keep going. And, oh. I've been waiting for you. Get out of here. Oh, go here. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I gotta run. Come here, you stupid chicken. I'm gonna get you. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Oh, oh, wait. Oh, my gosh. She's got like a nuclear ray. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I gotta go. And, oh, my gosh. Ah, he's still chasing me. Oh, gosh. I gotta fly away. Go, go, go. You're not going away that easy. Come here. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Wait. I accidentally went one floor too high. Come on. Come on. I need to go. Oh, go, go, go. He's literally chasing me with a laser. Ah, run. That's it. You better scram. Now I've got to replace my cameras. And, oh, my gosh. Good thing I was in creative mode and don't take any damage. That could have been a bad one. Oh, wait. Dash, are you okay? And, wait. What? Uh, speaker, Owen? Uh, what's going on? Uh, you just been standing still and staring at that chest for a while. And, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's because I'm putting stuff inside of the chest. Uh, don't, don't worry about it. Uh, I'm just, like, loading up the chest. Oh, uh, okay, I guess. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, guys. I forgot about the model block that I put over here. Quick, let me just go ahead and get rid of this. And here, let me go ahead and unmorph. And, uh, yes, yeah, Speaker, Owen, look, it's just me. I, I finished putting stuff inside of the chest. Now the chest is all fully loaded up. Oh, that's good. I was worried for you for a sec, but, uh, I guess keep 
doing what you're doing. And yeah, I will. And oh my gosh, that was a close one. I gotta be more careful about that stuff. I almost forgot about this model block I put here. Wow, I can't believe that my house is so much better than your guys' is. And wait, what? No, it's not. My house is obviously better. And wait, what did you even build? And whoa, what the? Are you building like a double decker cake up here? Actually, it's gonna be a triple decker. And wait, how did you just break that block from so and, far? Uh, uh, no, no, nothing. I didn't do that. Uh, don't worry about that. And oh gosh, guys, here, I need to go ahead and drink some milk so that I can get rid of all of my effects. Come on. Oh, wait, what the? The heck are you drinking? Why are you drinking milk? And, oh, the milk? God, it just tastes really good, you know? Ew, no, it doesn't. Well, what do you mean it's good? And it's like good for your bones and stuff, I'm pretty sure. Uh, no, don't you know it's not good for your bones? It's actually like bad for you. And uh, it is. Uh, okay, well, it's fine. It doesn't matter. But uh, whoa, yeah, speaker baby, your house looks really nice. Uh, how do you get in? Oh, well, this is the sky base and you have to get in from this little water tower. Ooh, that's a really cool entrance. Let me go up. Whoa, yeah, this is pretty awesome. And wait, what do you even have up here? Uh, right now, nothing because I'm working on actually getting it all built first, but I'm gonna have a bunch of defenses up here. Let's go! Our houses are actually looking so decked out now! Yeah, everyone except for yours. Yeah, your house looks pretty. Wait, hold on, are those the mobs? Oh gosh, uh, guys, I think the mobs are here! Quick, everyone head to your house! They're gonna be released soon! Oh, I'm going down to my bunker! Oh yeah, I gotta go to my bunker to get my prize possessions. And uh, yeah, yeah, same here! Come on, I gotta head to my bunker really quick and grab my armor and... Wait a minute, guys. Why don't I go ahead and morph into the mob? That'll be so funny! Wait, what the heck? What happened to my blasters? Why are they all wooden swords now? And, oh, wait, your blasters turn into wooden swords? Oh, I'm pretty sure they do that after they sit in a chest for a while. But anyways, guys, here, let me just quickly go ahead and sneak over here into the mob area while I'm still in creative mode. Come on, come on. And, okay, let me fill in this fence over here. And, okay, what in the world even is this mob? I don't even know what this thing is. It's so massive. But here, I guess let me go ahead and get rid of it. And, oh, there we go. And, okay, now I should have the morph unlocked for it and all right i should be morphed into it now and oh my gosh it actually worked look at me this thing is actually massive what in the world well anyways i guess now we just have to wait for the gate to open up and then we can do a bunch of crazy pranks okay is everybody ready i think they're gonna be released soon yeah i'm ready i'm down in my bunker and i've got all my op armor on and i am so ready to destroy everybody and yeah guys i'm ready as well i can't wait to destroy these mobs little do they know i am the mob yeah guys i'm ready and wait the gate just opened and, oh guys the gate just opened it's time all right let's go and wait i'm pretty sure this mob can also fly so here we go let's go okay come here oh no he's flying and <laughs> let's go this is so funny they don't even know it's me ah, nuclear ray come here and, wait, what, is he trying to shoot his nuclear ray at me and oh, oh gosh oh gosh okay i gotta just keep dodging that and wait hold on guys let me go ahead and grab a rocket launcher really quick and let's go take that oh my gosh he's shooting missiles here i'm gonna use my lmg uh, dash come out here now Gus, come on and, wait, and, and, guys i'm not coming on that thing is way too scary i'm hiding in my bunker and, oh gosh oh gosh i forgot to put like a fake model block for myself or something come on dash come on you have to help uh you guys can get it low and everything i'll help later when he's at like half health uh, fine i guess we'll fight it and let's go perfect all right well let's just keep shooting these rockets i guess let's go this is actually so funny and wait i'm gonna start blowing up the bases let's go no not my tree house <laughs> let's go this is actually so funny wait i think these blocks are reinforced so you can't even destroy it and, what he has reinforced blocks for his cake oh my gosh what in the world well, what can i destroy giant explosive ball coming towards the toilet let's go and, wait, what the oh gosh and, wait he missed it he shot speaker woman's house <laughs> speaker man you just blew up my house I don't think your house matters right now. Let's get rid of this toilet. And wait, what in the world is that weapon he's using? That thing is insane. Hold on, I need to grab one of those as well. I'm pretty sure it's called the TFG. And okay, there it is. Perfect. All right, let's go. It's copying my ammo. Oh my gosh, this weapon is actually insane. Let's go. And all right, come here, speaker man. You're going down first. Oh my gosh, with my OP armor, he does no damage to me. And okay, that's it. I'm going for his house. Let's go. I'm shooting these rockets inside of his house. Come on. I get away from my house. And wait, why is he not targeting the human? house. And, uh, wait, oh, he's right about that. Hold on, I need to blow up my house as well so I don't look suspicious. Come on. Wait, watch out, Dash! And, oh, gosh, uh, guys, I hear explosions above my house. Is everything all right? Can you guys defend my house? Uh, yeah, we're trying to defend your house, but, uh, we can't really do much. Why don't you come out and help defend it? I'm too scared. This mob is way too scary. I'm staying in my bunker. Oh, my gosh, how much health does this toilet have? That being such a scaredy cat, get out of here and help us! Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, I need to do something quick or else they're just gonna keep asking me to come out. Okay, what do I do? I need to get bigger weapons. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, let me see. Are there any better rocket launchers and whoa wait this one looks pretty crazy let me pull this out and wait what i'm pretty sure this one requires a, like another rocket so come on come on let me see what type of rocket can i use and whoa wait okay there's a lot of missiles here wait what about this antimatter missile okay i'm pulling this out come on come here toilet you're going down and, all right guys i think it's time here i'm just gonna shoot this down in the middle of the arena come on come on here we go was that a nuke and oh whoa. my gosh 
Uh, guys, I think that rocket was a little bit too powerful. Wait, you guys are still alive? Hey! Oh, no! Oh, it's over. And, oh, they just fell into the void. GG's. <laughs> that was pretty funny. Wait, Dash, how did you survive? Uh, where are you? Oh, well, I may have a little secret for you guys. Wait, why is the toilet getting closer? Oh, my gosh, run away. Wait, wait, no, guys, guys, don't run, don't run. What if I told you that I am the toilet? Yo! Oh, my gosh, I knew this. What? No way! Wait, how are you the toilet? Wait, what? Pranking us the whole time? Yep, that was me. I was pranking you guys this whole time as mobs. <laughs> I knew it. Wait, so you're the one that got rid of my house? And uh, yeah, that was me. I got rid of everyone's house. Oh my gosh, human! Uh, get over here. I'm getting payback. And Abby, get away from me! Today we're playing Build to Survive, but we have elemental powers. Hey guys, check me out. I've got the element of Earth. And, whoa, what the? That is so epic. And guys, check it out. I got electricity. And, whoa, that is awesome. But guys, check me out. I got the elemental fire. Let's go. Uh, but guys, we probably don't have much time till the moss spawn in, so we better get to building. And, yeah, yeah, you're right here, guys. Come on, we gotta start building our bases. And hmm, what should I start building my base out of? Let me see. Mm, I don't know, but I'm gonna make mine an underground base. It's gonna look super awesome. And wait, what? You're building an underground base? <gasps> that gives me an idea. I'm gonna do the exact opposite of that, and I'm gonna go ahead and build a sky base. This is gonna be so epic. And oh wait, hold on. I need to get some purple concrete really quick. And let's go. I'm gonna start building. What? Only purple concrete? Not even reinforced? That that could be. Exploded by TNT, you and, know. Oh, yeah, that's probably a good idea. Let me go ahead and grab some reinforced purple concrete so that's gonna be much stronger. And here, let me just go ahead and replace all of it with this. But wait, Speaker Man, what are you building? Oh, yeah, I'm building a sky base too. It's gonna be so epic. And, whoa, you are? Well, sky bases are way worse than underground bases. And uh, the wait, what? Underground bases seem weak because the mobs are gonna be on like the same level as you. For a sky base, though, we're gonna be way above the mobs. It's gonna be so much better. Yeah, we can't have stuff raining down on them. It's gonna be so OP. Exactly. No, I don't know what you're talking about. Underground bases are way better. I'm gonna build a bunch of traps underneath my base. Uh, okay. Well, that's kind of weird, but I guess we'll see which base survives better when the mobs come. But anyways, here, I gotta focus on building my sky base. I'm just gonna go ahead and build, like, a little box here for the foundation. And then I can go ahead and start building the sky base on top of it. Oh, yeah. I just gotta make the stand for my build. And all right, let's start heading up now. This is gonna look so cool. And oh, wait, you're already heading up. I'm about to start heading up in just a moment. I just gotta go ahead and finish up the foundation. And then I'm gonna start building up as well. It's gonna be so lit. Yeah, but neither of those is gonna be better than my base. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll see about that. But anyways, here, there we go. My foundation is done here. I should probably go ahead and add a door really quick. So let me just go ahead and grab an oak door. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put down two right over there. And now it's time to go ahead and start building the sky base. So I'm gonna go ahead and put down two ladders. One for going up and one for going down. And wait a minute. Instead of building a ladder, why don't I go ahead and use a water elevator? This is gonna be so much faster than a ladder. All I have to do is go ahead and put some glass around all of it just like this. And then I can go ahead and put some soul sand down at the bottom and then fill the entire thing up with some water and okay now when i go in here i should go up and wait what why isn't it working uh, are you sure you built it right uh you have to build them in a certain way and wait what you do okay you know what forget this i'm just gonna use ladders okay how about instead of using normal ladders though i'm gonna go ahead and use some of these awesome looking ones but here let me go ahead and get rid of all this water stuff first see yours is not even working this is why the underground is way better and what just because my little water elevator thing isn't working doesn't mean that underground bases are better my base is still gonna be so much better i just gotta add all of these ladders over here and now let me go ahead and start building the sky base part and whoa what the uh, wait speaker man what in the world are you doing to your build uh, i'm making a globe since i'm the earth elemental and, whoa, wait okay that actually makes sense at first i thought this was like one of those game controllers you know with like the box at the bottom and then the big circle thing on top what a game controller what how does this look anything like a game controller i'm literally building earth <laughs> what dude if you look at it from the side over here it looks exactly like one of those game controller things you'd find it in an arcade machine or something well i'm not fully done with my build just give it some time it's gonna look so epic all right all right and i'm not gonna lie so far it actually is looking pretty epic i gotta catch up and wait speaker one how's your build coming along um uh, my build is coming along great i just need to dig out more of this area okay okay and anyways here i just gotta keep building higher and then i think i've already got a banger idea for what i can do for my first trap i just gotta build this thing super high up in the air uh, dude why are you building so slow you know you have a magic wand that lets you build faster right oh yeah right i can just use commands here let me just go ahead and grab a magic wand really quick and just select all of this. There we go. And then I can just go ahead and do the command slash slash stack two and okay, perfect. There we go. Now my ladder is 
tall enough. Now I'm gonna go ahead and start building the actual base of my base. All right, well, I'll leave you to do that. I've still got a lot of earth to build. And whoa, yeah, your base is actually starting to look really cool. And oh, wait, are you building Antarctica up here? Yeah, but you're also kind of wrong. Uh, Antarctica's on the bottom. And wait, what's the one at the top then? Wait, is that the North Pole? Uh, yeah, the North Pole's on the top. Antarctica's on the bottom. Oh, okay, I didn't know that. But anyways, here, I just gotta finish building like this little room up here. This is gonna be the main part of my base. So let me just go ahead and line everything up correctly. And okay, this is starting to look pretty good so far. Yeah, well, my build is also coming together. I just need to decorate it a little bit more. And wait, what? You're already decorating? Uh, shouldn't we like focus on building defenses now and decorating later since, you know, it is built to survive, not built to uh, look good? Uh, clearly you don't know what you're talking about. Mine's gonna be the best one of them all. Okay, okay. I guess we'll see about that. But anyways, here, let me just finish building this little platform up here and boom. Okay, now the start of my sky base is done. And anyways, I think it's time I add the first trap. So let me go ahead and grab a little bit of lava. And since I have the fire elemental, I'm gonna go ahead and surround my entire base with lava. So here, let me go ahead and put some lava down like this. And wait, 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 hold on. Before this lava flows to the bottom, I need to go ahead and uh, just build like a little collection system down here just to make sure it doesn't overflow or anything. And yeah, okay, this is looking good. I just need to build this around my entire base. Oh yeah, my base is coming along super nicely. I'm using the globe as a place to put all my OP items. And oh yeah, right, because you still have the inside of the globe. <gasps> hey, wait, is that gonna be like your head of operations area? That seems sick. Yep, and I'm gonna have a secret plan in here and I'm gonna become an evil villain. I mean, uh, nothing. And uh, wait, 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 what did you say? Uh, nothing, don't worry about it. I'm just gonna build a really awesome globe and totally not do anything evil. Uh, okay, all right. Well, anyways, here, let me go ahead and just finish surrounding my base with this lava. This is gonna look so cool once all the lava is done flowing down. It's already starting to look pretty sick, but wait, how am I supposed to get inside? Oh, wait, hold on. I need to do something about the door in a second. Let me just put all the lava there. There we go. And, um, okay. How am I supposed to stop the lava from going through the door? Let me think think. And I guess I can just go ahead and like grab some magma blocks or something and just like place them around. But then the lava is going to flow the other way. Actually, well, let's try this out. This might work. All right. All right. Come on. Moment of truth. Let's see. Wait, hold on. Actually, I need to place two things of magma blocks over here. And oh gosh, oh gosh, the lava is overflowing. Uh, um... Whoa, what? Is your base made out of lava? And wait, no, no, no. My base isn't made out of lava here. If you just fly through this really quick, you can see that there's a bunch of empty space here. This is just for looks. And you know, the mobs aren't going to be able to get through this. Whoa, that's crazy. But isn't it going to to set everything on fire. And, uh, no, it's fine because my entire base is made out of reinforced concrete, so it can't even burn. Oh, okay. I guess that's pretty cool, but not cooler than my base. Just you wait. And wait, can I take a look at your base? What did you even build? What? It's not done yet. And, okay, 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 fine. Here, I'll go ahead and continue working on my base here. I just gotta go ahead and make this front area look a little bit nicer, and, uh, oh gosh, oh gosh, the lava's flowing again. I need to put more stuff there, and, okay, I think this should be good, and let me go ahead and place a little bridge over here to get in, and, wait, I shouldn't make it out of magma blocks because those are gonna burn you, so I should just put some grass here. There we go. And boom, there we go. The main part of my base is complete. Oh, wait, you're done with your base. I'm definitely coming to check this out. And whoa, this looks awesome. And yeah, I know it looks pretty good, but I'm not done yet. I'm just done like the base of my base, but I still got a lot of work to do here. Let me go ahead and start building the next part. I'm gonna go ahead and build the next part out of some of this purple stained glass. It's gonna look sick. All right, I'm definitely coming back here to check this out, but I've got more globe to build. And yeah, how's your globe coming along? I see you finished the outside, I think. Oh yeah, it's a uh, great. Uh, don't come in here. Wait, what? Why not? Uh, because I said so. Uh, okay. All right. Well, anyways, here, I'm gonna go ahead and finish up building the walls of my main room up here. There's gonna be, like, my head of operations right here. This is where I'm gonna be able to see all the mobs and what they're doing and everything, and it's gonna be so lit. Just you wait, guys. I'm gonna build the best armory ever. And, whoa, but you're building an armory? That's actually a pretty good idea, but here, I just gotta go ahead and finish up this room up here, and then I'm gonna start building some defenses as well. Yeah, but there's no way you'll build a better armory than me, especially since mine's underground. What? What does that have to do with anything? My above-ground armory is gonna be way better than your underground ground one. But anyways, now that I've got my little room up here done, I can go ahead and start building some more defenses. So, hmm, what should I build next? And <gasps> wait a minute. I just got a really good idea. What if I go inside of my base over here and just put a bunch of arrow dispensers that just shoot stuff out through the lava? That way the arrows are gonna catch on fire and then hit the mobs. It's gonna be so awesome. Oh, that does sound awesome. I, I should build something with my laboratory that makes my globe shoot a missile. And wait, what? You have a laboratory inside of your globe? Uh, yeah, uh, don't come in here. Uh, there's a bunch of uh, really uh, nerdy stuff going on. Yeah, it's very nerdy. Uh, okay, I guess I'll leave you to that. But anyways, here, I'm just putting down all of the dispensers for my little arrow shooter. It's gonna be so awesome. In fact, I'm gonna make all these arrow dispensers go all the way up over here, and then I'm just gonna have, like, a bunch of arrows shoot out of my base. It's gonna be so cool. Oh, no, it's leaky. 
leaking. Ugh. And wait, what? The what's leaking? What are you talking about? Oh, nothing. Just some of the lava I'm placing is leaking, but it's okay. I fixed it. And oh, that's pretty unfortunate. But anyways, I'm making pretty good progress on my arrow shooters right now. It's looking so epic. I just gotta go ahead and put some more down, and then it should be pretty much done. And wait, before I go ahead and start laying down the next layer of dispensers, let me go ahead and just connect all of these ones to some observers really quick so that I can power them. And you'll see how this is gonna work. This is gonna be really awesome. I just gotta put all these observers over here just like this. Hey, be careful. I can see your arrows. They're hitting my base. And wait, what? Are they already shooting? Oh, yeah, right, because I forgot the observers, like, shoot once. But wait, what? Oh, yeah, I guess they did. Oh, uh, hey, wait. Some of them hit my base, too. And Oh, yeah, they did. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, I just got to go ahead and uh, place a few more of these, and then it should be done, though. Don't worry. Uh, okay, just keep yourself out of my base. And, uh, okay, I'll try, but it might take a moment. Uh, they are currently shooting a lot. Hey, cut it out. They're on fire, and they're coming to the South Pole. And uh, I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. I, you know, I'll just be like five minutes. Okay, give me five minutes and this will all be done. Uh, fine, five minutes. That's all you get. And yeah, yeah, just give me five minutes and then this will all be done. But anyways, here, I just need to put a few more observers over here. And now, wait, hold on. Uh, Speakerman, can you do me a favor really quick? Uh, yeah, what do you need? Uh, okay, just follow me right inside of the lava right over here. And let me go ahead and grab a lever really quick. And here, you see this lever right over here? Just go ahead and flick it when I tell you to. Uh, okay, I'm getting ready. And okay, okay, go ahead and flick it in three, two, one, go for it. Let's see how this does. And oh my gosh, that worked so perfectly. All of the dispensers fired arrows. Let's go. Oh yeah, that's super awesome. But wait, hey, did you fire any arrows at my South Pole? And you did. And, uh, no, I didn't. Technically you did because you're the one who flicked the lever. So uh, you just fired your own arrows at the South Pole. Uh, potato, tomato, you still built the machine. Yeah, yeah, but I wasn't the one who fired the arrows. So uh, I'm going back inside of my lava. Oh my gosh. Well, keep your arrows away from my globe. And okay, okay, I'll try my hardest, but uh, I can't promise anything. But anyways, now let me just go ahead and select all this and then run the commands slash slash stack really quick and now i should have two rows of dispensers oh, this is actually so sick and wait what did they just fire again hey stop it and okay okay i'm sorry i was just testing it hey stop they're landing on my house too and, whoa wait i see going a lot of them did land on your house okay i'm sorry about that maybe you should build like a wall next to your house and my house or something maybe you should watch it hey okay i'm just building some defenses but anyways here i just need to go ahead and run this command a few more times let's try slash slash stack four and okay now i have my dispensers going all the way up here Oh my gosh! It just fired so many arrows! Uh, wait, Speaker Man, you might want to take a look at the mob area really quick. Oh my gosh, it's covered in arrows! What the heck? Uh, I think I may have did slash slash that. Oh, uh, don't look at the side of your earth, please. Oh, uh, what the heck? You just took out, like, so many countries! Uh, dude, you need to, like, get rid of these. Uh, I think I just committed several war crimes by doing that. Wait, what country is this over here? Uh, I don't know. I'm pretty sure this is, like, uh, North America or something. And, oh gosh, uh, alright, well, yeah, I think I may have put a few too many dispensers in here. I guess let me just go ahead and slash slash undo this. Why do you need that many on my side anyway? Just point them towards where the mobs are. And yeah, but what if the mobs like go over here? You know, you can never be too sure. It's not like they're always gonna be over here in front of the base. Oh, well, don't worry about my base because I have some awesome plans that are gonna be super awesome. And okay, okay. I guess I'll leave you to it. But anyways, here, I guess let me just go ahead and slash slash stack this only two times. So uh, there we go. We can just have it be like three blocks tall, just like that. And now let me just go ahead and connect all all of these with some observers so that I can power all of them with one lever flick and boom. Okay, now they all should be powered. Uh, wait, Speaker Man, can you test this thing for me again? Uh, I made some updates. Uh, sure, I'll test it, I guess. And hey, you still got them pointing at my globe. And, yeah, yeah, okay. I didn't say I was gonna change it. Uh, just don't worry about it. Uh, just like flick that lever when I tell you to, okay? All right, I'm ready. All right, all right, here. Let me go ahead and get a good view. And whoa, there are literally arrows everywhere. And okay, go ahead and do it now. All right, I'm flicking it in. There we go. And, Did oh, that do anything? Oh my gosh, that looks so awesome. Okay, wait, Speaker Man, you have to check it out here. Let me go ahead and flick it. And uh, are you watching? Uh, yeah, I'm watching. Wait, 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 wait for me. I'm coming. And, oh, wait, you want to watch as well? All right. Uh, just let me know when you're here and I'll flick the lever. All right, I'm here. And okay, okay, here. I'm about to flick the lever in three, two, one. Let's check this out. What do you guys think? Oh my gosh. This is going to take out so many mobs. Hey, it's going to go on my house. And, oh, yeah, sorry about that. But hey, you know, in case there's any mobs on top of your house, uh, it'll get rid of them. So uh, I pretty much just did you a favor there. Uh, I doubt any of them are going on my roof. Yeah, but, yeah, but what if they fly? You know, uh, that's going to be a problem. I've just accepted the arrows. He's put so many on my globe. And um, yeah, I'm sorry about that. Uh, but it's fine here. Uh, let's get back to upgrading our houses. What defenses have you guys built? Oh, yeah, I have like 
all the defenses, uh, like all of them. And wait, what, what do you mean by all of the defenses? D just a lot, like a lot. And can I check them out? That sounds pretty interesting. No, 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 no. You have to get over there. Uh, they're not done yet. Uh, okay. Uh, you better have something really cool though when I actually check out your base. But anyways, I gotta build my next defense. I guess the first thing I should probably do is go ahead and make this room up here like a little control room. So let me go ahead and put down a lever over here just like that. Or wait, actually, I should go ahead and use a button instead. Let me grab this button. There we go. Or actually, wait, no, I changed my mind. A lever is cooler. What? Did you just change your mind four times to lever to button, back to lever, back to le button, and then uh, again? I don't know what you just done. Uh, don't worry about it. But anyways, now that I've got my lever here, I'm pretty sure I can go ahead and, uh, wait, how do I use this again? I think I need to go ahead and, like, put some redstone over here or something. And wait, hold on. Is this gonna work? And Okay, yeah, the redstone got powered, but now how do I use that power? Can I, like, do this? And wait, uh, that's not working. Wait, maybe I have to use a repeater. Uh, let me grab that really quick and put that there. And <gasps> Okay, perfect, that worked. Okay, now I can go ahead and connect this redstone to that observer down there, and then I'll be able to control my dispensers from all the way up here. Uh, that was a lot of words, and I got, like, none of them. It's fine, I wasn't talking to you anyways, but here, I gotta go ahead and just connect this really quick. Come on, and- Okay, this should be connected. Let me just- Oh, wait, hold on. I need to put another block over there. Boom, there we go. And now I just gotta bring this redstone signal all the way down over here, and- Wait, is it gonna reach? And- Oh my gosh, I'm literally one block too short. Okay, I need to put a repeater somewhere here. Uh, let me see. Where can I put a repeater? And, um, I guess I can just go ahead and, like, make room for one over here. And there we go! That should work! And, oh, wait, I'm sorry. I just fired another round of arrows at you guys. Uh, there's nothing I could do. There's no point of fighting. Hey! <laughs> All right, but anyways, let me go ahead and put down a sign over here saying activate dispensers. And boom, now I've got my first trap complete. Well, actually, my second trap, if you count the lava wall as a trap. Oh, yeah, I just set up my first trap, too. Uh, you guys want to come check it out? And, oh, of course I do. Wait, hold on. Let me see. What did you build? Uh, nothing. Just come over to my base. Yeah, but make sure you're walking instead of flying. And, uh, okay. And uh, wait, why is there, like, a big hole in your floor? Oh, don't worry about that. Uh, just make sure, you know, walk into the base instead of flying to it. Wait, why do we need to walk? Ah! Oh, wait. That's why you need to walk. <laughs> Did you put ghost blocks here? What the? Oh, my gosh. Wait, Speaker Woman literally fell out of the world. What the? She has creative flight. Why did she fall all the way down there? She could have stopped herself. Hey, that was not nice. Why'd you make us walk over that? Well, it's a trap. What did you expect it to be? And yeah, wait, you could have just flown out. Why did you have to go all the way down into the void? I got scared, okay? I was very surprised that that actually went down. You're literally in creative. L look, this is what I would do if I fell out and I was in creative. Oh, what? I'm flying. Look, there, there I go. Ugh, whatever, guys. Let's just see the inside of the house, please. And, oh, yeah. Can we take a look at the inside as well? Uh, no, there's top secret uh, scientist stuff in here. Uh, the, uh, let's go check out somebody else's base. And, uh, okay. Uh, wait, can we check out Speaker One's base? I haven't seen yours at all. Uh, no! You don't get to see what's inside there till very later. And, okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. What in the world? Okay, well, I'm just gonna go back to my house. Uh, you guys have fun building your things. Uh, yeah, I'm going back and doing uh, scientist stuff. That's definitely what I'm doing. Just stay out of my business. And, uh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Stay out! What the? Okay, why are you guys being so secretive about your bases? I I've shown you guys all my base. Why can't I just see what you guys are building? Because uh, my base is just so much cooler than yours. What in the world? Okay, well, hmm, let me see. What could I build for my next trap? And... <gasps> Wait a minute, I got a really good idea. <gasps> what if I build some epic fire-themed archer towers? Those are gonna be so sick. So here, let me see. What type of blocks could I build my fire-themed archer towers out of? And wait, I guess technically they're not gonna be archer towers. I'm not gonna use a bow. I'm just gonna use my fire powers. So uh, wait, what What should I call this? I don't know, maybe instead of archer towers, fire towers or something. I don't know. And oh yeah, I guess I can call it fire towers. But here, let me see. What should I build it out of? Let's see. Could I just use some normal stone? And uh, no, I feel like that's a bit boring. Maybe I could use some... Whoa, wait. Wait a minute. I think I just found out what I'm gonna build this out of. What the? It's the Ashen Stone Brick Stair. Okay, this stuff looks super awesome. Okay, here. I guess the next thing I should probably do is go ahead and just, like, build one of these things going around my entire top part over here. And then I can go ahead and build four Archer Towers on top of this. It's gonna be so sick. Or wait, no, 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 not Archer Towers. Uh, the Fire Towers. Yeah, that's uh, what I'm calling them now. And let me see. What other types of blocks could I use with this Ashen Stone stuff? And whoa, there are so many different types. Okay, here. Let me grab some of the slabs and some of the fences and some of the walls really quick and oh wait also some of the normal blocks and here let me go ahead and build a nice little platform down here you put chairs here for the scientists and then over here and then i need to put a machine over here there we go and, wait speaker man what in the world are you even building down there are you, are you building like a whole lab or something what are you trying to do don't worry about it yeah what are you building speaker man it can't be cooler than what i'm building oh uh, don't worry about it i i told you i uh, just just don't worry about it till later and okay 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 i guess we'll see you later but anyways here let me go ahead and still work on my archery towers or fire towers really quick and whoa Okay, wait, this design actually looks so cool. I didn't know that you could put fences.
fences on walls? This is so sick. I mean, I mean, uh, ladder. Sorry, not fences. Wait, you didn't know you could put ladders on walls? And no, I'm, I knew like you could put them on like these types of walls, like the like normal blocks. But I didn't know you could put them on like these types of walls. Uh, a wall is a wall. What are you talking about? And, and no, 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 guys, I'm talking about like the wall item. You know how there's like normal blocks, and then there's also like stone brick walls. I'm talking about like the brick wall thing. Oh, you mean like fence walls, like stuff like that? Yeah, 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 like the ones that look like fences, except like thick and chunky. Uh, yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. But how do you not know what I'm talking about? They're like so common. Like people use them in their builds all the time. Uh, I don't know. They must not be very good builds. What? No, that is obviously wrong because uh, my build is using them and my build is probably the most epic one here. Just check it out. My first archer tower is done and this thing looks sick. Uh, no, I totally have the best build. Do you have tiny little robots that run around your base? I don't think so. And what? You have tiny robots that run around your base? Hold on, I'm coming in. Can I see this? No, 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 no. What do you think you're doing? Get out of here. Oh my gosh, you really just shut your door on me. Okay, fine, fine, fine. I guess I'll wait till the end. But anyways, here, let me go ahead and select the positions of this archer tower over here. And I keep calling it archer tower. I mean to say fire tower. And let me just select this. There we go. And now let me just go ahead and run the command slash slash copy. And then I can go over here on my other side of my tower. And then I can do the command slash slash paste. And boom, there we go. I have just duplicated my archer tower. But wait, hold on. This kind of looks a bit weird up here. I should probably break these fences. I guess there's just going to be like one big archer tower rather than two archer towers. But it still looks super sick. Uh, archer towers are kind of outdated, don't you think? And what, what do you mean outdated? These are not outdated. Just wait till you check out my archer towers. Uh, they can't be any cooler than whatever I have. So they sound pretty outdated to me. And uh, you cannot be talking right now. I literally have not seen anything that you even have right now. How do I know you even have anything? Uh, what do you mean? I have the best stuff. Like what? Uh, like lava. Uh, where do you have lava? I literally don't see any lava here. Your base is just like a pink box. And wait, your door isn't even centered. Hey, don't talk about my uncentered door, all right? And, oh, well, yeah, okay, that is pretty disgusting looking. Uh, yeah, I think my base is still definitely the coolest one here. Uh, just wait till I finish, okay? Then you'll see who's boss. Okay, okay, I guess we'll see, but there's still no way it's gonna be anything better than mine. But here, I gotta go ahead and just make my archer towers a little bit smaller so that, you know, they look like individual towers, not just one connected blob. And then it should be done. So here, let me just place these fences here and then break all of these excess blocks over here. And boom, there we go. Now I have four separate archer towers rather than just uh, the, what, like one big blob. But wait, hold on. I think I can make this even better, actually. Let me go ahead and select each archer tower. And I'm pretty sure I can just go ahead and move it one to the right with slash slash move. And then let me go ahead and select it again. And then I can also go ahead and move it once over here. And there we go. Now it's on like the edge of my tower. This actually looks pretty good. Oh, yes. My minion robot scientists are finally finished. And what in the world? Why do you have minion robot scientists? What are they even doing in there? Oh, they're, uh, you know, uh, crafting potions and uh, trying to come up with a master plan to rule the world. You know, uh, I mean, uh, nothing. Uh, that's kind of weird. But OK, here, I guess let me go ahead and just finish moving my last archer tower. And boom, there we go. This looks so epic. And um, wait, hold on. I need to go ahead and fix the ladder so that they all face the correct direction. Let me go ahead and break the ones on this side. And then let me go ahead and put them on the opposite side so that it looks a bit nicer. There we go. And then I can go ahead and make a little entrance area for each one of these. And oh wait, hold on. I also have to move these ladders over here. And Boom, there we go. Now my archer tower room is done. I just got to go ahead and connect a ladder so that I can actually get up to it. So let me do that right now. There we go. And boom, now it is 100% officially complete. Here, let me go ahead and put some fence around it to make it look a little bit nicer. All right, all right, all right. I think I'm ready to show uh, you, Dasha, but we cannot show Speaker Woman yet. And uh, wait, what? The, are you talking about your base? Yeah, of course I'm talking about my base. Come here to come check this out. And, oh, wait, I can actually take a look inside now. Finally, I've been waiting. Okay, uh, well, let's see. What do you have here? Be careful. Make sure Speaker Woman's not looking. And Okay, we're fine. Uh, in here is down in the bottom area. This is where all like the human scientists come in here and they're like do their studies so uh, we can build uh, some stuff you'll see later. And uh, okay, uh, what's on the next floor? Oh, up here on the next floor, we have a bunch of cool machines that I could use to grab DNA from stuff and, you know, splice it together with some other things. And, whoa, what the? Uh, this stuff looks really complicated. What the? What is that green thing over there? Uh, don't worry about it. it uh, if you touch that, you explode. Wait, the what? Oh, gosh. Okay, I'm getting away. But yeah, uh, this area looks pretty interesting, but I don't see any defenses yet. What's what sort of defenses do you have? Oh, my scientists are working on the defenses right now. They should be done any minute. Uh, just come up here and come check this out. And, uh, okay. And, whoa, wait, hold on. What in the world is all of this? What the? Is this like a 3D printer or something? Yes, this 3D prints anything in the world. What the? That is awesome. But still, I don't see any defenses. And wait, why do I see some names up here? What the? Oh, you'll see that. I just come up here and come check this out. This is my uh, robot scientist room. And they're working on the next project. You actually have robot scientist people? What in the world? Wait, hold on. Hold on, can I survive my fire powers? Oh, wait, they actually take damage. Dude! I was testing, I was testing, okay? I had to test them out. Stop! Oh my gosh, why would you try and destroy my scientist robots? I wasn't trying to destroy 
destroy them. I was uh, putting them through training. Okay, I wanted to see how strong they were. But wait, hold on. How strong the is this one over here? Scientists, not robots. Stop! Okay, okay, fine, fine, fine. But the, what do these guys even do? They kind of just look like Roombas. Do they like sniff the floor and like pick up like garbage that you drop? No, they're actually super smart, and they can build a rocket in five minutes. And wait, what? They can? Wait, is this your rocket stand? What the? Yeah, I've got a bunch of cool stuff here, but they're working on the next thing right now, which is some OP turrets. Whoa. Okay. Well, that does sound pretty awesome. Yeah, it's pretty cool, but I need to get back to work to helping my scientists. And okay, sounds good. I'm gonna get back to building my base. I got some cool ideas for some upgrades now. Guys, wait, I have an idea. Why don't we connect all our bases together? And, wait a minute. Connect all our bases? And, wait, can I see your base then when we do that? Uh, I don't know about that one. And wait, what, what's the point of connecting our bases if I can't see your base? Uh, that sounds kind of pointless, right? Yeah, then we just can't go inside each other's bases and then it's pointless. And uh, Yeah, there's literally no point in connecting bases if we don't like actually go in each other's bases. What? That's not true. There's plenty of points. Wait, Dash, why don't we connect our bases at, and then we leave Speaker Woman out of it, you know, since we're better and we have sky bases? And, <gasps> wait a minute. That actually sounds like a good idea. She doesn't even want to show us her base. Wait, what? Come on, guys. Oh, then, what, then what's the point of connecting to your base if you're not going to let us go to it? Uh, you know, lots of things. Uh, I think she just wants an excuse to get into our base and rob them. And uh, that's kind of weird, but uh, yeah, uh, Speaker Woman, I think we should just connect our bases. Let's do it. Uh, where should we connect them from? Uh, I think that I have a pretty good area to connect them from. Let me go inside my base and break a hole for you. And okay, okay, I'll just be waiting up here. Ugh, you guys are gonna regret not connecting your bases to mine. Okay, okay, yeah, yeah, whatever. But here, let's go ahead and start connecting our bases, Speaker Man. Uh, I guess let's go ahead and start putting some purple concrete here so that we can connect it to my base. And <gasps> wait a minute, why don't we just make the connection go through the lava? That'll be so sick. Uh, yeah, we're kind of like dismantling the earth right now, but uh, yeah, it looks all right. And the, what do you mean? Is what the normal earth looks like, you know? Uh, there's just a mountain right here. Yeah, 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 it's a mountain. This is a huge mountain. No, no, it's pretty standard size. I think it's only like a few meters up in the air. Uh, do you even know what a meter is? Uh, yeah, it's like a really long uh, distance of length. Uh, no, one meter's pretty small. It's not this huge. Oh, okay, whatever. But here, I guess let's go through the lava and wait, hold on. We gotta be careful to make sure that the lava doesn't overflow. Uh, hmm, how are we gonna do this? I guess let's go ahead and just really bring it close to the lava wall really quick. And then we can go ahead and build like a little guardrail so that the lava doesn't fall out. Oh, why don't we start with, you know, like the floor first and then go on. And okay, yeah, I guess we can do that here. Let's go ahead and put down the floor. And oh gosh, it's so hard to see anything inside of this lava. But there we go. I think the floor is set up. But then we also have to set up the roof so that the lava stops flowing up. Here, I'll just go ahead and set up the roof now. Let me place these blocks. And okay, let's see. Is the lava gonna overflow? And wait, is it not overflowing? What the? Wait, is it just gonna work? Uh, you didn't build it right here. We just gotta do that. And boom, there we go. And oh, oh, I see. Okay, now we have to put these walls over here. And oh gosh, oh gosh, the lava is overflowing. We cannot have that mess up any of my machinery down here. And okay, other than that, I think this looks pretty good. Yeah, this actually looks pretty good after we get everything situated. Yeah, here, let me just put some more lava over here to make up for the lava that we lost. There we go. And oh gosh, uh, it's um it kind of uh, spilling. Let me go ahead and get rid of this. And oh gosh, everything's going wrong. The lava is messing up the wall. Oh no, all of your redstone got destroyed. And, uh -oh. Wait, what the? Oh gosh, I didn't even see what happened in here. Oh, wait, speaker man, I think this calls for a quick slash slash drain. I'm doing slash slash drain 50. This should get rid of all of the lava. And oh, there we go. I got rid of it. I love magic. Yep, those commands are so OP, but wait, this tunnel is gonna break into my redstone here. I guess I should go ahead and move this, right? Uh, yeah, you move that to the other side and I'll start connecting this to your staircase. And, okay, okay, perfect. That sounds good. And it's actually not a staircase. It's actually a ladder. Uh, very different things. Oh, uh, the same thing. All right, all right. But anyways, here, I guess let me go ahead and finish connecting this. I just got to make this go the other way around. Come on. Uh, I can't believe you guys are connecting to each other and not with me. This is all your fault. What are you talking about? We invited you. What? No, you didn't. We would be down to connect our base with you only if you let us go inside of your base as well. And Oh, wait, I just shot some more arrows at your base. Sorry about that. See, and now you're abusing my base? I'm not abusing your base. I just shot some arrows at it by accident, okay? Very different things. Uh, whatever. You guys clearly don't deserve to be connected with me. Good, we didn't even want to. Yeah, we're just gonna pass. But anyways, now that we have all of this tunnel system set up, wait, is it working? Are the two bases connected? Yes, they are. And look, this is so awesome. Let's go. But anyways, now that this is set up, I think we should go ahead and continue putting the lava down on my house because we kind of got rid of it earlier. Yeah, we should probably make it a bit more safe though. And yeah, how are we gonna do that though? We don't want it like overflowing into stuff. I guess it's probably gonna overflow into the redstone if we just put the lava down now. And oh, wait, you're just putting the lava down. Oh wait, actually, I think that one should be fine. It should just go down to the bottom. Yeah, and wait, we should probably just put like a little gutter 
water here. There we go. And there we go. That should be everything that we need to do. And okay, I, I guess in that case, let's go ahead and start putting down the lava and let's see if it works. Let's go ahead and put it down like that. And okay, moment of truth. Will it overflow or will the gutter thing stop it? Here we go. And oh, wait, it actually looks like it's working surprisingly well. Yeah, this is actually working really well. Except there is one problem and there's no lava flowing down here, but I'm pretty sure we can fix that pretty easily. We just got to go ahead and put some more gutter rails over here just like that. And now we can just go ahead and put some more lava down here. This should fix it. And I finished putting the lava up here, so this should be going down any second now. Let's go. But wait, why did you put this stone over here? Oh, it's like a border. Uh, let me just get rid of it. Let me just do air. And yeah, I'm pretty sure we don't need that. And whoa, let's go. This is looking so awesome. And uh, wait, actually, never mind. Uh, we do need that. Hold on, hold on. We need to slash slash drain this again. It's overflowing again. Slash slash drain 50. There we go. Oh no, what do we do? And I'm pretty sure we just have to like put it down by hand. Let's just put one layer around this entire thing and that should be good. All right, all right. And there we go. This should be good. And let's go. The rail over here is stopping it. Wait, hold on. I need to put some more lava down over here in the manual area. There we go. Let's just put that down over there. Boom. There we go. That should be good. And okay, yeah, I think everything's working now. But anyways, our base looks sick. Wait, hold on. Let's meet inside of the base. Let's meet inside of the tunnel where it connects. Let's see how this goes. Oh yeah, and my scientists are just got done with the 3D printing turrets. And wait, what? 3D printing turrets? Hold on. Wait, I gotta check that out. And whoa, let's go. This tunnel system looks sick. And wait, can I see those turret things you're talking about? Oh yeah, check this out. This is what my scientists gave me. I just need to place this down, this down, and then the turret, and boom, there we go. And, whoa, this thing looks crazy. And wait, is it gonna like fire at any mobs that it sees? Uh, yeah, it fires at any single mob that it sees. And I have a mob right here to place down. Come on, check this out. And, uh, wait, why does this guy have TNT? And whoa, wait, look, it's firing at him. What the? This thing is awesome. And wait, is he trying to break the block? What in the world is this guy doing? And oh, there we go. I took it out. That was sick. Yeah, this is pretty awesome. And these are upgradable. So I'm gonna put a bunch more turrets down. And, oh my gosh, wait, do all these three turrets down here that you just placed also work? Oh my gosh, that is awesome. Wait, speaker man, this gives me a really good idea. We should place a bunch of these turrets around both of our houses and then just like rig our entire houses with turrets. Oh yeah, that sounds awesome. Well, let's get started on that. And all right, yeah, here, I guess uh, let me go ahead and grab one of these turret bases and wait, what in the world is this thing over here? The creative energy cube? Yeah, this is the power source. We just need one of them and then we can connect the rest with wires. And oh, we can, wait, where should we put that one then? Wait, what about your lava? That could be a cool spot. And, oh yeah, I guess that could. Uh, here, I guess let's head over. We can have like all of the machinery and stuff inside of here and then we can just have like cables going out to all the turrets but uh here where should we put it in here just like over here good yeah and oh wait i know exactly where to put them in my base up follow me and, uh okay where are you gonna put them let me put down the cables first i'm just gonna put them on over here and oh okay wait so these are the cables that we're supposed to use to connect them i see i see and wait are you just gonna put a bunch of turrets on top of them yep and here we go let's start putting down all the turrets and whoa okay this is gonna be so awesome all right uh, i guess are we just putting them like around all of these cables yeah that's exactly what i'm doing and whoa this looks sick and okay wait where do we get like the actual turrets from these are just like the turret bases oh okay i see there they are this thing looks sick here let me go ahead and grab these and uh, i'll help you out with these ones over here let's go this is awesome we should definitely test this out once it's done and, oh my gosh yeah that would be amazing but wait hold on i don't think i can put a turret over here i think it's too close to this one it's fine this one already has three turrets on it but anyway should we test it out now and boom there we go it's done let's test this out and let me spawn in the villager and oh wait why aren't they doing anything and wait i'm pretty sure we have to connect them to the power right and oh gosh we should probably push this guy into the void he's gonna start doing some damage to stuff but uh yeah we have to connect this to the power now all right well why don't we go ahead and connect it through a tunnel and, oh yeah i guess we can go ahead and connect it through the tunnel that we already built here let's go ahead and take this all the way up this is gonna be so awesome yeah speaker woman's not gonna have any idea how cool these are yeah speaker woman is missing out right now but anyways here let's go ahead and connect this to the power core and wait hold on we should probably go ahead and make this cable go down in this corner over here and then we can have it go down like this and connect to the power cube and boom there we go i think they have power now uh, yeah i can see the power moving out let's go over here and spawn in a zombie and okay okay here we go moment of truth let's go ahead and test it out here i'm coming back right, let's see how awesome this is spawn and, it uh, in wait, 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 wait. yeah hold on i'm still coming through i need to break through your uh, globe really quick wait you already did it didn't you and oh my gosh that was awesome uh, yeah and wait what took you so long you could just fly through the lava and oh yeah i forgot about that but wait spawn another one i want to see all right all right and oh my gosh this is actually so awesome look at that all of the turrets are firing at it oh yes they just got destroyed let's go these are awesome but wait we should probably put some on my house as well <gasps> wait a minute what if i go ahead and put some on the entrance over here next to like my magma wall oh yeah that sounds awesome and, yeah here let's go ahead and i guess let's just replace the corners of each of these blocks with some of the turrets and then we can go ahead and put the turrets on top of 
of them just like this. Yeah, and now let's connect the cables. But wait, how are we supposed to do that? And oh, yeah, I guess we can go through over here on the inside. Maybe we can have it go through like the lava or something. And oh, gosh, it's so hard to see stuff in here. But but yeah, I'm pretty sure we can just have the cables go like this. And oh, gosh, I literally can't see anything. Oh, we might have to get rid of the lava again for a moment. Oh, wait, no, I got it. I can see something. I, I'm looking. I can see it. And up. Uh, and there we go. I'm getting close. I can see it. And boom, there we go. I got oh, it. You got it. There you go. When, wait, is it messing up with the lava? And oh, wait, it's not even messing with the lava. The lava isn't even overflowing. All right, perfect. Well, uh, can you connect the other one as well? And then we can go ahead and make it go all the way to the power core. And wait, hold on. This one's blocking my turret. I need to go ahead and move this really quick. There we go. And oh, gosh, the lava's overflowing. I messed up. I messed up big time. What did you do? I don't even know. I did like the same thing you did and I just broke it. Okay, I think it's good now. Did I get rid of it? And uh, yeah, I think we're good now. All right, well, be careful. And okay, okay, I'll be careful. And oh, yeah, right. We need to make it go underneath the turret so it doesn't mess with it. And uh, I think we can connect them together and then just bring them up like that, right? And oh, yeah, this works. Yeah, just go ahead and connect it to the power cord and it should be good. All right, all right, here. I'm just connecting them up right now. Let's do this. And then we just have to bring this one over here. Boom, there we go. And now I think they both should have power, right? Should we test it out? Uh, I think so. I, I have the zombie villagers spawning. Come here. All right, all right. Here, put it down. Let's see how this does. Come on. All right, three, two, one, boom. And, oh my gosh, let's go. It actually worked. And the lava didn't even overflow or anything. This is so awesome. Yeah, and oh wait, my scientist just gave me an alert. Hold on, there's an upgrade ready. And wait, what there is? And oh my gosh, they're all done 3D printing. Boom, check these out. And wait, wait, wait hold on. Wait, wait, what did your scientist upgrade? Look at what those say. And wait, what add on damage boost? <gasps> wait a minute, is this gonna make them do more damage? Yes, it is. Let's go add these to every single turret here. Oh my gosh, yeah, we definitely have to do that okay here I'll, I'll go put them on the ones on my house let me go inside of the turrets really quick boom and let me go ahead and put these add-ons over here whoa this is gonna be so awesome whoa it makes them look so much cooler they've got like fangs now whoa what the yeah they've got like these red things on them those definitely weren't there before but uh wait Superman, can you spawn in another zombie villager let's see how much damage it does now uh, yeah i'll spawn one over at my base i have more turrets and, oh yeah all right go for it let's see how it does all right let's put it in here we go and there we go and here we go and oh my gosh it took it out so much faster than before yeah it looked vaporized it that was awesome and wait wait hold on we should just that with my turrets as well because i've got less of them so let's see if it's still good and here we go come on and oh my gosh it was like still just as fast that was awesome yeah that was super awesome <laughs> Is that actually your turret? And, uh, yeah, they are. Why? I bet you don't have anything as cool as these. Oh, yeah. I definitely don't have anything like that. Uh, yeah, check these out. They're so cool. We have the best scientists in the world working on these. And, and wait, what uh, was that? Wait, what in the <laughs> world? Oh, my gosh. You guys are terrible at this. What the heck are those things? Uh, wait, Speaker Man, uh, what are these? Are these turrets? Uh, why are, do our turrets not look as cool as these? What the heck are these? Wait, hold on. Let me spawn into a zombie villager and see what these uh, do. Uh, wait, what, what the? the heck? Yep, these are my turrets. I am the electric elemental after all. What in the world? How did you get cooler turrets than us? I thought like we had like a whole team of scientists working on them. Scientists? They sound more like random people off the street. Even the noob elemental knows about this. What the? And wait, how did you even get these? I made them, duh. Well, anyways, I have to get back to work. There's lots of stuff to do. Uh, okay, but, uh, Speaker Man, uh, we got some work to do. Our turrets are nowhere near as cool as those. I think I gotta do some research to upgrade my scientists. And, yeah, what the? Hold on, we gotta go tell your scientist people to upgrade their turrets what in the world oh yeah i've got to give these nimrods uh, what they deserve all right let's just uh bye and uh wait what are you just getting rid of all of them yeah did you see our turrets compared to hers these guys were not up for the job and, yeah fair enough but how are we gonna get better turrets now that you got rid of the scientist people like maybe we could have asked them to just make it better oh i've got one idea and oh you do wait what is it all right just follow me and uh you might want to put one of these on and uh, wait what in the world is this what uh, what uh, nothing it's just for a stealth mission come on let's hurry and go and, uh, stealth mission what are we even doing all right we're gonna steal one of her turrets. Are you ready? At three, two, one. Steal it. Let's Wait, go. What? You're stealing the turret? Uh, okay. Oh, gosh. Uh, hi. Run! What are you guys doing? Run, run, run. Go, go. Retreat. <sighs> Whatever, the rest of my house is still better. And wait, what? You really think the rest of your house is still better than ours? Ha, no, wait. Now that we have the same turrets as you, our houses are going to be so much better. Uh, you guys wish. Yeah, let's get rid of these old turrets and let's make these super better now. And yeah, here, let's replace them with these new and epic ones. Here we go. And whoa, this stuff is actually so awesome. Let's go. You guys can steal my turrets, but your houses will never be as good as mine. Uh, yeah, because they're going to be better. And uh, yeah, Speaker One, look at how many turrets Speaker Man's house has. This looks insane. Wait, Speaker Man, we have to test out these new turrets. Oh, yeah, of course we do. All right, all right, here, let me go ahead and grab a zombie villager spawn egg, and uh, are you ready? Uh, yeah, I just fell. Let's go, let's get all this right, ready. All right, here we go, and oh my gosh, that was 
insane. It just like one shot at him. Yeah, that sounds awesome. And wait, Speaker Woman says she's building an armory room. I, I think we should one up her and build a massive armor like a gallery. And, oh my gosh. Yeah, I think you're right. All right. Well, uh, we got to get started on our armory room. Uh, where are we going to build it? Uh, I don't have any room in my base. Uh, do you have any room in your base? And um, hmm, honestly, not really. But wait, why don't we just build it like in between both of our bases up here in the sky? Well, yeah, that could work. And <gasps> wait, what if I build another planet? We could just put it in there. And oh my gosh. Yeah, that'd be so cool here. Just build like the sun or something or like a mini version of it because uh, the sun it would be bigger than the earth. So just build like a small one here and then we can have it inside of that. Uh, dude, I've got a, such a better idea than that. Uh, why don't I just build the moon? And oh yeah, yeah, the moon would be perfect. Okay, well, uh, here, I guess let me go ahead and grab like some white concrete and let's get started on that. Oh, don't worry. I've got commands. Boom, there we go. And oh, I messed it up. And wait, what? You can just build like the entire moon with commands? What the? And oh, 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 I guess you can. All right. Yes, I can. And check this out. This is awesome. Uh, now just time to change the colors and wait what change the colors I mean, isn't the moon just normally white uh, no it's gray uh i'm pretty sure it's white uh, no it's not why don't we make it half white half gray that's not how the moon is uh, okay okay whatever but anyways here i guess while you're doing that i'll come up with a way to let us you know like go from here to like the house and then like the house to here so hmm what could we do and wait a minute actually i got a really good idea what if we have like a whole ender pearl system we can have like an Wait, what? Uh, I don't think that's the correct color for the moon. Oops. And boom, there we go. All right, all right. But anyways, like I was saying, we can go ahead and have like a little ender pearl platform right over here. So uh, let me go ahead and grab a chest. And then we can go ahead and just fill it up with a bunch of ender pearls. There we go. And then we can also go ahead and have the same thing over here on this side. So let me go ahead and make a little ender pearl platform just like this. And oh, wait, hold on. We also need to add a ladder over here so that we can actually get up to it just like that. And then let's go ahead and put down our chest with all the ender pearls. And boom, there we go. Now we got a nice little way to get across both of the planets. Yep, and now it's time to start building the armor. And yeah, let's go. And whoa, wait, there are so much armor stands over here. We have so much room for armor. Well, wait, since I'm the fire elemental, let me see, what type of fire armor could I use? And Oh, wait, hold on. Actually, this stuff looks pretty cool. Whoa, wait, the red hyper giant armor. Okay, this is probably the closest thing I'm getting to anything fire themed. And oh my gosh, it gives plus 128 armor. Okay, that is very OP. What? Oh yeah, I'm getting the Doomslayer armor. Look at this. It looks so cool. And, whoa, this stuff looks awesome. And it's very earth themed because it's like green and like kind of camouflage but whoa wait okay we have a lot of armor stands to fill i guess i'll fill up the ones on this side of the room with all of this red stuff all right and now that we've got all the armor down it's time to start on the op weapons and yeah you're right here let's go ahead and put down chests all over this room and anyways what type of weapon should we even use let's see there's so many different types to choose from and wait hold on i guess the first thing that we have is like our elemental powers right that can be our main weapon yeah i mean that's all right but uh what about a grass poison gun wait what a grass poison what the okay yeah you should definitely use that that's that sounds like very earth themed, but hmm, let me see. What could I use since I'm like the fire guy? <gasps> wait a minute. Is there flamethrowers? And oh my gosh, wait, there actually is. Wait, uh, speaker man, check this out. I got a flamethrower. Whoa, careful. Oh my gosh, this thing is actually awesome. Okay, I'm definitely using this. I'm going to put this in all of my chests. Let's go. Oh yeah, we're probably going to need some food for healing up. What about these apples? And, whoa, what the, what are these neutron star apples? Okay, yeah, these seem like a great idea, but wait, are there any red apples? I want to see if there's any like fire themed ones. And, <gasps> okay, yeah, there's some red ones. I'm gonna go with these. Whoa, wait, there's red hyper giant apples. Okay, I'm pretty sure that's like the same as my armor. I'm gonna go ahead and fill up this entire chest with them. Oh yeah, and for this last chest, let's put a bunch of grenades. And, whoa, what the uh, grenades? Okay, that sounds like a great idea. We got frag grenades and then steak grenades. Let's definitely do that. I'm filling this up. And boom, our armory is finished. Let's go. This looks awesome. Uh, guys, I think I see the mob. And, wait, what? The mobs are already here. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Wait, hold on. Let me see. And oh no, wait, I see something down there as well. Oh gosh, everyone to their bases. I think the first wave is gonna start. Oh yeah, go to your base. Okay, I'm going. And come on, come on here. I gotta go to my control room. And oh gosh, uh, guys, I just got sent into survival mode. I think it's time. Oh gosh, wait, I only have a chest plate and a helmet on. I forgot to grab the rest of my armor. Oh yeah, the gate's open. Oh no. Wait guys, I think the turrets are attacking him. And oh gosh, oh gosh, guys, I kind of see his head down there, but I can barely see anything. Wait, hold on. I need to go down to get a closer view, but wait, let me go ahead and activate my dispensers first. Come on, let's go. Now they just shot stuff at my house. Stop it. It had to be done. I had to try fighting the mob, but what even is this mob? I want to get a good look at it. Let me hop down over here. Let's see. What even is this thing? And uh, Guys, uh, it's a big toilet. Everyone to your houses. Uh, quick, we got to get armor. Oh, no, I'm heading to my armory room. Uh, Dash, hurry, quick. Go to the armory room. All right, all right quick. 
quick, quick, quick. I'm coming here. I just need to go up over here. And oh gosh, I can hear the turrets firing away. Let me grab an ender pearl really quick and toss it over here. And all right, here I am. I know, my boy. I'll be there in a second. And all right, I'm, I'm here. Perfect. All right, quick. I mean, grab the armor. We gotta go. Come on, let me put on all of this armor over here. And oh my gosh, the armor gives me so many effects. But wait, the armor gave me slowness. What? This armor is horrible. Wait, I think I can just take off the helmet though, and it'll go away. And yeah, okay, I'm gonna use this helmet that you gave me earlier. And uh, wait, quick, we need to grab all of the supplies. Quick. Oh yeah, and oh my gosh, my armor is so OP. Wait, look, it makes me jump higher and it makes me run faster. Oh my gosh, but we can't get distracted. Quick, grab the weapons and what else? Oh wait, we need to grab the apples and quick, go, go, go. Guys, come down. I've been waiting for you guys. And okay, okay, I'm coming here. I need to toss an ender pearl. And all right, come here, you stupid toilet. And oh gosh, uh, wait, I think I need to use my elemental powers. Let's go. Wow, be our gun. Let's go, let's go. And oh my gosh, the turrets are doing so good. And whoa, wait, speaker on. Your house looks sick. You built like an electricity thing on it. Yeah, but guys, I don't think our weapons are doing anything. And uh, wait, why are there explosions here? Oh gosh, oh gosh. Uh, guys, I think the toilet is doing its next wave of attacks. Uh, yeah, I think we should get back to our base. Uh, this looks so dangerous. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Here, I'm going to try throwing a stick grenade at it. Come on, come on. Here we go. Hopefully this does some damage. Here we go. And wait, uh, did it just light on fire? with the stick grenade did nothing. I've got like four grenades. Come on, come on. Hopefully they do stuff. Come on, come on. And wait, I hear them exploding, but uh, wait, I think the toilet is really eating them. What in the world? Oh, I think the toilet is way too strong. We have to go to my base. And, come on. Oh gosh, oh gosh. Wait, your base? What? You don't even have anything. Yeah, you don't have anything in your base. What do you mean? I have everything. Come on in. And, uh, okay, fine, fine, fine. Quick, come on. Let's just go. Quick, quick, close the door. I think your base is the closest anyways. And, and wait. Whoa, what the heck? Uh, finally. And, uh, wait, what in the world is all this? This is what you were doing that entire time? Uh, yeah. Come on. I told you I had the best stuff. Oh, my gosh. What? You've got, like, a whole mini city down here. Oh, yeah. You gotta be careful. Some of these things are really dangerous. Uh, what the heck even is some of this stuff? I've never seen this in my life. Well, this green liquid is acid, and these are some of the most poisonous plants around. You don't want to get too close to them. Whoa, what's this? And, oh, my gosh. Yeah, this armor looks insane. This is so much cooler than ours. Oh, I'm stealing some of this. Oh, yeah. This is the most powerful armor around, and then if you look at the chest, I have all the enchanted golden apples. Uh, what the? Oh, wait. We've only got one of them, but oh, my gosh. You have so much stuff. Oh, my gosh. This armor is so cool. I'm so fast. And wait, Dash, check out this sword. It does affinity attack damage. Wait, what? Infinity attack damage? Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I told you guys I had the strongest stuff, but come on. And wait, what else do you have in here? And what in the world is this? So this is my control panel. You know the turrets up there? I can manually control them from up here. And wait, what are these? Are these rockets? My scientists were supposed to build these, but they didn't finish them. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Look at the traffic cones. These are very dangerous. And wait, what? You actually have rockets? Oh, my gosh. Wait, these look crazy. Wait, can we use these on the toilet? I mean, like, our weapons weren't doing anything. Maybe this will actually get rid of them. Yeah, these can probably do the job, but I'm not sure if it's worth it. They'll probably blow us up as well. And, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. These things do look pretty powerful. Uh, guys, I don't think we have a choice. The toilet's breaching facility. And, wait, what? How did he get in here? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Uh, the speaker one, I think we have to use one of these nukes. How do we use it? Oh, it's okay. I have the remote detonator, but wait, come on. We have to go through my escape route. And, wait, what? An escape? You have a whole escape route? Obviously. Come on. And, uh, okay, okay, I'm coming. And whoa, what in the world is this? This is my airship. It'll get us out of here safely. But first, I gotta open up the roof. All aboard! And, uh, okay, quick, everyone, go, go, go. Come on, we gotta hop on. And wait, you don't have any ladder. Uh, does anyone have any blocks? We have ender pearls. Let's just go through the bottom. And Oh, yeah, good idea. Uh, here, speaker one, take this ender pearl. And uh, let's just mine a little hole through here. And quick, go, go, go. All right, I'm in. Is everyone ready? Uh, yeah, I'm in. Let's go. All right, let me turn it on. And whoa, wait, are we moving now? Uh, yeah, we are. Uh, I think we have to get into our seats. And, oh. Oh my gosh, this thing is awesome. All right, well, quick, go, go, go. And okay, let's go. We made it. But uh, wait, speaker one, how do we activate the nuke? Don't worry, I have a remote detonator and go. And, wait, did you just hit it? Uh, wait, I don't see any nuke anywhere. When's it going to come? Uh, wait, how long is this going to take? Hey, just give it a second and it'll calm down, all right? And uh, wait, I think I see it up in the air over there. And here we go. And oh my gosh, uh, that did a lot of damage. <gasps> Whoa. Everything just vaporized. What the heck? And wait, look, the mob's gone. Uh, yeah, of course it's gone. There's nothing left for it to be on. Oh my gosh, let's go. And whoa, speaker one, I did not know you had all that stuff. I'm sorry for underestimating your base. See, I told you I had the best base. Today, we're playing Build to Survive, but everything is super realistic. Whoa, everything looks so real. I can't even see myself. And yep, it's pretty crazy. But guys, in a few minutes, a bunch of super scary mobs are going to start coming through that gate. And they're also going to be super realistic. Oh gosh, well, we better build 
got some good defenses. And yeah, you're right, guys. Here, let's go ahead and start building our defenses. And here, I'm just gonna go ahead and build like a basic box. And wait, actually, what am I doing? This wall looks pretty cool, actually, because it's realistic. But it's not gonna be strong. Mm, well, I think I'm gonna use some reinforced concrete. I'm gonna go ahead and use some bedrock because I'm pretty sure that's like the strongest block in the game. And here we go. This bedrock looks so cool. Oh yeah, bedrock's alright, but I'm using this reinforced concrete. It's super strong. And wait, you guys are both using reinforced concrete. Are you sure that's gonna be stronger than bedrock? Uh, yeah, it's so much stronger than bedrock. Mm, okay, I'm not sure about that. Remember, these mobs are gonna be super realistic, so that probably means they're also gonna be super strong and probably able to mine through a lot of stuff. Yeah, well, my pink concrete is gonna be so much stronger than them. Okay, okay, I guess we'll see. But guys, here, let me go ahead and just finish up the base of my house. I just gotta go ahead and finish up a little box. And wait a minute, guys, I just realized, since everything is super realistic, we actually have to worry about lighting stuff now since, you know, there's like shadows. Oh yeah, I'm gonna put some epic lights inside my house. Oh yeah, I can't wait to put a super cool light. And wait, you guys are excited to put lights and you know what? Actually, these lights do look pretty cool. Whoa, I'm just gonna go ahead and put some lamps in my house for now. This looks sick. Oh yeah, my house is gonna be super awesome. I just gotta do this floor and boom, there we go. The floor is done. And wait, hold on. Can I check out your house? And whoa, what the? That door looks pretty cool. But uh, dude, I think you need to add some lighting in there. Your house is looking pretty dark. Oh yeah, well, I mean, it's not done yet. I've just gotta do something real quick and boom. And, whoa, wait, what the? How did you just do that so quick? Oh, I used cheats, and now I have an epic skyscraper. What in the world? Wait, I want to do that, too. What? Don't copy me. Get your own idea. Uh, no, it's cool, and I want to do it. And, wait, hold on. This gives me an idea. Since both of you guys are taking your bases all the way up in the air, I'm going to do the opposite, and I'm going to build a bunker this video. A bunker? Yeah, that way I'll be all fully underground, and the mobs aren't even going to be able to reach me. So, here, let me go ahead and grab some ladders, and I'm going to go ahead and start digging out my bunker now. Well, you know what? I'm going to build towards the sky. Well, my base is going to be so much better than yours because my design's actually unique. Yeah, yeah, whatever. You didn't invent skyscrapers, you know. No, but you definitely stole them. No. And all right, all right, guys, it doesn't matter because uh, the, my bunker base is obviously going to be better than both your skyscrapers. So uh, let's just keep building. And here, let me quickly go ahead and grab a magic wand really quick. And here, I'm just going to go ahead and use some commands to clear out my bunker. So let me go ahead and select this position over there. And then let me also go over here in this corner. And oh gosh, wait, it's getting pretty dark. I need to go ahead and grab a torch really quick. I'm just going to go ahead and put this torch in my second hand for lighting. There we go. And here, let me just go ahead and select this position. And now using some commands, I can go ahead and instantly clear out a big room. Let's go. Well, my house is coming together. I just need to put some lights here. And here, I'm gonna go ahead and add some walls to my house using some commands as well. There we go. That looks so awesome. Oh yeah, my tower has an infinite number of layers. It's so awesome. And wait, what? Your tower has an infinite number of layers? No, it doesn't. That's impossible. You can't have an infinite number of anything. Yeah, you can. Come check this out. And uh, okay, I'm coming inside your tower. Let's see this uh, infinite number of layers you talk about. And whoa, wait, it's uh, pretty spooky in here. It's very dark. You might want to add some lights. And uh, yeah, wait, let's count these. So you have one layer, two layers, three layers, four layers, five, six, seven, and you're at eight. Yeah, but I'm going to keep on going up and I'm going to have the best base ever. And uh, okay. We'll see about that. Mine's way better. And hmm, wait, I don't know about that, Speaker Man. Your base is looking kind of shorter than Speaker Man's, but whoa, wait, yours actually does look pretty cooler so far. Whoa, wait, dude, those are like some fancy lights you got there. Yep, just you wait until I finish. They're going to be so good. All right, all right. Well, anyways, here, I'm gonna get back down to my bunker. I gotta start upgrading this thing, and it's, like, super dark in here. I think the next thing I need to do is go ahead and add some more lamps. So, let me go ahead and grab some really quick, and whoa, wait. Goldstone lamp? What in the world is a goldstone lamp? Whoa, wait, that thing looks super sick. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and put a bunch of these up on the ceiling. Oh, yeah, I kind of forgot about lights. Let me add those to my floors right now. And, yeah, you definitely need some lights. When I was in your house, it was super dark. Like, that thing could be a Halloween attraction. Oh, wait, I might leave it as is. I love Halloween. What? No, that's a horrible idea, because then when the mobs come out and we get switched into survival mode, you're gonna be, like, lost inside of your own house. Uh, you're boring. Yeah, well, my build is perfectly lighted up. And, uh, no, wait, lighted up? I'm pretty sure it's lit up. Uh, no, I'm talking correctly. It's clearly lighted up. Well, um, no, I'm, like, 99% sure it's lit up, not lighted up. I don't think lighted is even a word. Clearly, you don't know anything about lighting. Uh, what? This isn't a matter of lighting. This is a matter of, uh, grammar. Uh, no, it's not. What in the world? All right, well, anyways, here, I'm gonna go ahead and start building my next thing. I'm gonna build an epic armory room on the first floor of my bunker and here let me see what type of armor should i go ahead and grab Wait, why are you putting your armory on your first floor what that means like the mobs can run in and steal stuff from your armory and wait uh that's actually a good point mm, let me see is there any like fancy trap doors i can use and wait a minute why don't i go ahead and you wait a secret iron trap door what in the world is this and whoa wait hold on there's this trap door and wait what that just looks like a stone block wait is this a trap door let me try putting down a lever over here and wait hold on i just heard something open can i go through this now and whoa what the um speaker man i think 
think my base should be fine. I've got secret iron trap doors now. There's no way the mobs are getting through this. Wait, you have secret trap doors? Yep, this thing is awesome. Pretty much it's a trap door, except it looks like a stone block, so it's like super disguised. Oh, yeah, that sounds awesome. All right, all right. Well, anyways, back to my armory room. Let me see. What type of armor should I use? Let's see. What do we have here? Wait, hold on. This shadow armor looks really sick. It's purple, which is the best color, so I'm gonna use this. What? Purple's not the best color. Red is. I think pink is, but an armory room sounds really cool. I have to make one. Yeah, here, let me just finish putting all of my armor down, and now I need to grab a weapon, so let me see. What type of sword could I use? And whoa, there is so many different types of swords. Whoa, wait, this one looks really cool. The Maelstorm Longsword, and it's even purple just like my armor. Let's go! I'm going above the sky limit! Whoa! And, wait, what? How high are you building your skyscraper? And, oh, wait, hold on. I need to add some buttons inside of my bunker. I can't really uh, open up these doors from over here. Let me just put these there. There we go. Wait, that, that didn't even activate it. Okay, I'll just figure that out later. And whoa, what the? Your thing is so tall. Yep, and I'm going to keep on going up until I have the tallest and most epic house ever. And wait, speaker one, what in the world are you doing with yours? Uh, it kind of looks like half of a, a lowercase t. Hey, I'm not done yet. The structure is still a work in progress, but it's going to look really cool. Okay, okay. I can't wait to see what it's like when it's done. But anyways, here, I'm going to go back down into my epic bunker in here. Let me go ahead and put all of these weapons over here next to the armor. This looks so cool. And, whoa, wait, this weapon looks so cool in my hand now that everything's realistic. Everything looks so much better when it's realistic, including my house. This looks awesome. And yeah, our houses look so cool. And whoa, speaker man, your thing is so tall down here from my basement. We're like polar opposites. I'm going down, you're going up. Yeah, and I just reached the sky limit, so I can't go any further. And oh, what the? You reached the sky limit? Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, uh, speaker man, you might have some catching up to do. I think speaker man's winning in the uh, tallness department here. Hey, who cares about being tall? Mine is very functional and it goes horizontally. And oh, wait, I see what you're doing here. You have like rooms on the side. That actually looks pretty sick. Yep, this way is way better than whatever speaker man is doing. Speaker man is building the best base ever. Yeah, you wish. I don't wish, I know. Ugh, whatever. And guys, guys, stop fighting. Obviously, my base is the best because uh, it's underground. But anyways, I need to start putting some stuff inside of these chests in my armory room. Let me see. I should probably go ahead and put some golden apples in there because uh, that's gonna be pretty helpful for fighting. So here, let me just go ahead and grab a bunch of those. And I've still got a lot more room. What should I put in my chest? Here, I've got a perfect idea of what you could put in your chest. Right, here, let me come down and here, you could take that. And, uh, wait, what in the world? Is that a poop emoji? What do you mean? It's the same thing as your base. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, dude, are you calling my base poop? Okay, that is completely incorrect. What even is this thing? And whoa, wait, what? It does 29 attack damage. What the? Uh, your base is gonna look like poop. What? My base does not look like poop. If anything, Speaker Man's base looks like poop. It looks like a big, very long poop. Okay, this is getting weird. Hold on. Uh, what do you mean? My base looks awesome and epic. And uh, yeah, okay, whatever. Hold on, guys. I have a funny idea. Let me go ahead and grab some item frames really quick. And oh, wait, I already have some. And I'm just gonna go ahead and put a bunch of these poop emojis around Speaker Man's house because he said my house was poop. So uh, this is revenge. All right, let me add these windows. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. He's adding windows. Wait, is he nearby over here? And uh, wait, I don't see him. Okay, we should be good. Oh, wait, I think I just heard his door open. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. I gotta hide. And wait, what? Uh, Dash, what the heck are you doing here? And, uh, nothing, nothing. Uh, just don't come outside of your house, okay? And whoa, are those lasers in there? That looks pretty sick. And oh, gosh, he saw it. Uh, what the heck? Why did you put a bunch of poop around my house? Uh, because it's an accurate representation of what your house is. Uh, so you're welcome. I'm gonna go back to building. No, it's not. All right, that's it. Me and you are in a prank war. Uh, what? What does that mean? Okay, well, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and keep filling up my chest. You'll see what it means whenever I hit you with the next prank. Whoa, you guys are in a prank war? I hope Speaker Man wins. And wait, wait, why are you rooting for Speaker Man? Uh, because his base is clearly better than yours. And oh my gosh, you guys are just teaming up because you both have sky bases. You guys are just haters for the underground base. What? We're not haters. We're simply better. Okay, okay, whatever you say. We'll find out which base is stronger when the mobs come. But anyways, I need to go ahead and grab a bow for my chest. And whoa, wait, there are so many different types of bows. Whoa, what the? Wait, there's this one called the black hole bow and it does like 2 million attack damage. Whoa, 2 million attack damage? That's gonna decimate any mob that comes close. Wait, what? A black hole bow? How is that even possible? I don't even know what in the world this thing is, but it does a lot of damage and that's all that I need to know. So here, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up this chest now and just replace all of these empty chests with this OP one. Well, I just finished my lava moat with some magma blocks and electrified fences. And, whoa, what the? You built a lava moat? <gasps> Wait, that is actually such a good idea. We should all build the fences because uh, we don't want to be fighting the mobs. We want to have our house fight the mobs for us. Yep, and I'm doing that right now. And boom, there we go. That's set up and I win. And wait, what the, What did you do? Oh, nothing. Just uh, come up to the second layer of my base. Uh, okay, I guess I can come up and... Whoa, what the... You have all these lasers here. I saw these earlier. These things look sick.
sick, but wait, how are you supposed to get past these? Oh, I have a special key card that lets me pass through them. Oh, okay. Well, I guess since I'm in creative now, I'm just gonna like just go through these and all right, I'm coming up to your second floor and wait, what in the world are those? Welcome to the wall of miniguns. What the wait, hold on. Can we try spawning in a mob to test this out? Let me go ahead and grab a zombie villager to spawn it. Can I do it? Uh, yeah, go on. Oh wait, I wanna see this. Hold on. And oh, uh, all right, I guess we can wait for you, but whoa, these things look crazy. Oh yeah, each one of these turrets have their very own minigun, so it's super OP. Okay, well I'm here. Now let's test it. And all right, all right, here I've got a zombie villager spotting in my hand. Let's go ahead and test it out. And oh my goodness, what in the world? That was actually insane. Vaporized. All right, uh, you might want to leave before it attacks you. Yeah, I'm not sure I feel safe anymore. I'm going. Uh, yeah, those things look pretty scary, but those things are also super OP. Hold on, I need to go ahead and add some of those to my base as well. I'm going to do that right now. Yeah, me too. I gotta up my defenses. Here, let me just go ahead and grab a turret really quick. And oh wait, before I put a turret on my base, I should probably go ahead and finish up my roof. And I'm just gonna go ahead and use the magic wand so I can quickly do this. Let me select this position and then. And also this position and let me just set all of this to bedrock and wait a minute hold on let me go ahead and make like a little balcony area as well and then i can put my turrets on the balcony area it's gonna be so sick so let me do that and then let me grab some fences and oh wait these purple fences look pretty cool let me go ahead and put those down and then let me just do the command slash slash stack and now let me just go ahead and do it for each corner over here just like this and boom there we go now my balcony is done now it's time for the turrets okay well i'm gonna make sure that my base has a bunch of different rooms oh yeah i'm pretty sure my base wins I just set up an automatic crafting area for my miniguns. And wait, what? Automatic crafting area? What does that mean? Oh, this automatically crafts ammo for my miniguns. And wait, what? Do you have a thing that automatically crafts ammo to feed to your miniguns? Okay, that is pretty wild. I guess there's levels to this stuff. Yeah, wait, that sounds really awesome. I need something like that. That does sound pretty awesome. But first, I'm gonna go ahead and like, you know, actually set up my turrets before, uh, you know, I have like auto ammo crafting things. So here, let me just go ahead and put this light over here for my turret area. All right, well, I'm setting up a food room that is gonna be the best ever and whoa wait you're setting up a food room wait that's actually a pretty good idea oh yeah that does sound pretty good but i think i'm gonna go for more of the defensive route and yeah a food room is cool and all that but i feel like as long as we have like steak then we should be good and anyways just like that all of my light here is done so now it's time to put down the turrets let's go i'm gonna put one in each corner and uh wait what why do mine not look the same as your speaker man uh, you may have the wrong turrets uh i don't know they look pretty similar there's just like nothing on them it's just like a, like a black square oh you get to add your own weapon and whoa wait Wait, you have to add your own weapon to this thing? Okay, wait, hold on. I think I get it now. Let me see. What type of weapon can I use? In and okay, wait, hold on. There are so many different types of weapons. What the? There's a flamethrower. Can I put the flamethrower on it? Uh, yeah, that should work. And wait, 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 hold on. There's also a chainsaw. No way I can put the chainsaw on this. Let me try putting the chainsaw here. And oh my gosh, I've got a chainsaw turret. Uh, that's kind of stupid, isn't it? Uh, no. Chainsaw turrets are awesome. Hold on. Let me go ahead and grab some fuel for this. I'm pretty sure I need to get one of these fuel tanks. Yeah. And let me just put it inside of the fuel area. And let me also go ahead and grab another zombie villager spawn. I need to test out how this thing works. Wait, hold on. I want to see. And yeah, this is going to be pretty interesting. I'm about to spawn it in. You ready? All right, I'm ready. I'm watching. All right, all right. Here, let me go ahead and spawn it in. And wait, it's burning. Is that for my thing? And wait, what was that? Oh, my snipers. Uh, Yeah, I'm setting those up right now. And wait, what the heck? Uh, Do you even have power connected to this? You don't. You need power. And oh, wait, I need to power it. Oh, maybe that's why it didn't work. But hold on. I also need to build a wall around here so that your stupid sniper turret doesn't interfere. All right, well, let me just grab one of these so you can have power. And boom, there we go. It just started moving. And okay, okay, I think it's powered now, right? Should we go ahead and test it out again? Uh, yeah, look, there it's moving. It's ready. All right, all right, here we go. Let me go ahead and spawn it in. And oh my gosh, wait, it just pushed it off. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Yeah, but that wasn't that cool. Uh, maybe try something bigger. Uh, let me see. Uh, what could you use? And wait, 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 what, what do you mean? This chainsaw is great. Oh, I've got an idea. What about, boom, this, the Grim Reaper. And, wait, what, the Grim Reaper? What is that? Is that a rocket launcher? Uh, yeah, let me grab some rocket ammo and let's get this chainsaw out of here and put in the Grim Reaper. All right, all right. And here, let me go ahead and spawn in another zombie villager for testing purposes. And here we go. Let's see how this thing does. Is it gonna do anything? And wait, it's kind of just watching it. And whoa! Yep, and the villager has been vaporized. There you go. Oh my gosh, that was pretty crazy. And wait, what? The, where did the rocket launcher go? It just disappeared. And oh, wait, it just respawned. Yeah, it only has a few seconds where it could actually shoot. It needs to be repaired. And let's actually move this energy thing right here. Boom, there we go. All right, well, that was actually pretty cool. Yeah, and I want to show you how cool my snipers are. Come here, check this out. And okay, okay, let's check out your snipers. And whoa, wait, these guys can... Whoa, what the... They can shoot from so far away. Whoa, that's so cool. I'm definitely building something like that. And oh my gosh, yeah, that is actually super awesome. I'm definitely gonna expand these turrets. I need to put like a whole bunch of them around my base. But anyways, let me see. What other types 
sorts of weapons can I use other than this rocket launcher? Let's see. And whoa, wait, what in the world is a blaster rifle? Wait, hold on. I need to go ahead and test this thing out. Let's see what it does. And oh, wait, that's kind of weak, actually. Come on, there's got to be something cooler than that. Wait, whoa, check this out. It's called the Sonic Rifle. And wait, what? The Sonic Rifle? Whoa, what the? Oh my gosh. Okay, that thing is super OP. Ow, wait, stop shooting it at me. It's super awesome. And come on, come on. There's got to be something cooler than this rocket launcher thing I have. And whoa, wait, what in the world is the gauze rifle? Wait, hold on. Let me go ahead and test this thing out. And oh my gosh. Okay, wait, hold on. That left like a cool trail behind it. That thing is sick. Okay, I'm definitely using this. Well, I'm almost done with my food room. I have basically every food in the game. And whoa, but yeah, your food room sounds super sick. But whoa, wait, what the? Wait, why does my turret thing look like that? Why does it look so broken on there? Wait, hold on. Does this thing even work? Let me try spawning in a zombie. And oh, okay. It definitely still works. All right. Well, anyways, here, I'm gonna go ahead and grab these and I'm just gonna put them in each corner of my base. I remember to power them first. And oh, yeah, yeah, right. I need to power them. And wait, instead of putting one of these power cubes in each corner, I'm pretty sure I can just use some cable so I can connect them all super quickly. And oh, yeah, there's some cable. I'm gonna go ahead and use that. Let's go. I'll just go ahead and have my main power source over here in my main house. And then I'll use some of these cables to connect it to all the turrets. Let's go. Oh, yeah. I'm putting something new on every single layer in my house. This looks so sick. And wait, you are? What are you building now? Oh, nothing. Don't worry about it yet. Uh, okay. Oh, I wonder what he's building, but it can't be better than anything I'm already doing. And wait, what are you doing right now? I'm making a disco room. And wait, what you are? Uh, that doesn't seem that useful in a build to survive challenge. Uh, what are you talking about? It's super useful. The mobs are gonna boogie away. Uh, okay. That's a pretty interesting strategy, but I guess that works. Just wait until you guys see my finished house. And okay, okay. I guess we'll wait. But anyways, let me think. What could I add next to my base? Oh, wait, I should probably put a ladder over here to connect all of my floors together. And you know what? I don't even need these trapdoors. There's no way the mobs are getting in my base in the first place. Everything's made out of bedrock. For the break wars! Let's go! And, uh, wait, what? Wait, what did I just hear? Hold on. What's going on? And, wait, what the? Uh, was that you, Speaker Man? Uh, yeah, you just got pranked. Let's go! And what in the world? You literally built like a tower thing just to drop TNT on my base. Oh my gosh, dude. That is actually so messed up. Uh, no, it's not. And bye. I sealed off my tower. Woo! Oh my gosh, what in the world? Well, you better know I'm gonna get revenge for that. You just wait. Uh, no, you're not. And oh my gosh, what in the world? I can't just let him blow up my house and get away with it. Okay, guys, I need to come up with something good first. Let me go ahead and repair all this. He just did a bunch of damage to my house. Here, let me go ahead and just repair all of this glowstone really quick. And wait a minute. I think I got a really good idea. Okay, let me just fill in all of this stuff and repair this really quick first. And there we go. Good as new. But anyways, guys, now it's time for that prank I was thinking about. All right, so anyways, what if I morph into some mobs and then go and prank Speaker Man's house as mobs? That way he won't even know that it's me. So anyways, here, let me go ahead and see what type of mob I can morph into. And whoa, okay, there was a lot of different types of mobs here. Let me see. I need to find something good. And oh, wait a minute, guys. Since Speaker Man blew up my house, what if I go ahead and morph into a mutant creeper? So the first thing I have to do to get a mutant creeper's morph is I'm pretty sure I just have to get an OP sword. And let me just go ahead and wait. No, I can't kill the mutant creeper in here because then it's going to blow up. Because I'm pretty sure that's what mutant creepers do whenever they're killed. So I guess let me go ahead and just uh, spawn one over here really quick. And let me just go ahead and take it out. And okay, there we go. Look, it's about to blow up. Hopefully it doesn't do too much damage. Come on. And oh, okay. That wasn't that bad. That was like a normal TNT explosion. But anyways, now that I've killed the mutant creeper, I'm pretty sure I should have his morph unlocked. And okay, perfect. I do. Let's go. So here, let me just go ahead and select morph to the mutant creeper. And okay, perfect, guys. I am now morphed into a mutant creeper. Okay, this is exactly what I need. And anyways, now that I am a mutant creeper, let's go pay a little visit to speaker man over here. And wait, it looks like he's got cameras over here. Hold on. Let's try jump scaring him next time he looks through one. All right, now it's time for the security camera surveillance room. And oh, what the heck is that? And, <laughs> okay, I think he just saw us here. Let's go ahead and break these cameras really quick. And it is time to go in. And oh, wait, he's got these lasers here. Let's just go ahead and, you know, uh, eliminate these. And wait, hold on. I got to remember where they were because I don't want to break too many of them. Let me just place them back over there. And there we go. And wait, what? I can't place them back. Okay, well, I guess they're just going to be gone. All right, well, anyways, here, let's just go ahead and get past these lasers. And okay, perfect. And oh, gosh, he's got more cameras here. We got to get rid of those. And all right, here, let's go up the ladder. And oh, wait, hold on. I'm too big to fit. Okay, you know what this calls for? Let me just go ahead and grab a little bit of TNT, just like Speaker Man did to my house. And let me also grab some flint and steel. And I'm just going to go ahead and, you know, just quickly place a little bit of TNT there and then light that up. And okay, this should be pretty good. Let's watch. Wait, what the heck was that? And uh, wait, guys, I think he noticed. And wait, I just realized none of these blocks 
blocks even broke? Oh, you know what? I'm just gonna break them with creative mode. There we go. I forgot he built out a reinforced block set. Come on, I need to break a few more. And okay, we are up. And oh, wait, here are all those turrets he was talking about. And oh, wait a minute, I got a pretty funny idea. What if I just go ahead and replace all of these turrets with some chainsaws? That's gonna be super funny. And wait, here, let me just go ahead and replace all of these with some chainsaws. Boom, you know, I'm just gonna select this block and let me just replace all of them. Let's go. All right, I'm almost at the bottom now. What was that? And, oh gosh, oh gosh, I, I, I think Speaker Man's coming down. Come on, I need to hurry up. Come on, come on, quick. There's only a few left. And there we go, we got all of them. All right, quick, I gotta head back down before he notices me. And okay, good, I think we should be in the clear. Quick, I gotta rush back to my house. All right, I'm almost at the bottom. And wait, what the heck? My ladder's broken and oh my gosh all my turrets are replaced with chainsaws instead of miniguns uh what are you yelling about uh, all of my turrets just got replaced uh wait what who replaced your turrets oh i know exactly who did it it was that uh, creeper that i saw on my cameras and, oh my gosh let's go he thinks it was the mutant creeper he has no idea that it was me dash but anyways guys i think it's time we go ahead and unmorph wait a creeper changed your turrets into chainsaws uh, yeah that's exactly what happened and oh my gosh this is actually so funny speaker horn doesn't believe him uh i don't think that would happen and uh wait yeah speaker man what are you talking about you're saying a mutant creeper changed your turrets into chainsaws uh, yeah that's the only thing that makes sense now i've got to replace all of these back with miniguns and, uh that's kind of strange i don't think the round even started yet so uh, i'm not sure what you're talking about yeah i think you're just seeing things yeah the mobs aren't supposed to come out until like a little while later but wait guys i just got a really good idea what if we connect all of our houses together oh yeah that actually sounds like a good idea oh yeah then if one of our houses gets invaded then they can go to the other person's house and exactly and whoa wait speaker one what in the world are you doing with your house over here this stuff looks sick oh yeah it's pretty awesome you'll see when we connect our houses okay okay all right well anyways here we should probably get started on connecting our houses so let me go ahead and just make my ladder over here go a little bit higher and then we can have like a big tunnel in the sky to connect all of our houses all right well i'm starting on my tunnel all right all right and whoa wait you're building it all the way up there uh okay i guess we can go that high let me just go ahead and extend my ladder and here now i actually need to go ahead and put down the ladders there we go all right my tunnel's made uh now you just gotta connect it to your actual base and yeah here let me just go ahead and build a little bit of bedrock stuff over here because my base is made out of bedrock and now let me just connect it here boom there we go we've got a connection all right well i guess i'll build up the walls and the floor okay well let me start building to you guys all right all right this is gonna look so awesome we can have like a little room over here on top of my base and i guess we can have like all the main stuff here that we need well i'm gonna make my stairs really pretty so that it doesn't ruin the aesthetic of my house and oh yeah that sounds like a good idea well, we're not trying to make our houses look pretty we're trying to survive remember yeah yeah whatever i'm not even trying to make my house look nice or anything but it still probably looks like the nicest one here i'm not gonna lie uh, no it doesn't yours looks hideous look at it what dude it looks so much better than yours yours literally looks like a, a weird straw yeah at least mine has you know like consistency yours is all kinds of different colors yours is gray and purple and yellow and green and purple again and gray again and yeah dude it's called the color theme okay have you ever heard of it uh, your color theme is everything isn't it yeah because i'm so good that i just use every color okay i'm that good uh uh, guys, let's relax. I clearly have the best house. And, uh, your house is pretty cool. Honestly, I think it might come in second place, but it doesn't even compare to mine. Uh, what are you guys even talking about? My house is totally better than yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In your dreams, you can keep thinking that. All right, well, anyways, here, guys, let's just finish connecting all of our houses. All we have to do is finish building this little hallway system, and then we should be done. Oh, my gosh, this is so off-center. All right, that's it. I'm getting rid of this. And, uh, wait, what? Getting rid of what? Uh, your wall. It's off-center. What? Who cares if it's off-center? You were saying yourself earlier that it doesn't matter what it looks like. It only matters if it can defend you. And it's made out of bedrock, so of course I can defend you. Well, yeah, but I'd also like it to, you know, look somewhat decent. It doesn't matter how much you try to fix it. It won't ever look as good as mine. Uh, it already looks better than yours. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, it clearly does not. Yeah, but wait, guys, we should put some glass on top of this roof so it actually looks nice. And, oh, yeah, that would look really sick because that way we can, like, see the sun through it and everything. And the sun looks super cool. You can, like, even see its shadows being, like, casted and stuff. It looks sick. Oh, yeah, let's make it look like a dome. And, whoa, whoa, okay, you're building, like, a fancy type of roof. Okay, I see how you're going. Uh, guys, these bridges does look good and everything, but it's gonna take way too long. Why don't we build a roller coaster system? Wait, you mean like a roller coaster system to get across the houses? That would be a banger idea. That way we don't have to walk and it's gonna be so much faster. Oh, yeah. Uh, here, Speaker Roman, I, I'll give you some rails so you can start working on yours. Uh, there you go. Awesome, thanks. Oh, you might wanna watch this. It's gonna be really funny. I gave her rail mines. And, wait, you gave her what? Uh, rail mines. Uh, they explode whenever you ride and, over them. Whoa, wait, wait, that, that's pretty messed up. Should I warn her? Uh, no, we'll let her experience it on her own. Okay, that's pretty good. Let's test it out really quick. And, oh, gosh i think she's about to use it let's see if it explodes all right let's put it right on top of here and, oh! and 
Oh, wait. It looks like it worked. <laughs> Good one. You just got pranked. What are these rails? Oh, they're rail mines. You just got pranked. <laughs> hey, you just broke a bunch of my bridge. Well, I mean, it says rail mines on them. You should, you know, read some. Ugh, I trusted you. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. That was pretty funny. But anyways, guys, here, let's just go ahead and finish building the actual roller coaster system. All right. Well, now that this puppy is ready, let's take her for a test spin. Wee! And here we go. And wait, ah, what? What the heck? Did you put a roll <laughs> mine there yourself? See? Uh, what does it feel like? Uh, what? That was you? Oh, my gosh. You got revenge for that? And, oh, wait. It yep. looks like Speaker Woman joined the prank corps. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I'm getting my revenge. Uh, we'll see about that. All right. All right. Well, anyways, here. Let's see. Are there any more rail mines or is this like an actual roller coaster track now? Everything looks good. Uh, no one put any more rail mines. I think we've had enough with those. But here, we should probably take this for like a real test now. All right. Let's test it out. Hopefully, there's no more rail mines. And okay. And okay. So far, so good. No rail mines so far. And let's go. I think that was a successful mission. Uh, so I actually made it. And since we're already in Speaker Woman's house, uh, why don't we get a tour of yours first? And, whoa, wait, hold on. You just turned into a ghost. What in the world is going on? Uh, what are you talking about? Whoa, I'm perfectly fine. Wait, you're I, like turning like white and stuff. I, I don't really care. Uh, let's do this tour. Hold on. Why are you doing that? You're turning to like this white figure. What are you talking about? All right, let's do this. Uh, and <laughs> wait, I think you guys are turning into ghosts. Wait, what? No, only Speaker Man is. And, wait, what? No, it's happening for you as well. Ah, I'm getting out of here. I think he's gone crazy. Uh, I think he's going cuckoo bonkers. Come on, Dad. I want to show you my house. And, okay, you guys don't look like ghosts anymore. Okay, fine, fine. I can check it out, but uh, your house looks kind of haunted. It just happened again. I, I think you're just hallucinating, but anyway, uh, let's just continue with this tour. All right, well, my house isn't fully done yet, but I guess I'll show you guys a little bit. Well, I made a little room for you guys. And whoa, wait, you made like a little guest room? That's actually pretty nice of you. Oh, yeah, we've got our own rooms in your house. That's awesome. It's not decorated, but I try to color code it. Oh, yeah, what else do you have? Yeah, half of that room is really awesome. The other half is kind of ugly. Okay. Let's just go down here, and as you can see, the sign. And, oh, yeah, that is uh, indeed a sign. That's that's a really useful sign. I think it really adds a lot to this room. Like, without this sign, this room would be nothing, really. Okay, well, the sign's not the whole point. This is the whole point! And, oh, gosh, you guys are turning into ghosts again, and whoa, what the? Wait, what is all this? See, the sun was only a distraction! Yeah, I guess so. It's not that good of a distraction, though, because there's a huge metal door next to a sign that says there's nothing here. Wait, are you not even seeing this armor? This stuff looks insane! Whoa, look at that. It's like changing colors and stuff. Oh, yeah. I already have that armor at my base. What? I've only got this purple one over here. And oh, wait. I see. You have it at your base as well, Speaker Woman. That's a pretty good taste in armor. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I guess it's purple. But come on. There's more rooms. Uh, all right. And what's this down here? Is this a dance floor you were talking about? And this is the disco room. We can just dance disco all day long. And whoa, wait. Yeah, this place is actually pretty cool. I guess we can go here once we defeat all of the mobs and we can have a victory party. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's all right. But uh, let's actually keep focusing on this door. Uh, Hopefully, this gets better. Oh, uh, yeah. And over here is my security room. And whoa, what? You have so much stuff in here. What the? What, what is all this for? Oh, well, to keep my house safe. Duh. And oh, wait, oh, wait. Uh, what's the point of having cameras to look inside of your security room? Shouldn't they be outside of your security room? And then, like, you can look through them inside of your security room? Uh, yeah. But I have to make sure that my security room is secure. And oh, uh, do you really need this many cameras? You got, like, what, what six in here? In fact, I should add some more. And oh, okay. I see. You're really taking your security seriously. Phew. That should be enough. All right, well, let's keep going. And this is my favorite room. Yeah, and also the paintings on the wall are kind of weird. Hey, my paintings are great. And wait, what's this one over here? Oh, this one? That's a little mushroom. That doesn't look like a mushroom at all. That looks like a turtle with like a hard hat on. <laughs> yeah, wait, hey! what? That is not a mushroom. Mr. Toadstool, don't listen to them. He has a name? Yeah, of course. It's called Mr. Toadstool. Uh, yeah, you're kind of weird. Uh, who names a painting? Hey, Mr. Toadstool is more than just a painting to me. All right, all right. Well, anyways, can we just get on with the tour? We spent enough time on this uh a painting room. Yeah, you're definitely weird. Well, next is my favorite room, the food room. And whoa, but you've got so much stuff in here. But wait, there's actually a pretty unhealthy selection of foods. I think you should put like more cakes and stuff. I mean, not cakes, sorry. Steaks, not cakes. Okay, they're very different things. Okay, well, if you look at the chest, I have basically every item in the game. And whoa, yeah, you do. Okay, wait, I see you've got some steak here. Let's go. Wait, what the heck is this? Oh, yeah, that's some cheese. Uh, why is it so old and crusty and moldy? Uh, well, some cheeses taste better like that. And whoa, wait, that's kind of disgusting. I'm not sure if that's, uh, like, good to eat. What? No, it's totally a thing. Yeah, there's no way I'm eating that. I'm going down. Uh, okay. All right, all right. Well, I guess let's check out the next floor and... Whoa, wait, what's this? It's just a little bit of my setup. It's right at the entrance. And wait, what? You have a printer? What do you need a printer for? Oh, this? This is for tax fraud, obviously. Wait, what the? Uh, okay, well, your house is pretty cool, but guys, do you guys want to check out my house now? Is this your entire house tour? Yep, that concludes our house tour. Oh, yeah, I guess we can check out yours next. And wait, wait, hold on. No, no, no. 
no, we can't go through like that, guys. We have to go through to my house in style. Let's go through the roller coaster. All right, and here, let me go ahead and put down a minecart. And all right, I'm going first. See you guys. Oh, all right, well, I guess I'll follow and, behind oh, wait, hold you. On, hold on. I need to stop. Uh, make sure to stop at my house. All right, I am. All right, there I go. Wee! Okay, me next, me next. Woo! And all right, well, I guess the minecarts are over at Spookerman's house. But anyways, guys, you guys ready to have a tour of the best house ever? Yeah, but wait, why is it so open? What if a mob, you know, like just spawns in and shoots us? And oh, yeah, I guess that is a good point. You know, I'll have like a little glass wall around the ladder so that, you know, no mobs can like try shooting us with their bows or anything. But anyways, guys, this is the first area. What do you guys think? Uh, it doesn't look that good. Look, there's fences and uh, yeah, that's it. Uh, yeah, I don't know if this is super impressive. And uh, what, what do you mean? This is super impressive. Guys, check it out. Uh, This is my uh. Patent pending open design right here. Pretty much what you can do is go ahead and grab a bow from the armory room. And look at all of this free space that you have. You have so much room to just use your bow and shoot down all of the mobs. Yeah, and so does the mob have, you know, more room to, uh, you know, pretend I'm a mob. And I'm like, I'm coming out and I'm flying and then fireball and then you're gone forever. But no, I can just go ahead and retreat back to the main house, which is over here. Yeah, but one fireball is all it takes and then poof, you're gone forever. Uh, Actually, no, I won't be gone forever because on the floor below, we've got an armory room and these armor will defend me from fireballs. Wait, is this all you have to your base? This looks horrible. And, uh, the, what do you mean? Oh, wait, I've also got those turrets up there, but yeah, this pretty much it. This looks awesome. What do you mean? Yeah, it's not that bad. I mean, I like the purple armor. My base isn't even finished and it looks so much better than this. Oh, yeah. Well, why don't we go check out your base then, huh? All right, let's go check out my base then. Follow me. All right, let's go. All right, all right. All the way up to the mine carts again. Here we go. And wait, guys, we should probably make like a dedicated mine cart stop at my house. So let me go ahead and grab some more rails. And here, I'm just going to go ahead and like dive the track a little bit so I can have like my own dedicated uh, no, stop. No, no one needs to stop here. This house is ugly. And, oh my gosh. All right, you know what? Fine. All right, well, come on. Let's keep going to my base. Let's check out how awesome it is. And wait, uh, actually, we're not going through this here. Uh, turn around. Uh, wait, what, what are we doing? We have to go through the entrance. And wait, what? We're not going through the minecarts? Uh, no, because I have to show you everything in this glory one thing at a time. All right, let me just open my hangar door and boom, there we go. Whoa, I see you have the lasers. Yeah, some of them got destroyed. I don't know what happened. Uh, here, let me fix that real quick. Let me just... Bam, 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 and boom, there we go. That should be enough lasers. Oh, yeah, that's pretty strange how some of them got destroyed. I wonder who did that. But anyways, here, I guess let's just go through these. Are we safe to walk through them? Yeah, you're in creative mode. You can't take any damage. Oh, yeah, right. I forgot. But let's go and wait. This one over here doesn't even work. Yeah, I got to fix that layer. I don't know what happened. Some of them just stopped working. But up here is my awesome minigun floor. Whoa, wait. And oh, gosh, guys, it looks like he changed all of the chainsaws back to miniguns. What in the world? Yeah, randomly they changed into chainsaws, but I got them back to miniguns. Oh, well, that's. That's weird, but I remember this room. These are super cool. And yeah, wait, hold on. I'm pretty sure we've already seen this stuff before, but what else have you added? Oh, I've added so much more. Up here is my awesome study room. And, whoa, what the? Your study room? What do you need a study room for? Oh, you know, to like study the mobs and come up with a perfect weakness for them and feed it to ammo to my miniguns so they can instantly vaporize them. Whoa, that sounds really awesome. Yeah, just take a look at all these machines. They're super epic. Whoa, yeah. What in the world do these things even do? Oh, let's see. This one over here grabs the this one cleanses it this one spins it this one uh you know diverts it into the the three main colors and then this one over here is just you know to, uh, it's a table to build snacks on uh and then this one takes them and then injects them into a pet bunny and poor bunny but i uh, th then it takes that bunny and then smelts it and then over here i can craft the perfect ammo for the enemies and, oh oh i see that's a pretty interesting process but uh what else you got oh up here on the next floor it gets even crazier whoa what is this oh it may not look like a lot, but uh, on the other side of this wall is the OP sniper turrets. Oh, wait, I remember seeing those from the outside. And, whoa, and wait, what in the world are these blocks over here? What, nether metal? Oh, yeah, I found these, and they're super strong, so no mobs are going to be able to blast the fireballs through them. Whoa, yeah, that does look pretty cool, but what else you got? Alright, up here on the next floor, I have a bunch of riches that you're never going to get to in your life. And, wait, what? Are there barriers here? Okay, that's actually pretty cool. <gasps> wait, guys, what if we build a house out of barriers? That'd be sick. Well, it's not barriers. It's called solid air. Look at it. Wait, solid air what the hold on can you drop another one uh my inventory is so complicated right now uh, yeah there you go take that whoa what the solid air that is actually the most random thing i've ever seen what wait if we can get through how are you supposed to get through oh i'm not gonna worry about that for now uh, let's just keep moving on and, uh okay ready then and up here is the most secure food pantry in the world and, oh, wait what you have security chests for your food wait what's the passcode can i know uh, no you can't know hey i want some food you have an entire layer in your house full of food okay well i want you and you know what? I don't have any food. I'm hungry. I'm breaking this chest. And oh, wait, I could just break it that easily. Okay, well, thanks for the food. Dude, my muffin! 
muffins. And, oh, wait, you had muffins in there? I don't think I even picked any of them up because my inventory is already so full. Oh my gosh, you just got rid of all my muffins. All right, that's it. Let's go up to the next floor. And here's the floor that has the minecart area. I haven't gone any further up, but uh, get, get out of my house. You broke my food. And, okay, fine, whatever. I'll get out. You know, that was actually a pretty nice house, uh, except for like uh, every part of it. My house is just so much better. Uh, no, it isn't. Uh, wait, guys, do you see that? And wait, what What are you talking about? Look, the mobs are spawning. And wait, what? They're spawning already? Oh, oh no. gosh, oh gosh, I thought we had more time in. Whoa, uh, wait, is that Slenderman? Is that a lot of Slendermans? Uh, those things look super scary and realistic. Uh, what the heck is that? I'm not taking any chances. All right, I need to add one final defense to my base. And, oh gosh, I, I think there's a toilet there as well. I, I gotta add a defense as well. Wait, guys, instead of building our own individual defenses, why don't we all work together and build one big defense? And, oh, wait, actually, that might be a good move because I'm not sure how much time we have before the mobs come through. Okay, um, well, but what type of big defense can we all make together? Uh, guys, I've got an idea. <gasps> we should build a missile silo! And, wait, are those missiles? Okay, let's do it! And I have the perfect place to put it. Uh, let's put it back here, just like that, and boom! And, wait, wait, well, why are we putting it behind my house? Because your house is in the middle. Uh, okay, I guess that makes sense, but yeah, here, let's go ahead and dig out a big room for the missile silo. This is gonna be insane! Wait, I think there's already a cave system under our base. And, wait, what? There isn't? Whoa, what in the world is all this? Why is there, like, a whole cave here that we didn't know about? Uh, I don't know. I, I think we were building over top of a sinkhole. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. All right, well, we better build it quick before the sinkhole sinks any farther or something. So it's here. Come on, we gotta build it out over here. Uh, just use your cheats. Uh, use your wand. And, oh, yeah, here. Let me grab the magic wand really quick, and boom. This should be super quick. Let me just select these positions and slash slash set air. Boom. There we go. And, oh, my gosh. This is such a big hole. Look at this. And, whoa, what the? Wait, uh, speaker one. I think that's your house right over there on your lava mode. Oh, wait. It is. All right, well, guys, we can't keep getting distracted. We've gotta build this awesome nuke silo. And, yeah, you're right. Here, let's go ahead and clear out this little hole over here for, you know, the actual missile to come out of. And then we gotta go ahead and start building walls to this room. So here, let's see. What should we build these walls out of? Oh, we should build it out of Osseum blocks. And, oh, yeah, that block looks super cool. Okay, we definitely should. Let me go ahead and grab one. And uh, Wait, speaker one. This isn't Osseum. It's called Osmium. What? How? You need to learn how to read. Hey, it looks like the same thing. Potato, tomato, okay? Uh, potatoes and tomatoes are very different things, first of all. And it literally has an M inside of it. It's got two M's. How did you not see that? I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, but wait, guys. Guys, it's actually getting very dark in here. Uh, let's add some lights. Uh, what light should we add? Oh, this one looks really good. Let's add this one. And wait, what? where are you in? Oh, wait, this light looks sick. It's called the industrial lamp. Oh, that's perfect for what we're building. Okay, let's go ahead and just put all of these osmium blocks on the walls. And then we can go ahead and start putting down the actual, like, missile launcher stuff. All right, speaker will want to say osium. Hey, uh, don't make fun of me. I get to make fun of you whenever I want. You do stupid things. I don't do stupid things. Oh, yeah. Then what is this block called, Miss Osium? It's osium. And Okay, guys, guys, it doesn't matter. Okay, stop arguing. Let's just go ahead and finish this up in here. I'm gonna go ahead and put all of the floor down really quick, just like this. And here, I'm only gonna go ahead and put just like one line of these osmium blocks, just like that. And then using the magic wand, I can go ahead and do slash slash stack. I'm already on it. Beat you. And wait, what? No, I bit it first. Okay, uh, it doesn't matter. But anyways, guys, now that we've got this little area done, we should probably add a roof actually before we put, start putting the missile stuff down. So let me just go ahead and put it in like that. And boom, there we go. Now we've got our roof. And oh yeah, we gotta break these blocks. Okay, well, now we can finally start putting stuff down let's put this and this and, and then this here, wait is this all the missile stuff and then oh yeah in order for the missile to work we gotta put all this stuff but let me put the thing right here and uh, wait don't you think the missile should be the last thing we put down uh, what if it accidentally goes off i uh, don't worry about it and boom and, whoa that thing looks terrifying all right well uh, here i guess the next thing we should do is go ahead and grab some glass let's grab some black and yellow glass and let's just go ahead and like outline this area so that it can be like a little warning for anyone trying to come through and whoa the glass looks so realistic all right and i've got an idea i've got these case traps and i'm gonna make an entire perimeter so no mobs can intrude here and, oh yeah that's a great idea because that way if any of the mobs try to get into here and you know mess with any of the stuff they just get caught in the cage trap yeah that's a great idea but here i'm gonna continue putting down all the stuff that we need let's go the missile silo is almost complete we just gotta go ahead and put down a little bit more glass over here and then oh wait we should also go ahead and put down a door wait speaker can you use one of those doors that you use for your house like one of those crazy ones oh, yeah uh let's see this one should be good enough let's just make an area for the door be very careful not to punch the nuke and boom there we go perfect this looks awesome but wait what where did the door go shouldn't it be like up here in the glass it just disappeared i think it just goes invisible oh that's uh pretty interesting but anyways guys the missile silo room is complete wait let's go check up on the mobs oh yeah let's go check on these mobs hopefully they're not out and a few they're not and, oh gosh uh, they're probably gonna be released soon though so here everyone let's head back into our houses we gotta grab our armor and get into position oh yeah you're right but 
Wait, guys, if we're actually gonna use this missile, aren't we gonna need a way to get away? And, oh, yeah, that is a good point, because otherwise we'd just be blowing ourselves up. All right, well, anyone got any ideas? Wait, guys, I've actually got an idea, but first, let's build a runway. And, wait, what, you do? What is it? Uh, you'll see whenever we get it done. Right, let's grab some black wool and some yellow wool, and boom, there we go. All right, let's start with this runway. Uh, alrighty then, but what are you thinking? Oh, I said I saw you in a second. Let's get this runway done first. Uh, okay. All right, and guys, it's gonna take forever if we just do it this way. Let me grab this and then let me uh, do one of these and boom. And let me turn around this way and do the same thing and boom. And oh yeah, right. We can just do it with commands. But anyways, now that we've got this massive runway up there, what are you thinking of building? We are going to build an airship. Wait, what? An airship? Oh, that sounds awesome. All right, well, let's get started. Yeah, let's build it a little bit off the ground so it doesn't pick up our entire house and boom, just like that. All right, let's just make this really big so that we can get away easy. And yeah, here we go. This thing is going to be awesome. And wait, hold on. We should probably add some glass windows just to make sure that, you know, if any of the mobs shoot fireballs at us, we can defend from those. All right, well, while you guys do that, I'll do all the mechanical stuff and actually get it working. And, oh, yeah, all right, that sounds good here. Let's just add this glass box really quick. This is gonna be so awesome. All right, this is actually coming together. Yeah, here we go. Come on, come on. Let's just finish placing all of this glass. And here, let's go ahead and add a roof as well. And wait, let's make the roof out of some stained glass. That's gonna look super cool. Uh, Dips on doing it out of purple stained glass is gonna be awesome. Hey, wait, we should add some pink stained glass. Okay, well, you better get started making your other side pink because I'm making this whole thing purple if wait, you don't do wait, it in time. Wait, 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 wait. Why don't we all have our own colors? Uh, you build the pink out of the glass walls and then you build the purple out of the ceiling and I can have the red platform. And, oh, yeah. I guess that can work. All right, wait. Speaker one, build your walls out of pink stuff. I'll build a roof out of purple. Uh, okay, I'll just do it. Commands. And Oh, yeah, right. I forgot you can do it with commands. All right, but anyways, here, I think the airship is done now and this thing looks awesome. We've got like the pink walls and then the red floor and then the purple ceiling. This thing is sick. Yeah, and now that we have this, we should probably get ready. The mobs are going to be here any minute. And, oh, gosh. Yeah, you're Right. All right, quick, everyone to their armory rooms. I'm gonna make a place so we can actually jump in here if we need to. And oh, yeah, good idea. But I'm heading into my armory room. I think the mobs are gonna be released any second now. Here, I need to grab some armor. Okay, I'm grabbing armor. Here we go. All right, all right, same here. And oh, gosh, I just got put into survival mode. And uh, wait, guys, I think because it's super realistic, we have thirst bars. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Well, I didn't pack any water bottles. And, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Neither did I. But here, guys, come on. Let's just hope for the best. I've got my armor on. Let's go. We gotta take these guys out. And wait, are the mobs released yet? Oh, uh, guys, they're escaping. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, they got released. All right, quick, everyone, we gotta use our bows and stuff. Let's go. Come on, let's take all of these out. And oh gosh, oh gosh, there is a lot of mobs. Oh gosh, the big toilet mob is coming out. Quick, turrets, do your thing. Oh, I'm trying to fight them. And, wait, oh, everyone, oh, you're going oh, down there by yourself. And wait, what? All right, guys, why are you guys down there? I think it's a good idea to like be on your building and just shoot down. Minigun power. Oh, I gotta reload. Hold on. And, uh, yes, figure out. I don't think you should be down there with them. I'm just staying up here. See, my open area wind is obviously the best. Oh, maybe your open area did have a point. Come on, come on. Let's just shoot all the down and oh my gosh, there are so many realistic Slenderman mobs. Why in the world? Uh, they're not taking any damage, guys. My minigun's out of ammo. I'm getting back in my house. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, wait here. I'm gonna try throwing a frag grenade at it. Come on, come on. And wait, what, what even happened to that grenade? It didn't even blow up. Wait, hold on. I'm gonna try throwing another one over here. Come on. And there we go. And oh, wait, I almost threw it in the missile silo. Oh gosh. Hey, 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 be careful. Don't throw that there. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, yeah, that was not a good move. But come on, we gotta get the toilet out of here. Oh gosh, he's trying to go to the missile silo. Come on, we gotta push him away. Go, go, go. Yeah, get him out of there. If he falls in there, we don't know what's gonna happen. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, come on. Why aren't any of these mobs taking any damage? Oh, guys, these mobs are way stronger than I thought they would be. And, oh gosh, oh gosh. Ow, ow, ow. Wait, they're starting to attack me now. Ow. Yeah, let's go. I'm blowing on my lightsaber. And, wait, you have a lightsaber? Oh gosh, you have so many weapons. But come on, I'm just gonna keep using my boat. This boat does like 2 million attack damage, and it's still not taking him out. What in the world? Now they hit me. Uh, guys, I'm pretty sure sure these mobs are invincible. Yeah, they're not dying no matter how hard I hit them. And oh gosh, oh gosh, uh, guys, I'm losing thirst bars really quick. We gotta get back into creative mode. We have to get rid of these mobs quick. Oh gosh, I didn't even think about the thirst bars. We gotta go. I think it's time for the missile. And, oh gosh, oh gosh, do you really think so? Um, okay, well, everyone head up to the airship. Go. I'm going. And oh gosh, oh gosh, uh, I forgot to add a door to my house. Uh, speaker man, I'm going through your house. Oh gosh, I need to dodge this big toilet mob. I'm coming. Hey, don't go there. There's lasers. You can't go right and, now. Oh gosh, oh gosh. And wait, I just opened your door. Hopefully no mobs go there. But all right, speaker woman, I'm coming through your house. Okay, okay, come on. And come on, come on, come on here. Let me get right, in here. And, oh my gosh, on, the guys. are inside of your house. Oh gosh, oh gosh. How are there mobs on your first floor? But okay, I managed to escape them. I don't know. I was running away. Some of them must have been invaded. And, oh gosh, oh gosh. All right, but anyways, here, uh, I'm heading over to the main area. How do we even get up to the airship? We forgot to put a ladder up there. Uh, no, there's a staircase over here. Follow me. And, wait, there is where? Turn around. Follow me if you want to live. And, oh, wait, there's a staircase over here. I didn't even notice. Okay, okay, come on. Go, go, go. All right, come on, guys. We gotta go before the mobs come. Come on, quick, quick,
right, well, quick, everyone hop in the airship. We gotta go. All right, I'm turning it on, guys. Everyone get in your seats. Let's go. And, all, right, all right, quick, let's go in. Okay, guys, it looks like we are taking off. The airship is live and active. And wait, are any of the mobs here? Oh, yeah, they're definitely there. Come on, let's go. And Okay, okay, come on. We just gotta fly super far away. We don't want the missile to do any damage to us. And oh, gosh, oh, gosh, we gotta go back to creative mode quick. I'm only at half a thirst bar. All right, guys, I'm gonna detonate it. And, okay, okay, here we go. Come on, come on. The missile should be coming soon. Everyone get ready. All right, I'm ready. Let's get this. And, okay, okay, here we go. Come on, it should be coming from the sky or something. Everyone just watch out. Come on. Oh, yeah, I'm looking. All right, come on. And uh, guys, does it usually take this long? Come on. And, wait, I think I see it right there. And, there it is. Oh, my God. Gosh, everything just got destroyed. And oh my gosh. Okay, I can see everything now. And we did a lot of damage. Yeah, and look, my base is the only one to survive. And look, we got rid of all the mobs. Let's go. Today, we're playing Build to Survive against that huge TNT. Oh gosh, that thing is terrifying. Yep, and we each have to build the fences in order to survive the blast. Well, we better get to building. And, yeah, you're right. I do not want to stick around for too long here. Let me go ahead and grab some obsidian really quick because uh, I, that thing looks very scary. And I'm just going to go ahead and start building my defense. Well, I'm going to grab some concrete and start building up a wall. Uh, you know concrete's going to blow up, right? Oh, I didn't think about that. And uh, yeah, concrete does not seem like the best block for this. Yeah, and obsidian's not that strong either. And whoa, wait, you're going for bedrock? Okay, uh, that's actually a pretty good idea. I'm going to go ahead and use some bedrock as well. Wait a minute. Actually, I'm pretty sure there's something called reinforced obsidian. I'm going to go ahead and use this. I'm pretty sure it's like normal obsidian, but stronger. And I think it's actually stronger than bedrock as well. Well, I found the thing called reinforced concrete, so I'm going to use that. And all right, all right. Now we're talking. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this reinforced stuff should be strong enough to survive the blast. So here, let's go ahead and start building our defenses out of this. And wait a minute. What am I doing? Hold on. Okay, let me go ahead and get rid of all of this. I'm going to go ahead and build a bunker. I think that's going to be the ultimate defense. While you guys are up here with your fancy houses up above the ground, I'm going to be chilling underground surviving the blast. And the blast isn't even going to affect me. Hey, you stole my idea. That's what I'm doing. And wait, what? You're building a bunker as well, but it looks like you're building a normal house right now. Uh, no, this is like, you know, the outside of the bunker because uh, we also need this to be blast proof. Yeah, but wait, why are you making it so big? Isn't like a bunker supposed to be underground? Uh, I'm just building like a little door to get inside of it right now. Well, I mean, that's what I'm doing here too, but I also want it to be kind of spacious. Well, you know what? That's a very good idea. So I'm going to build an underground bunker too. And, wait, are we all building underground bunkers? Okay, this is going to be an interesting build to survive. But anyways, here, let me go ahead and put my door over here and guys, check out my door. This thing looks so sick. But anyways, now I need to go ahead and like actually start building the bunker. I've just got like the end Entrance for my bunker done here. Let me go ahead and grab some ladders really quick And I'm just gonna go ahead and place these going all the way down But I, I cannot have any dirt here I need to replace all of this with some obsidian because I do not want any chance of that blast getting into my bunker Yeah, that would be really bad. We don't want there to be any sort of entrances Otherwise, we'll all get blown up and exactly everyone make sure your bunker is super secure because uh, if that blast gets in It's not gonna be good. Uh, yeah, I'm already working on that and my base is actually gonna be super awesome Oh wait, and I have a great idea. I'm gonna put my door in the back so when the blast hits, it won't get the door. Oh, wait a minute. That is actually such a good idea. That way the blast is going to like hit a wall and it's not even going to do anything. But honestly, I think my door over here should be strong enough. So I'm just going to leave it in the front. And all right, back to building the bunker. Well, I'm going to put a great defense on my roof. The blast will never expect it. <laughs> no, wait, what? A, a defense? Uh, the blast isn't like a mob. What type of defense are you going to use on it? Uh, yeah, what in the world are you talking about? No, just look what I put on my roof. And, uh, okay, wait, hold on. I'm coming up. I want to see what sort of defense you have for your blast. That wait, you have a sign. It says no blast zone. Um, I'm not sure if the TNT is gonna listen to the sign. Oh no, trust me, it'll work. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure the TNT does not care about your sign. It totally does. It's a no blast zone. It can't break the rules. And uh, okay, yeah, I mean we'll see about that. Uh, this big thing over here doesn't look like something that'll follow rules, but yeah, uh, go for it. You guys will see. All right. Well, anyways, here I'm gonna go ahead and get back to building some actual defenses against this blast here. I gotta make sure to blast proof all of my walls by building them out of some of this reinforced. Obsidian. Uh, Speaker Man, how's your build coming along? Oh, it's becoming awesome. Uh, just come check it out if you want to. And wait, you already have some progress done? Okay, wait, here, I'm coming over. Let's see, do you have any defenses? And wait, you made your entire floor out of bedrock. That's a good idea. I might have to steal that. And whoa, wait, what in the world is this? Wait, what, are there barriers here? Why can't I go through? Oh, it's because the door is closed. And uh, no, it's not. It's literally open. Wait, what? Well, why can't you go through but I can't? Uh, this door just hates me. Maybe it's just because I'm better. But underground, I'm going to have a super awesome bunker that goes all the way down to world limit. And 
all right, but I don't really like your door. Your door literally hates me. It's not even letting me go in. But anyways, I gotta get back to building my bunker. And okay, here, I think I've dug out my little ladder area deep down enough. So here, I'm gonna go ahead and start clearing out the actual space for the bunker. Let me just go ahead and put this last few reinforced obsidian. And okay, yeah, this definitely should be deep enough. But anyways, here, now let me go ahead and start digging out the actual base. And instead of doing it by hand, I'm gonna go ahead and grab a magic wand really quick. And I'm gonna go ahead and clear out this entire thing with command. So here, let me just go all the way over here really quick and select this position. And then let me go all the way over here in this corner and then select another position right over here. And then I can run the command slash slash set air. And boom, there we go. Now I've got a nice little room, except uh, it's actually kind of small. Let me just go ahead and make this area a little bit bigger. Let me go ahead and set this to air as well. And then let me go ahead and slash slash stack this a few times just like that. And okay, yeah, this is what I'm talking about. And in fact, I think I can make this a little bit bigger as well. So let me just go ahead and stack this one time. And this is starting to look a lot nicer. Well, I'm finally starting on my underground bunker. I just need to clear out a bunch of area out. And you should use commands. That's what I've been using, and it's super quick. Yeah, you have a magic wand to use it. Oh, yeah, you guys are right. Hold on, let me grab this, and boom. Now I cleared out a bunch of area. Let's go. But anyways, here, let me go ahead and finish putting down my walls. And wait a minute, you know, since I'm underground, I guess I don't really have to be building with reinforced obsidian anymore since, you know, it's already, like, super strong down here because of all the dirt. So I'm gonna go ahead and build my walls down here with some purple concrete. That should be good enough. Uh, you know you can use reinforced concrete, and it's just as strong as bedrock, right? And, uh, yeah, I know about reinforced concrete, but I'm pretty sure it, like, looks weird. Yeah, see, it kind of looks darker than the normal concrete, and it, like, kind of looks sad and depressing, so I don't want to use it. Oh, well, you're weird then. What? No, I'm not. Down here, you know, the, now that I'm underneath all of the dirt and stuff, it's not gonna make a difference if I use reinforced or normal concrete. It's still gonna survive either way. Who knows? It may go through your base. Yeah, well, my bunker is completely surrounded by water, so that no blast is ever gonna get through. And, wait, what? You surrounded, like, your entire bunker with water? Whoa, wait, that's actually a pretty good idea. That way no blast can get through because like water stops blast. You know what? I think I'm gonna go ahead and do the same here. Let me go ahead and select uh, this position over here and then also this position over here and also this position over here and let me go ahead and do slash slash walls and then fill it with water and boom, there we go. Now my entire bunker has walls made out of water. That is actually such a good idea. Yeah, well, I'm gonna feel sorry for you guys that there's no way you're gonna be able to beat my base. What, what do you even have in your base? Oh, what do you like to know so you can steal it from me? I, I'm not gonna tell you till very later on, but oh my gosh, this is coming together so nicely. And hey, I actually do know one thing that you have in your base. You have a door that I can't go through, so uh, that makes your base bad. Uh, it doesn't make it bad, it just makes it you proof, which is the best kind of base ever. And what the, what do you think I'm gonna do in your base if I get in? I, I don't know, probably like steal stuff and like my ideas and like awesome stuff that I do. What, dude? I'm not gonna steal your ideas, but anyways, here, the base of my bunker is done. This is like gonna be the main room, but here, I need to go ahead and actually put down these ladders really quick, and oh wait, I already have them. So let me just go ahead and extend this little platform to go all the way down to the bottom floor. Oh no, the water's leaking! And oh. wait, what? The water in your walls is leaking? Oh, wait, I forgot about that. Oh gosh, uh, I just realized the water's gonna be like a big issue if we try to like build new rooms or something. Um, well, I guess we can deal with that later. Oh, phew, if I was able to stop the leak, geez, water is hard to work with. Yeah, but it's probably gonna be worth it because, uh, you know, better be safe than sorry when we're dealing with a big TNT like that. Yeah, I think you're right. All right, well, anyways, now that I've got my base room down over here done, wait, I have a perfect idea for what I can build first. I'm gonna go ahead and build a kitchen because, you know, the, what if we get stuck in the bunker for a while? We're gonna need some food. Uh, kitchen's all right, but it doesn't deserve its own room. It deserves its own building. Wait, what? How big are you building your kitchen? Oh, uh, wouldn't you like to know? I'm not telling you anything, but I know that my base is definitely gonna be yours. And uh, the, what, the, why are you telling me anything? Why are you being so secretive with your base? I've been telling you, like, everything about my base. Uh, because my base is going to be the most awesome epic base in the world ever. Oh my gosh. All right, what in the world? Well, anyways, here, I'm gonna go ahead and start building a little hallway to get into my kitchen area. This is gonna be the most epic, sick, lit, epic, and cool, and awesome hallway you've ever seen. You really just steal my uh, description of my base. And the what, dude? That is not your description. And, uh, wait, uh, speaker man, I think I accidentally dug a little bit too far. Is this your base? Get out! And, okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. Hold on. I'll slash slash undo it. Hold on. Let me do slash slash undo. And, okay, there we go. Uh, I guess I'll build my kitchen, like, over here. I won't dig as far. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe you just spied on me. Hey, are you stealing other people's bases? And, uh, what? I'm not trying to do it on purpose. I just accidentally dug a little bit too far. That's all. Yeah, sure. I believe you. What? 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 Uh, are you being sarcastic right now? No, I'm not being sarcastic. I'm never sarcastic. Uh, you sound awfully sarcastic. Why don't you guys believe me? I wasn't trying to spy on you or anything. Why would I do that? Uh, 
because you would do that and you're weird. <laughs> okay, dude. Well, anyways, here. Let me just go ahead and finish clearing out this room for my kitchen area. Yeah, well, I just need to continue finishing up my water walls, which are really hard to work with. And wait, what about instead of water walls, you make lava walls? I'm pretty sure lava is also blast proof. Oh, well, water is better and looks better. Okay, fair enough. But anyways, here. I think I have enough room over here for my kitchen now. Actually, wait. Let me go ahead and just clear a little bit of room up here on the ceiling really quick. Just like that. And okay, yeah, I think this definitely should be good for like a small starting kitchen. So anyways, let me quickly go ahead and do slash slash walls. And hmm, what could I make the walls out of? And, oh, wait, what about stone bricks? I'm pretty sure that'll look good. And uh, actually, wait, no, this looks more like a prison than a kitchen. Uh, wait, speaker, what are you building your kitchen out of? I'm not telling you. And, oh my gosh, whatever. Okay, you know what? Uh, actually, I'll go ahead and build it out of some smooth stone bricks. That's gonna look super sick. So let me do that. And okay, yeah, this is starting to look more like a cozy kitchen. So here, I guess I can set the top area to some wood. And I can go ahead and do the same with the floor over here. There we go. And wait, also, let me go ahead and open up this door over here. Perfect. There we go. Now I can start building the kitchen. Anyways, the first thing a kitchen probably needs is a refrigerator. And whoa, wait, there is a lot of refrigerators. Uh, guys, which refrigerator should I use? There's three of them. Uh, I don't know. Pick one that looks the best, I guess. Uh, they all look pretty good. I don't know which one to use. And you know what? I'm just going to go ahead and use all of them. Whoa, there we go. Triple fridges, baby. Wait, your base has three fridges? And yeah, I know. It's pretty epic. I got three fridges. I've got the, uh, the what does that say? Channel electric. And then I've got the Raz. And then uh, this one doesn't have a name over here. Yeah, I feel like you just made those up. I didn't make those up. They literally says on the fridge. It's their names, okay? Sure, buddy. Whatever you say. But uh, there's no way you're going to beat my base. It's already coming together super nicely. And oh my gosh. All right. Well, I'm excited to see what your base looks like at the end. But anyways, here, I think the next thing I need to add is some countertops. So here, let me go ahead and grab some of these light blue countertops. Yeah, these ones look pretty good. And I'll just go ahead and add a bunch of these over here. And wait, I'm pretty sure I can also go ahead and grab a kitchen sink. So let me do that really quick. And boom, there we go. My kitchen is starting to look so sick. Uh, you guys are building so fast. I'm still working on my floor. What? You're still working on your floor? Like, uh, on which room? Just the main one? Uh, yeah. You guys have multiple rooms already? Uh, yeah, multiple rooms. I have whole buildings in my base. What in the world? Uh, I have to go faster. Yeah, guys, I'm not sure when that TNT is going to explode, but uh, we definitely got to be quick. And ooh, wait, hold on. What is this? Uh, this sign actually looks pretty cool. Can I go ahead and put it over here? And oh, wait, this looks sick. Can I put text on it? And what? I can't even customize the sign. Wait, hold on. Is there another one that I can customize? And wait a minute. There's one called Sign Baker. I'm pretty sure this is going to do good for the kitchen. And yeah, I guess I'll just put that there since it's got like bread on it. So there we go. I guess that's the sign for the kitchen. But anyways, now let me go ahead and put a table down over here just like that. And here, let me also go ahead and find some good chairs for it and uh okay these ones look pretty good and i'll just go ahead and put these chairs around the table so that people can like sit around while they eat uh well i think i finished my first room jeez and i'm almost done with my first skyscraper i mean uh don't worry about what i just said uh, skyscraper <laughs> why do you have skyscrapers in your uh bunker that sounds uh interesting uh, i told you i'm gonna have the best base ever and stop listening to the words i say D just don't pay attention to them what you're the one who's saying that but anyways here i guess it's time for me to go ahead and stock up all of my three refrigerators so let me just go ahead and fill all of these up with some steak. Let's go because steak is like the best food ever. So let me put them all in here. And now I'm working on the roof of my first floor. And wait a minute. Actually, I've got a pretty good idea for what I can do in my kitchen. So, you know, uh, if you're hungry inside of a bunker, you can run to the kitchen and go inside of the fridge and grab food, right? But that's like super slow. That takes what, like 10 seconds? Uh, yeah, I guess so. Uh, where are you going with this? Well, what about instead of manually going into the fridge and, you know, taking out your food and eating it, there's a dispenser that automatically gives you food whenever you walk into the room. Oh, that actually sounds pretty good, uh, but I think I'm just gonna go with uh, the tried and true. Uh, I'm just gonna have chefs in my base. Wait, what? Chefs? Where are you gonna get chefs from? I I'm gonna hire them, of course. Uh, okay, that sounds interesting, but here, I'm, I'm too broke for chefs, so I'm just gonna go ahead and have, like, a system that drops me food whenever I walk into this room. Yeah, that sounds like a really smart plan. Oh, I don't know what I'm doing for food. Yeah, it's gonna be super epic, but here, I need to go ahead and put some redstone beneath all of these pressure plates, and wait, does the redstone activate now and okay perfect it does and now i just need a way to connect this redstone to those dispensers up there um i guess i can just make it go around over here like this and oh gosh oh gosh i forgot about the water walls you know what i'll just add this water later it's gonna be annoying while i'm trying to put my redstone down let me just go ahead and do the command slash slash drain and boom there we go now all of the water should be gone um, i'll add the water walls later but anyways now i need to go ahead and connect all of these dispensers with some redstone and oh gosh wait it's actually gonna be kind of tough how am i supposed to do this i don't have that much room and wait a minute. I'm pretty sure if I grab an oak leaf block, I can put it over here. And perfect. Check that out. Look, the redstone can go through the
the oak leaf block and wait, hold on. Is this working? Okay, I have no idea if this is working, but let me go ahead and test it out really quick. Let me go ahead and put some steak inside of this dispenser for testing purposes. And is it gonna work? <gasps> oh my gosh, did you see that? The steak came out. That is so awesome. I honestly was not expecting that to work. Wow, everybody's so amazed that you have a uh, steak coming out of a fridge. Okay, okay. Well, first of all, it's not a fridge, it's a dispenser. And what do you mean? This is so epic. I can literally just walk inside of my room and get free steak. But, anyways, here, I need to make this a little bit more polished now. So, I guess let me go ahead and fill in all of this stuff over here. And now I need to go ahead and add like a better variety of food in here. I can't just have steak. So, uh, the, what do people eat with steak usually? Um, it's bread, I guess. Do people eat bread with steak? Uh, I think so. Uh, I also think they eat, like, uh, potatoes and stuff like that. And, wait, actually, I'm pretty sure they eat uh, gingerbread houses, so I guess I'll put some of those inside of the dispensers. What? Gingerbread houses? What are you talking about? Uh, have you never been to a fancy steak restaurant before? Uh, they don't serve gingerbread houses with your steak. Uh, dude, they literally do all the time. I don't know what you're on about. I've never heard of that before. What? You guys have just never gone to, like, a fancy restaurant before. And, wait, I'm pretty sure another thing that they always serve with steak is uh, black hole apples. Yeah. Are you okay? What, what do you mean? Have you never seen a black hole apple before? It, it's such a common thing where I'm from. Not served with a steak. Uh, what are you even talking about? What, what do you mean? These things go perfect with steaks. You guys just have like a bad taste in food. But anyways, now whenever I walk over these dispensers, I get all of my food. Let's go. This is sick. Congratulations. You set up dispensers. Wow. I'm so proud of you. Uh, I'm building an entire awesome epic base now. And uh, I don't believe you. Can I come check it out? Uh, no, not yet. It's not finished. And okay. Okay. Whatever. Oh my gosh. When I place down this flower, all my crops go away. And wait. What? Why are you placing down flowers? Uh, because I want my underground base to look nice. Uh, yeah, my base looks nice too, but I, I don't need flowers for it. Well, flowers help with the oxygen levels, so clearly you don't know what you're talking about. And, oh, wait, that actually makes sense since, like, the flowers, like, suck up the CO2 and then, like, breathe out oxygen. I guess that kind of makes sense. Why do my crops keep going away? What in the world? Do you have water connected to them? Uh, yeah. Oh, uh, maybe you just gotta get better. Wait, your crops keep going away? Uh, are you sure you're, like, a, a good enough farmer? What? It has nothing to do with my farming ability. I'm the best farmer ever. Uh, your crops say otherwise. Hey. That's so not nice. But wait a minute. Building a farm actually sounds like a really good idea. If we're going to be down stuck in the bunkers for a long time, then we're definitely going to need like an actual source of food once the kitchen runs out. Yep, which is exactly why I'm building one. Well, anyway, speaking about building stuff, I'm actually going ahead and building my next room right now. And I'm building an armory room. This is going to be the best room I've ever built. Oh, yeah, an armory room. So original. I I've already built like three of them. What? Wait. Why do you need three armory rooms for it? Because uh, I said so. Okay, well, I'll have to see it to believe it. But here, I need to go ahead and finish clearing out this room. This armory room is going to be super clutch because then we'll have armor to defend against the blast. Oh, yeah, you're right. That makes a lot of sense. I'm going to start building one. Yeah, it's going to be super important. And wait a minute, guys. Hold on. I think I made it to Speaker Man's base again. I'm super curious what he's building. You know what? It's not, no harm is going to be done if I just take like a quick look at this. And Whoa, what the? Hey, what are you doing? You're getting you trespasser! Uh, what the, uh, the what in the world was that? It's none of your business. Stay out of my area! And, oh my gosh. Okay, uh, you don't have to be so aggressive about it. Jeez. Uh, what's going on, guys? What are you yelling about? And uh, I just accidentally, uh, yeah, definitely accidentally uh, broke into Speaker Man's area, and he got like super mad at me and started like throwing something at me. And oh my gosh, Speaker Man, your wall is like too close to my base. Uh, you gotta move your wall in a little bit. I don't have enough room for my armory room. Uh, what are you talking about? I'm in my area. Yeah, but you're taking up way too much space. Look, I barely have enough room for my armory room. See, it's like not even like an even square. I need this to be at least like an even square right here, the floor. Well, that's not my problem. I'm in my designated area. You gotta figure it out. And, uh, okay, hold on. I think I have a solution. Let me just go ahead and do slash slash move five. Boom, there we go. Alright, I think this should be good. Hey, what are you doing? Get out of here! This is my base! Uh, dude, I told you you were crossing the line. You are uh, getting way too close to my base. Look, I need the extra room. Uh, no, I wasn't crossing the line. Uh, let's go up to the surface and see. I'll show you that I'm on my side. And, uh, okay, sure. Yeah, let's check it out. Out. All right, come here. I want to show you that I'm on my line. Come here. And, uh, dude, your door literally sucks. I can't even go through it. Did you forget? Oh my gosh, just break it. I don't care. And Okay, I'm breaking it. That was a horrible door. All right, look, if I break this red, I'm, I'm on my line right here. If I break this, then I'm not. And uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, why don't you just go ahead and uh, can you move for a second? Let me just select that really quick and uh, go down here and select this and then slash slash move. Yeah, why don't, why don't we just do that? You know, that works. What the heck? No. All right, well, let's just do this. Let me grab my magic wand and I'll move you out of the arena. And, uh, Okay, 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 hold on, hold on. I'll go ahead and slash slash undo it, but um, how about you just let me on your land? You know, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, fine, you know what I think about your armory? Just follow me and I'll show you exactly what I think about it. Right, let's just grab this and goodbye to it all. Hey, stop, stop, stop. Whoa, 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 wh
wait, dude, you just damaged my kitchen a little bit. What was that for? You damaged my base. Now stay out. And, oh my gosh. Fine, fine. You didn't have to pull a rocket launcher out. And oh my gosh, you just blew so much stuff up. I warned you multiple times. You still didn't listen. And, oh my gosh. All right, fine, fine, fine. I'm sorry for trespassing on your base. I guess I'll just uh, build a smaller armory room. But here, I got to repair my kitchen now since you blew it up. Jeez, why are you guys so loud? What's going on? And uh, Speaker Man just took a rocket launcher to my bunker. Uh, why did you do that? Uh, because he was in my area and I warned him that if he didn't leave, then I would do it. And he didn't leave. Why you did not give me a warning? You literally just pulled it out and, and just started going at it. Does that sound like me? No, it doesn't. You're just making up excuses. What the? That's literally what you did. But you know what? Fine. I guess I'll just go ahead and build my armory room on this side of my thing. So I don't have to worry about like going on your land or anything. Good. I hate trespassers. Uh, why did you just change your voice? What do you mean? I need to change my voice. And, oh, wait, why do you sound like that now? Uh, you just sound completely different now. Uh, what are you guys talking about? I think your guys are going crazy. Uh, oh, dude, you literally just put on like a deeper voice to sound scary or something. What? No, I didn't. You guys are just going crazy. I think you guys need to go to a hospital. Uh, I think he finally lost it. He's cuckoo bonkers. And, oh, what the? Yeah, maybe. But anyways, here, let me go ahead and clear out a little bit more room for my armory area. This is going to be the best armory room ever. Now that I've got like as much space as I want. Well, I'm getting started on the kitchen finally. And oh, wait, you're getting started on your kitchen? Let's go. What are you going to build? Are you going to build like a dispenser thing that gives you food whenever you walk in like me? Uh, no. Why would I do that? That sounds dumb. And, what? No, it's going to be faster, all right? Uh, it's going to be super good and epic. And wait a minute. Actually, I got a really good idea for my armory room. I guess I'll go ahead and use some of this purple reinforced concrete for my armory room because I'm going to make this area look like super epic and like battle-y. Battle-y? That's not a word. I need to like learn a dictionary. Uh, dude, that is definitely a word. Uh, if it's not a word, then I just invented it right now. You can't invent words. That's not how they work. Yeah, I can. Who's stopping me? Uh, me. I said so. Uh, speaker woman, uh, what do you think of the word battle-y? Uh, do you think it should be a word or not? Of course not. What? Not? Come on. I need at least one other person to agree with me. Then we can officially make it a word. Uh, well, you have two people disagreeing with you right now, and we're the only two people here. Uh, actually, uh, no, you're not. I've actually got my, uh, friend Bob. Uh, he actually agrees with me. Let me just go ahead and, uh, grab him really quick. Bob? Wait, hold on. Who's this Bob guy? Uh, just come to my bunker, you know? In fact, uh, we got Bob, we got Jim, we got, uh, uh, Trevor, we got Michael, we, we got all the guys. And they all agreed to make it an official word, so, uh, yeah, you can just come see for yourself. Alright, I'm coming to see what's going on here, and oh my gosh, your base is so purple. And wait, uh, dude, are you kidding me? Oh, what? These are my friends, and, you know, they agree to make it an official word. You look so crazy right now. You have a room full of armor stands with Steve heads on them. And, uh, okay, well, first of all, this is my armory room, so I guess it kind of makes sense. But, uh, d d these are not armor stands. These are, uh, these are people. Uh, sure. Uh, I'm going to schedule you an appointment with a doctor. What? Okay, dude, I was just joking, but all right, let me go ahead and break these and actually put down my real armor stands. And, uh, my kitchen is finished. Oh, let's go. You finished your kitchen. Well, uh, what does it have? Does it have any cool features like, uh, you know, like my dispenser thing? Well, it has an oven and a microwave, you know, all the necessary kitchen stuff. And, oh, wait, I should probably add a microwave oven and like a, an oven to my thing as well. That's a good idea. You don't have one already? Uh, uh no, I, I definitely have one. It's, uh, right over here. Yeah, yeah, I've got one. That sounds like the voice of someone who's lying. What? No, what do you mean? I literally have both of those things and, whoa, wait, what the, what is going on with my fridges? I, Guys, I think my fridges are turning into ghosts. They're, like, t changing colors every two seconds. Uh, what are you talking about? Color-changing fridges? Uh, yeah, dude, I don't know what's going on. I guess they're, uh, like, malfunctioning or something. But anyways, back to the armory room. I've got a super cool idea for what I can do here. I'm gonna go ahead and grab some lava, and I'm just gonna go ahead and put, like, a little lava thingy in each corner. This is gonna look so sick. Okay, I'm getting started on the bathroom. And, oh, wait, a bathroom. That actually sounds like a really good idea. I definitely need to build one of those soon, because otherwise it would not be good. Yeah, I would feel sorry for you if you were staying in a bunker without a bathroom? Uh, yeah, bathrooms are totally inessential. Wait, were you thinking you of not placing down a bathroom dash? What? I, I wasn't, like, not thinking of it. I, I just forgot. Uh, how do you forget about uh, the bathroom? Uh, when was the last time you showered? Uh, I don't know, like a few months ago, maybe? Dude, that is not okay. What? That is perfectly normal. I don't know what you're on about. Uh, I don't know who told you that, but they're completely wrong. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was my doctor who told me that, and, you know, he knows everything. Wait, who's your doctor if they tell you you should bath only once a month? And, uh, honestly, I don't know his name. I just, like, meet him for appointments every, like, few months, like, on the side of the street. Uh, yeah, then that's not your doctor. Uh, you need serious help. <laughs> okay, okay, I was just kidding. Uh, last time I showered was, like, a week ago, but here, I need to go ahead and actually put some armor on my Jesus, armor stand. Jesus, you stink, then. What? Oh, my gosh. All right, well, here, let me go ahead and actually put some armor on my armor stands. Let me see. What could I use? And Okay, wait, this shadow armor 
armor looks pretty cool, but it's pretty purple. And, you know, I think I already have enough purple stuff. And Whoa, wait, there's a lot of cool stuff down here. What the? Whoa, wait, check this out. There's something called Power Armor Mark II. Okay, I'm definitely going with this. This stuff looks sick. I need to start working on my armory next. Oh, my gosh. And, yeah, an armory room is definitely important. This armor is going to be super helpful in surviving against the blast in case anything goes wrong. Yep, I already did my armory, so I'm good. I'm almost done as well. I just need to go ahead and find a weapon to use. And, whoa, there are so many different types. Wait, hold on. I'm feeling like an axe today. Let's see. Should I use an axe? Wait a minute. Actually, I don't need an axe. I'm going to use a chainsaw. Yeah, this thing looks good. What the heck? What? What's wrong with a chainsaw? That is so perfect. I'm pretty sure I need to grab a fuel tank for this thing as well. Let me go ahead and grab that. What the? Why do you need a weapon for? You're going to fight the TNT with your chainsaw? Uh, oh, yeah, right. I forgot. I thought it was a build to survive against like a normal mob. I forgot that we're, uh, you know, fighting a TNT. All right. Well, I guess I don't need the chainsaw. I'm sorry, Mr. Chainsaw. I, I, I'm going to miss you. But wait, if I don't have a weapon, hmm, what should I put inside of my chest over here? Let me think. And I guess I can just go ahead and put in like a bunch of enchanted golden apples and some like more crazy apples. I'll grab some of these enchanted emerald apples. Uh, wait, what in the world is a forbidden apple? Uh, I don't know. And you probably shouldn't find out if it says it's forbidden. Uh, wait, speaker woman. Uh, do you want to eat an apple? It's uh, really nice and good. Oh, an apple? Sure, I love apples. And Yeah, yeah, it's really good here. I'm gonna come over to your house and uh, deliver it. Okay, sounds good. And all right, all right, here. I really want to see what this apple is gonna do. It's literally called the forbidden apple. And oh, wait, hold on. I forgot speaker woman's door is in the back. So let me go around here. And all right, all right, I'm coming in. Oh, wait, this is my first time checking out your bunker as well. Hey, no, you don't get to see down until later. And oh, uh, okay. All right, well, where's the apple? And oh, uh, all right, there you go. There's the apple. It's uh, just a normal apple. It's really good. Wait, why does it have an F on it? And oh, oh, uh, it, that stands for fantastic. Yeah, it's a really fantastic apple. Huh. Okay, makes sense. Let me try. Ah! Oh, wait, what what the the Are you okay? Ah! Ah! I can't see anything. Oh, the world's going sideways. Uh, what is the world? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Uh, you should not have eaten that apple. Uh, what the? What is wrong with you? You're so mean. I just wanted to see what it was going to do. What in the Oh, my gosh. Why are you so fast? Uh, my hunger's gone, and I'm taking damage, and I feel nauseous. Oh, ah! no. And, uh, oh, wait, oh, what the? Did you just explode? And, whoa, what the? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> and uh, what in the world just happened? Uh, okay, that was definitely an interesting apple. Oh, my gosh. <sighs> I'm fine. And, Thank uh, goodness. Wait, you are? Okay, well, I'm glad you respawned, but what in the world? Okay, uh, I guess we shouldn't eat those apples anymore. Oh, my gosh, that explosion did so much damage when you blew up. Uh, Dash, did you give her one of the apples? And, uh, yeah, I wanted to see what it was going to do. Uh, yeah, that was probably a bad idea. And, uh, yeah, I guess we learned our lessons, but I'm glad we tested it. Now we know that it's not good. Oh my gosh, speaker one, when you exploded, it even did some damage over here to my bunker. Okay, that was a the very interesting explosion. It did so much damage to mine. Oh. And oh gosh, uh, I'm sorry for giving you that apple. Yeah, well, at least we know it's not blast proof. And, oh gosh, you're right. Yeah, that just served as an experiment. Now we know our bunkers aren't blast proof. Since that little apple explosion uh, kind of blew up my bunker. Okay, we gotta do some serious upgrades to our bunkers if we can't survive a little apple explosion. Yeah, I think I'm gonna make my walls bedrock instead of water and yeah that's a great idea putting like a border of bedrock around the walls instead of water okay i think i'm gonna do that as well except i'm gonna do it when i'm done building my bunker that way i can like build all my hallways and all my extra rooms that i need right now and then i can just like surround everything with bedrock later but anyways now that i have my armory area done what should i build next let me think and wait a minute i think i got a really good idea what's your idea i'm gonna go ahead and build an observation room i, I guess that's what i'll call it here let me go ahead and grab some cameras really quick and pretty much what I'm gonna do is go ahead and put some cameras out over here just like this. And then let me go ahead and link these up to my monitor really quick just like that. And now let me go down back into the bunker. And pretty much what I can do with these is see exactly what's going on and when the TNT is gonna explode. Oh, I'm already two steps ahead of you then. And wait, why do I already have cameras as well? Okay, well, uh, at least I'm building them now myself. But yeah, there's gonna be really OP. And in fact, I don't even need like a whole room for this. I'll just go ahead and have like an item frame. And I'll just go ahead and put the camera monitor right over there with a sign above it saying outside world view there we go now we can always check up on the tnt if we need to uh, i'm placing down the bedrock walls right now and oh yeah that's a good idea but wait don't you think it'd be a better idea to you know do it at the end because uh that's when everything's gonna be done and like what if you want to build a new hallway or something uh well my base is already surrounded by water so i pretty much limited it from the start and oh yeah fair enough all right but anyways i just realized the next thing that i need to build is like a little living quarters area because uh like what if we end up having to stay in this bunker for a long time we're gonna need, like, some place to rest and sleep. Yeah, that's a good point. I need to make that, too. You guys are far behind me. What, the, what are you?
you building, Speaker Man? We haven't even taken like a good look at your base. I kind of like saw like sneak peeks, but uh, what did you like actually build? Uh, it's none of your business what I actually build. Stay out of it. All right, whatever. Well, Tier, let me go ahead and clear out a little area over here, and I'm just gonna go ahead and put down like a bunch of bunk beds. This is gonna be my sleeping area. And done. I finally finished with the bedrock. Jeez. And oh, you did. Let's go. Well, I guess it took a while, but it's gonna be super worth it since now none of the TNT can get through your thing. Hopefully. And boom, the bank is ready. I'm gonna have a full blown currency system down here. And, uh, <laughs> Wait, what? You're building a bank? Uh, that sounds interesting. Why do you need to build a bank in a survival bunker? Uh, because it's not just me in this bunker. I'm building a whole civilization. What the? You're building like a whole city down there, it seems. Uh, I'm not telling you what I'm doing. Stay out of it. Oh my gosh, whatever. I didn't even ask anyways. But here, I guess let me just go ahead and finish up all of the walls for my living quarters area. This area is going to be so sick. And boom, there we go. All the walls are done. And now let me go ahead and grab some beds. And ooh, wait, hold on. There's a lot of different types of beds. I thought there was only like one type. Whoa, wait, okay. Actually, wait, is there such thing as a bunk bed already that's like pre-made so I don't have to build my own? And oh, wait, there is, except, uh, wait, what in the world? Why is it so small? Okay, I think that's for like babies. All right, now I'm starting to set up my living area. And oh, wait, hold on. I think I found a good bed and okay, yeah, I guess this one works, but wait, can I stack these on top of each other? And oh, wait, I can. I'll, well, uh, I don't think that's gonna make a good bunk bed. Let me try going one block higher and okay, there we go. Now that looks more like a bunk bed. And here, I guess let me go ahead and also grab some walls really quick. And I'm just gonna go ahead and place those over there just to make this area look a little bit nicer and let's go so far this area is looking sick yeah but it's gonna be nothing compared to my base i'm so excited and what you really think you can build a better living quarters than me there's no way i've got like the coolest beds you've ever seen probably no way mine is going to be awesome and actually i just made my living quarters bam there we go this is so awesome and, look, how are you building so much faster than us i, I have a magic wand of course and uh, yeah so do we i've literally got it in my hand right now but i still can't build that fast uh, maybe just get better i guess i don't know what to tell you and, oh my gosh whatever well, anyways, here, I guess let me go ahead and finish stacking all of these beds on top of each other. And now I can go ahead and put down the walls just like that. And wait, is there water on top of my house? Where is this water coming from? Uh, I guess let me just go ahead and slash slash drain this. Wait, that was my water you just drained. Undo, undo. And wait, undo? Uh, okay, but wait, I thought you got rid of your water. Didn't you put bedrock? Uh, yeah, I have water and bedrock. And, whoa, wait, that sounds pretty cool. But wait, I didn't know your house was this close. Can I come take a look? And uh, wait, I think I'm underneath your bunker right now. Uh, yeah, I think you are. But... <gasps> wait, that gives me an idea. Do you want to connect our bunkers? And, oh, wait a minute. Connect our bunker. Okay, that sounds like a banger idea. Uh, yeah, we should definitely do that. That way, if one of the bunkers gets, like, uh, I don't know, breached and uh, the TNT makes its way in, we can just run to the other person's bunker. Uh, I think that's a great idea. Wait, Speaker Man, do you want to connect it as well? And, yeah, that would be awesome. I'm pretty sure you have, like, the biggest bunker of all. Uh, no, no way ever. And, uh, wait, what? why not? It's going to be a good idea because that way, if one of the bunkers goes down, we can just go to the other person's. I said no. And, okay, fine. Fine, I guess I'll just connect my bunker to Speaker Rowan. Yeah, geez, all right. And all right, up here, Speaker Rowan, I'm gonna start connecting my bunker to yours right now. I'll start digging over a tunnel heading to your base. Okay, sounds good. I'll start digging towards you as well. All right, sounds good. And whoa, wait, there's like so many random holes over here while I'm digging this tunnel. I'm pretty sure this was from that explosion when you ate the apple. Yeah, that would make sense. All right, well, anyways, I think I've dug far out enough here. Let me try digging up now. Am I underneath your base right now? And oh, wait, hold on. I need to go up. Come on. And oh, wait, I think I went a little bit too far. I think there's where the explosion was. And uh, yeah, wait. Wait, hold on. I need to dig a little bit less. Oh, yeah. I think you went way too far. Just put a ladder next to your wall. And, uh, okay. Wait, you mean, like, over here? Yeah, I see your name tag. That should be good. And, oh, okay. I guess I didn't have to dig, like, a tunnel or anything. Uh, I guess let me go ahead and start putting up the ladders just like this. And, all right, here. I guess let me start digging up first. Let's see. And, uh, wait, hold on. Am I here? Oh, wait, I made it. Uh, all right. I guess should I just dig up? Hi! And, oh, wait, here I am. Hello there. And, whoa, wait, your base looks sick. Oh, uh, yeah. Welcome to my bunker. It's pretty awesome. Oh, yeah. I see. You've got the bedrock and the water. That actually looks so cool. And you even got glass so, like, you can see everything. Oh, yeah. Let me show you around. So, here's my armory. The armor stand's got a little bit moved by the explosion. And, whoa, yeah. That explosion was no joke. Oh, yeah. And if that explosion hadn't happened, then my crops would still be here. And, oh, yeah. But this looks pretty nice. And if you go right here, here's the bathroom. And, oh, wait. This is a pretty nice looking bathroom. And, wait, hold on. Does this light switch actually work? And, oh, wait. It does. That's so sick. Yep. Don't mess with it. You're gonna ruin the electricity in the house. I uh, was, uh, no, I'm not. Hey, stop! And, okay, 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 fine, fine, fine. Okay, well, what else do you have? Okay, so this is the kitchen. And, whoa, this area looks sick. And <gasps> wait, is that a jar of cookies? Can I have one? You can have one. Just one. And wait, I can't. Let's go. And wait, you can actually take stuff out of it. Oh, uh, I may have taken a little bit more than I intended. <laughs> I told you only to take one. And, okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry about that. Anyways, I'm gonna go ahead and finish building this ladder. Let me just go ahead. Hey, and wait. The tour isn't over. 
<laughs> and, uh, wait, you still have more? Yep. Uh, and, oh, fix wait. this. So yeah, why is in the middle of my floor? Where else am I going to put the ladder? Ugh, just move it a block over or something. Uh, okay. And, whoa, wait, what's this room? This is my bedroom. And, whoa, wait, this area looks sick. Whoa, wait, this is actually a pretty cool bed you've got here. I've got, like, bunk beds. Mine are a little bit cooler, I'm not going to lie. But, yeah, this is pretty nice. Yep, it's the best I know. I have the best base ever. But, uh, yeah, just move down to your ladder. Uh, wait, wait, what in the world is this thing over here? Uh, that's a bee, clearly. That is not a bee. It, it looks like a bat with, like, a banana on top of it. What in the world? Uh, no, it's a bee. Uh, okay, yeah, whatever you say. <gasps> There's another light switch. I'm, uh, I'm gonna take one of these for my house. But, yeah, all right, I'm gonna finish building this ladder. Okay, have fun. All right, here, let me go ahead and put down all of these ladder blocks over here. And I'm just gonna put some temporary blocks over here as dirt for now. And hold on, I need to get rid of all this water. This water is in the way. Let me just clear it out with these blocks over here, just like this. And, okay, there we go. The water is all gone. And here, now let me just go ahead and put down these ladders over here, just like this. That and boom, there we go. Now our bases are connected. Uh, wait, speaker one, where do you go? Uh, I'm fixing my armory. And oh, all right. Well, uh, yeah, I'm just here to tell you our bases are connected. Although you might want to move your door. Uh, it's kind of like uh, right in front of the ladder. Uh, no, you should move your ladder. Boom. Uh, oh, but there's like two ladders down here, and oh my gosh. Okay, you just wanted to make it one. Okay, whatever. I guess I can break the other one. Yep, this is much better like this. Okay, okay, whatever you say. Well, here, let me go ahead and fill this in just like this. And anyways, I gotta get back to building my like living quarters area. I've already got some beds over here, but what else does a living quarters need? Oh, wait, I guess I need some entertainment over here, right? Since, you know, it's like the living quarters, so I guess I could use some entertainment. Here, let me go ahead and grab a little table, and I can put a TV on it. And boom, there we go. My living area is complete. And oh, wait, you finished your living area as well? I'm building my living area right now. Now, what did you build in it? I, I, I need some ideas desperately. I have a gaming area. I have a place where I can see all my cameras. I have a kitchen. I have uh, a place to read books. And then I have a place where I can sleep. And, whoa, wait, that is so many areas. You have a gaming area? Wait, that sounds sick. I need to go ahead and do that as well. Let me grab a chair really quick. And, oh, wait, there's like office chairs. This will be perfect. Let me put these over here. And I guess we can go ahead and grab one of these computers and just hook that up to the TV just like that. There we go. And boom, there we go. Now I got a gaming area as well. But I still got to build some some other stuff. You said you had a library, right? For like reading books. Yeah, I do. In case it gets, uh, you know, boring in here. I have every single book in the world ever. And whoa, wait, that is awesome. Okay. I need to do that as well. Books are super OP. And whoa, wait, there's like some fancy looking bookshelves. Okay. I'm definitely going to go ahead and put a few of these ones down as well. And wait, I guess I can go ahead and put down some of these book. Like, wait, what? These are both like bookshelves. These are just like a different style. I guess I can put some of these on the walls as well. And wait, hold on. I also need to go ahead and put down this light switch that I stole from speaker woman. There we go. Now I can flick this all day long. Let's go. Wait. Wait, wait, you sold what now? Uh, uh, nothing, nothing. I didn't steal anything. But here, let me put this last bookshelf down over here. I need to break the other one to make room. And okay, that looks pretty good. Let me just put these down. And boom, there we go. My reading area is complete. Actually, I should probably go ahead and add a couch for like sitting down while reading. And now let me put down a table right over here in the middle. And boom, there we go. Now the reading area is officially complete. This area looks sick. And boom, there we go. Uh, my house is actually almost complete. And wait, it is. Same here almost. I just need to add a few more things. And the next thing that I need to add is like a utility room. I'm gonna go ahead and put down an enchantment table, a brewing stand, furnaces, everything that I need. So let me do that here. Yep, I just need to continue working on my flooring. All right, all right. Well, anyways, here, let me go ahead and clear out some more room over here. This utilities room is gonna be so sick. It's gonna be the best utility room you've ever seen. But here, let me go ahead and clear out some space for it first. And hmm, what should I build the walls in this room out of? Uh, let me see. What's a good block that I could use? And oh wait, I guess I can use some stone bricks. That could be pretty cool. Let me just select all of these positions and then do slash slash walls, stone bricks, and boom, there we go. That looks pretty good. And wait, I need to do the floor and ceiling as well. And here, let me go ahead and open this up really quick. And boom, there we go. This is the base of my utility room. Although it kind of looks like a prison right now because of like the super the harsh looking stone brick walls, but it's fine. It's going to look better once I've got everything done. So here, let me put the enchantment area first. Let me just go ahead and clear out a little area over here because I kind of want to build it inside of the wall. I think that's going to look super sick. That'll leave me with more room to build like other stuff like furnaces and stuff in the middle of the room. But anyways, here, now let me put down all of the bookshelves. Let me go ahead and put some there as well. And I guess I'll put some on the roof as well, just to make it look nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna add some flower pots to some cute little flowers. Let's go. And anyways, my enchantment room is pretty much done. I'm just gonna add one more thing. I'm gonna go ahead and put down a dispenser over here on the floor with a button. And then I'm gonna fill it up with a bunch of lapis because guys, uh, remember you need lapis for enchanting. So uh, don't forget that or else you won't be able to enchant it. Wait, I should also go ahead and grab a barrel really quick and I'll just put that over here. And I'm just gonna fill this up with a bunch of enchantment bottles. This is going to give us a bunch of levels. Anyways, the next thing I should probably build inside of this utilities room is like a brewing stand area. So let me go ahead and make another indent in the 
the wall for that over here. Oh, a burning room actually might be pretty good. I might use that. And wait, what? No, you can't use it. You didn't even connect your house to mine. Yeah, but you stole my idea with the bedrock walls. Uh, no, I didn't. I built my walls out of reinforced obsidian, not bedrock. Uh, do you not remember earlier when you said you were going to, you know, like put a giant bedrock wall around your uh, bunker? Oh, yeah, yeah. Actually, I remember, but I didn't steal that idea from you. I stole it from Speaker Woman, so, uh... Well, I had the idea first, and I've had my base built the longest. Wait, hold on. Didn't you just say you came up with the idea? That was completely my idea. Uh, what? No, I came up with the idea. Come check out my base. I've had it built for the longest time. Ugh, okay, I'm coming. Uh, wait, no, I didn't mean it. I stay out. Nope, I'm coming. Uh, no, 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 no. I, don't. It's not ready yet. And, uh, wait, wait, hold on. If she's seeing your base, can I see it as well? No, no, no one's seeing my base yet. I'm at your door. And, yeah, speaker, no, and we're about to break away. in. You better get ready. I'm coming in. No. No. And, uh, wait, what? did I just get teleported back to my... What the... Yes, I teleported you both back to your bases. It's not ready yet. I'll show you once it's finished. Okay, whatever. I guess I'll just go back to building my brewing room here. Let me go ahead and grab some of the necessary brewing materials that we need. Uh, what do we need? Blaze rods, I guess that's one of them. Blaze powder, definitely. And oh, wait, we also need to get magma cream. I'm pretty sure that's important. And oh, wait, we also need carrots. Uh, that's like an important material, right? Or golden carrots. Yeah, that's the important one. And let me just go ahead and stack up all of these chests with them. Here we go. I'll put the blaze powder and blaze rods inside of this chest. And I'm pretty sure some of the other things I need are some of these glistering melons and some redstone and some gunpowder. And I think there's like every single brewing material that's ever used in brewing. Wait, what about nether warts? You forgot those. And actually, I did not forget those. I was just about to get to them for the nether warts. I'm going to go ahead and build my own little nether wart farm so that I can just make them myself and never run out. Okay, I'll give it to you. That's actually a pretty good idea. And yeah, yeah, I know. It's a great idea. Let me grab some doors really quick. And I'm just going to have like a little separated area for my nether wart farm. Let me go ahead and just make this look nice really quick. There we go. And yeah, there's just gonna be my epic underground nether wart farm. And boom, I just put a bunch of flowers in my base. This looks so cute. And wait, you put even more flowers in your base? I thought you already had some. Uh, yeah, but now they're gonna be in flower pots. Oh, oh, I see. Uh, that's cool, I guess. But here, I'm putting down all of my nether warts right now. This nether wart farm looks sick. But anyways, what other utilities do I need to build here? And oh yeah, right, right, right. Hold on. I need to build a furnace room. Let me go ahead and grab like one of every single type of furnace. Let me grab a normal one and a blast furnace. And wait, hold on. I also need to go ahead and grab a smoker there we go for cooking food and wait what in the world is this thing over here wait another blast furnace okay don't mind if i do this thing looks sick i don't even know how this thing works but i'm gonna go ahead and put this in my furnace area and here now let me go ahead and start putting down my furnaces i'm just gonna go ahead and put down one row with each furnace this is gonna be so awesome and efficient there we go and now over here on the other side of the room i'm gonna go ahead and put down some barrels and fill them all up with some coal so that i never run out of fuel and oh wait here i'll also go ahead and put down some piles of coal on the floor just to make it look cool uh, since when were piles of coal cool. Uh, what, what do you mean? Piles of coal are so awesome. You can do so much with uh, coal. You can, like, put it in your furnace, and you can, like, uh, burn it for fires. That doesn't sound very cool to me. What do you mean? Coal is awesome. It's my favorite, uh, the food. What? I, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But anyways, I think my utility room is done now. Let's go. And boom. There we go. The guest house is done. And you know what, guys? I think I'm finally ready to connect to you guys. And, wait, what? You have a guest house? And wait, you want to connect to our bases? Wait, finally. I've been waiting for this moment. And yeah, wait. We've been waiting to see what's inside out of your bunker. You sounded like you have so much cool stuff, but we barely took a look. Well, I'm ready now. And here, Dash, I'll start bridging over to your and, house. Oh, you are perfect. Let's go. All right, here, I'll start digging over as well. I'm pretty sure I just have to break a few blocks. And yeah, I'm already here. And whoa. Oh my God. Gosh, wait, this area is insane. Yeah, this is my underground city, and oh, I forgot the most important thing. I gotta make a ladder, actually, to get down here. What in the world? Oh my gosh, that is amazing! How in the world did you have time for this? Uh, because I'm epic and awesome. Just take a look at how cool this is. Oh my gosh, wait, hold on. You gotta give us a tour right now. This stuff looks crazy. All right, well, I guess we should start at the top, because that's where, uh, you know, the beginning is. And, uh, okay, and wait, hold on. Can I go through this door now? Did you fix it? And oh, I still cannot go through this door. Uh, I don't know why it's broken for you guys. Uh, it doesn't matter. All right, well, after the ladder's built, there's going to be a ladder going all the way down. And uh, here you are introduced to the guest houses. And, whoa, wait a minute. And wait, why is it purple and pink? <gasps> is this for us? Uh, this purple guest house is for you. Uh, everything in here is for just you, Dash. Whoa, let's go. This is oh, awesome. This and is so sweet. This is actually sick! And wait, hold on. There's only one bed. Let me go ahead and fix that really quick. And oh, wait, you can't put another one next to it. Yeah, it's broken. I tried. Well, let's go see mine! Yeah, over here is the pink house or, uh, you yeah, know, Speaker Woman's guest house. Whoa, this looks Whoa, awesome! This is amazing! And wait, wait, why does 
she get too bad? Uh, because it's not connected to the wall, and you, there's still a block missing. I don't know what's going on. It's it's broken. Well, wait, hold on. You gotta show us the rest of these buildings. You have like a whole city going on down here. Like, look, they even have like big signs on them and stuff. This looks awesome. Yeah, this is actually super awesome. And here is a uh, my guest house, but uh, it's not finished yet. It's a work in progress. Wait, why do you need a guest house? I, I was bored. I needed to fill space, so I guess uh, I I just needed one. Uh, over here is the dark. Uh, dead. this is like where you want to go if you just want to relax. And, whoa, what the whoa. dark? Why is it called the dark? Oh, uh, because I said it's dark. And, uh, wait, what the? Why'd you just blind me? Um, uh, you didn't have to go that far, but uh, yeah, I guess it is pretty dark. Uh, this seems like an interesting room, although I'm not sure how it's gonna help us. Well, this is just for the city. Uh, here, drink your milk and come on, let's go explore the rest of the city. Oh, I want to go inside this. Uh, wait, then give me a second. Uh, this is the bank, and it's got a super awesome vault door made of complete gold. And, whoa, what the? That looks so cool. Oh my gosh, this thing is insane. Oh, yeah, uh, I'm just gonna grab. This. What are you doing? Leave my gold uh, alone! Stop uh, it! Okay, okay, okay. I didn't do anything. And, uh, wait, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, grab some of these as well. There we go. Thank you very much. What are you much. doing? Quit it! You're in creative. Just grab some. Stop breaking and, it. And uh, yeah, but it's like more fun that way. Uh, anyway, uh, let me close the door. And over here, uh, we have two ways to go. I, I guess we. I can show you the kitchen first. And, whoa, yeah, this looks sick. All right, well, uh, what sort of food you got here? Uh, I've got fish, and I've got bread, and I've got potatoes, and I've got a bunch of other stuff that could be grown, and I've got a bunch of different floors with a bunch of different things in them. And whoa, what? Uh, wait, how many fridges is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You've got more fridges than me. Uh, there's more up here. Yeah, well, why is there a bunch of fish in them? Uh, because fish are farmable, and I have a bunch of fish, so uh, nobody can get sick of it. And Oh, uh, I see. Fair enough. But wait, what other rooms do you have? I can't wait to see the rest of this little city. Oh, yeah. Let's keep heading down, and uh, I can show you where we actually get all the food. Whoa, the kitchen was awesome. Yep, and over here is the green room where everything is grown, and there's two floors to this epicness. And, whoa, you've got like a whole multi-floor farm over here. This is awesome. Yep, and I have uh, workers that uh, farm this and make it completely automatic. Oh, it's cool that you don't have to do anything because it's just automatic. Uh, yeah, and over here is another dark room. Uh, there's really nothing much in here. I, I was working on this whenever I finished. And wait, why do you like dark rooms so much? They seem kind of pointless. Well, I mean, I like to read books and the darkness helps. And, uh, how are you supposed to read books if you can't see the text? Well, it doesn't block out all the light, just some. I think that's bad for your eyes. Uh, and then this is a guest house for uh, someone random. Uh, if anyone wants to you know, like, come here and chill out and play some video games. I want it, I want it! Uh, no, it's not an entire house for you, it's for everybody. And yeah, I see you're You've already got your pink one over there. I want more. And of course, I get the best house ever. Uh, come here and check out this. This is the speaker home, only for me. Whoa, what? This isn't a home. There's like a whole tower over here. Oh my gosh, what do you have in here? Well, this here is uh, my camera observation room, and I can see every camera in my base ever at the same time. Oh my gosh, there's like a whole security room in here. Well, up here is my own personal kitchen. Check this out. I've got everything. Everything I could use here. Oh, this is awesome. And it's red, which goes with your colors. Yep, everything in here is red. And up here is my video game room in case I want to have friends over and play some video and, games. Whoa, yeah, you've got a lot of video game rooms. What the? Wait, what's on the next floor, though? There's still so many more floors to go in. Oh, wait, there's only two more. But whoa, wait, you got the book room. Let's go. Yeah, this is my reading room. I could just sit here and relax and read books. Ah, uh, well, that sounds very relaxing. But what's the last room? Oh, of course. We save the best for last. And this is my, uh, my, my bedroom. Why does that have two beds and no middle bed? Uh, because it's broken and it doesn't let me place it there, but uh, it's fine. Oh, well, this looks so cool. You even have a lava lamp. Yep, and this is the tallest building in the city. And whoa, yeah, this is actually awesome. And wait a minute, guys, since we all connected our bases now, that means we have like everything. Like you've got all of the houses and like living quarters over here. I've got all the utilities, like crafting tables, enchantment tables, armory rooms, all that. And Speaker Woman's got... Uh, flowers. Yes, flowers are great. Thank you very much. Yeah, but guys, there's actually one more thing I want to build. Oh, what's that? Oh, well, if you come over here, you see I have a bunch of clear space over here. Uh, yeah, wait, what are you gonna build here? Well, this is where I'm gonna build a giant airship so we can escape if, uh, you know, the TNT becomes too much. <gasps> oh my gosh, that is a great idea! That way we can have, like, a fully safe escape vehicle. Oh my gosh, okay, that is a great idea. We should definitely do that. Yep, I'll go ahead and start building. Uh, you guys can help if you want. And wait, wait, actually, I'll help under one condition. I can use purple concrete. Yeah, that works. We can all put our colors into and, it. Oh my gosh, let's go. There's gonna be the coolest looking airship ever. Yeah, I'm putting some pink stained glass. Wait, wait, wait. What about we ha all have our own separate areas? Like the the this could be red, and then Dash's part could be purple, and then you can build your pink part at the, at the end of the purple. Oh yeah. Well then, let's evenly split this. Thank you very much. I, uh, wait, what? Did you just break through my purple area? All right. Well, I guess in that case, I'll make my purple area a little bit chunkier. Hey, what are you doing? Come on, let's all make them even, guys, so nobody gets mad. Uh, let me see. We'll just all make them like this. And uh, stop. What? No, we can't make them even. Guys, I need the extra room. Uh, no, you don't. This is an airship.
ship, not a house. I need the extra room or else I'll explode. That's you won't. not your Stop stuff. It. Okay, okay, okay. Fine, fine, fine. Here, I guess let's go ahead and grab some glass. And wait, guys, instead of using normal glass, let's go ahead and use some reinforced glass. And speaking about reinforced blocks, let's use some reinforced concrete as well. Because remember, this is supposed to be like a super safe escape vessel. Oh, yeah, that actually sounds like a good idea. And yeah, we're literally going to be flying through a giant piece of TNT. And wait, uh, if you want your base to have more room, uh, just make it taller than ours. And oh, yeah, I guess that works. I'll go ahead and make my room the tallest one of them all. This is going to be awesome. Yeah, but you're going to take forever, so I guess I'll help out. And all right, all right, yeah, thanks here. Let's just go ahead and make this really nice and tall because I'm going to make it like a double decker. I'm going to put two floors on my room. And here, I think this should be tall enough. Let's go ahead and top it off with some purple concrete. Ugh, I can't believe that you're actually letting him have two floors. Whoa, what's wrong with two floors? I need the extra space, okay? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Yeah, it's going to be epic. This is going to be the first class seat of the airship. So here, let me put the second floor over here. And honestly, I might even have room for three floors. And uh, actually, no, I won't have room for three floors. I'm just going to have two really big floors. And here, let me go ahead and make a little staircase system just like this. And boom, there we go. Both my floors are done. This is awesome. Yeah, and there we go. Now we just have to place all the machinery down. Let me grab this and this and there we go. And, oh, wait, hold on. Let me go ahead and put one of these captain's chairs up here. Wait, guys, can I be the captain since I have like the highest chair? No, I'm going to be the captain because this is my base. And, okay, fine. I guess you can be the captain. I'm going to put some grass. I'm going to put some flowers on my side. Wait, what the? How is that going to be useful for the airship? That's just going to be additional weight. Hey, no, we need oxygen. And, oh, yeah, fair enough. But I guess the airship is done. Wait, we should probably have, like, a ladder so that we can actually get up to it. I guess let's make the entrance over here. Uh, wait, speaker woman, don't you need a chair? Oh, yeah, I need a chair. And Thank Oh, yeah, you. you're probably going to need a chair. That's a good idea. But anyways, here, let's go ahead and make a little ladder going over here on your wall. And then we can have, like, a little uh, terminal over here for actually getting on the airship. Let's go. And there we go. The airship is completely done. Let's go. This looks awesome. Oh, yeah. But, guys, I wonder how the TNT is doing. And, oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. Guys, we haven't checked on the TNT in a while. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. I'm heading back to my base. I got to check my cameras. Oh, yeah. I have cameras on my base. So I'm just going to check it here. Right, here, let me grab some. Oh, the speaker one just ran over my pressure. Oh, you got the food. Nice. Yep. And okay. Well, anyways, here, let me take a look through my cameras. And oh, my gosh. Uh, guys, I think it's about to explode. Oh, no. And, uh, wait, guys, I just got put into survival and I think my cameras blew up. I can't use my monitor anymore. What? Oh, gosh. All my cameras are gone, too. Oh, no. Everything is going dark. And, oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Uh, guys, I think it's time. Quick, everyone to their armory rooms. And uh, wait, speaker one, you don't have one. Uh, just come to my armory room. Oh, no. I don't have one. I'm on my way. And yeah, quick, 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 head over. Everyone, we need to grab all of our armor really quick. And here, let me go inside of my chest. And wait, I forgot to put stuff inside of my chest. Oh, my gosh. And oh, wait, you're here. Uh, well, yeah, just grab a set of armor. But it's fine. I've got other chests up here. Meet me at the kitchen. There's some food in here that could help us. Let's just go over this pressure plate. And look, we can grab some of these black hole apples and gingerbread houses. I told you it was going to be useful. We can't even eat the gingerbread houses. We just place them down. Yeah, but we can eat the apples. And oh, my gosh, they just gave me so many good effects. Uh, fair enough, I guess. Uh, yeah, here, let's go ahead and grab a bunch of stuff. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, uh, wait, speaker, oh what, what's gosh. going on? Wait, are you okay? No, my house blew up. And, uh, ah. wait, what? Did the explosion really get that far? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, guys, I think my living room just blew up. Oh, everything's destroyed. Uh, guys, we gotta go. It blew up my entire house. And, uh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Uh, guys, quick, I think we need to go over here and grab some stuff. Uh, Here, uh, do we need to smelt anything? Wait, everyone, let's go ahead and enchant our armor. Uh, wait, you can't even enchant this armor. And, uh, wait, what? You can't? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Okay, uh, well, I was just trying to be super safe, but I guess our armor is already good enough. Is there anything that anyone needs from this room? And, uh, wait, wait, speaker man. Uh, could I interest you in some nether warts, maybe? No, I don't care about your stupid nether warts. Uh, do you not see uh, what's wait, happening wait, right wait, now? Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, I think the explosion's getting closer. Uh, yeah, we need to get out of your base. It's compromised. I'm already out of here. Everybody head to the airship. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Yeah, you're right. I'm not sure how much longer we have until speaker man's base gets destroyed. And, oh, gosh, I think something just blew up behind me. And, guys, I think the explosion has reached the base. And, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, it's right there. All right, quick, everyone to the airship. We gotta get out of here. And, uh, oh, wait, uh, guys, there's literally a roof above us. How do we get rid of it? Don't worry, I set up a command block for and, that. Boom, there wait, we go. You did? Okay, perfect. Well, quick, everyone hop in your seats. I think the airship's ready to take off. Uh, speaker man, can you turn it on? Uh, yeah, I got it. Boom, and boom. There we go. All right, we can go now. And, oh, my gosh. Uh, guys, I think we're moving. Let's go. Let's go. We're taking off. Oh, my gosh. Let's go. We escaped. But, uh, wait, guys, we should probably check out how much damage happened to our bunkers. And wait, guys, the TNT didn't even fully blow up yet. Uh, yeah, it did. Look at that. And, oh, wait. I think it just fully blew up. Oh, my gosh. Whoa, look at all that damage. Oh, my gosh. Gosh, that was one big TNT. My bunker! And, uh, wait a minute, guys. I'm pretty sure some parts of the bunkers actually survived. Look, I can see some bedrock. And look, there's my armory room down there. Oh, let's go! Well, I guess that means we survived. Let's go! And, oh, my gosh. We actually did it. Let's go! That was pretty crazy. And if you want to watch the next video, then click on the video on the screen right now.